A wimp away, a wimp away, you know, I was, a wimp away. I was going to work this morning. <laughs> like that? No, not like this. I didn't have my hat on. And I even took it off to go to the petrol station. I'm only wearing this for the first hour. I've been forced to wear it. But I thought, what's the Hulk Hogan character in, in oh, Crocodile Dundee? I'm yeah. definitely not a Crocodile Dundee. <laughs> definitely not an Indiana Jones. So I've given myself a stage name just for the first hour. Okay. Serengeti Smith. So <laughs> I like it. What do you think? I think that could be like <laughs> a cartoon. It's ridiculous. Ever since you and I dressed up last year for our Halloween show, they, they insist that I dress up for these... <laughs> Ridiculous shows. But can I just say, bless you, because oh. Mark said to me, Elle, have you got anything jungly? I thought I... you'd have a, a full wardrobe of animal print, as it's so on trend and fashionable, but you don't. I've got know. one dress, right. and I did try and find said dress, but mm. I couldn't find it in the darkness. Yeah. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry, can well, I, I left you high and dry? <laughs> I think this is probably the first time I've ever worn a non plaid shirt. It suits you, though. Yeah. It does suit you. It's not what I ordered, but. It's, it's, I think it's linen. I've, it's yeah. a bit creasy. No, I like linen. it. You look yeah. nice. You look good. And I've got safari yes. trousers on. Which are very practical. There's lots of yeah. pockets. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> honestly, I love it. Honestly, I do honestly. love it. It makes You're making me want to watch Indiana Jones yeah. now. Because I, I, I said to Andrew, they want me to buy some stuff for this safari thing. And he said, well, make sure that it's practical that we, we can wear when we're out walking. I, I like I can it. wear all of this out walking, so. There you go. I like, his, I like his thinking. Yeah. <laughs> you look really cute. I like it. Oh, it's quite restrictive, isn't it? <laughs> Do you know how long it took me to so, do my so hair this morning? <laughs> perhaps, perhaps we should explain why. Okay, so, <laughs> you've probably seen that, uh, that um, VT that I've done, and Alan came up with that awful tagline at the end, mm -hmm. when I say, you heard, it, you heard it here first, and that trumpeting elephant, that was all Alan's idea, not mine. Mm -hmm. I don't like doing VTs and things. <laughs> but we've got an amazing first hour, including something that Lauren wants to purchase for her mum. I hope her mum's not watching, because I've just given the game away. These amazing little elephant bells. They're adorable. Have you heard them ringing? Oh, do they ring? Yeah, they're little no. bells. They're so cute. I didn't, no, I didn't. Yeah, no, listen, hang on. listen. They, they are so cute. Oh. So we've got this in the first hour, and then at nine o'clock, we've got Ooh. the most incredible Botswana agate kits. Yes. So we thought, oh, we've got a bit of a theme going on here. And then at 12 o'clock, we got these amazing tassel topper kits consisting of a lion, a leopard, and an elephant. I love these so much. They're these gorgeous. Things. So we thought, as we've got a theme, we'll, we'll have a theme show. So today is Mark's Safari Adventures. Would you go on a safari? Um, if I didn't have to see an animal killing and eating another animal, which is gonna happen on a safari, so probably yeah. not. No. Yeah. Because uh, we, uh, we don't watch David Attenborough or anything like that in our get house. Sad. Yeah. I know. And you get really frustrated because you, we, we were talking the other day about it. You watch these animal programmes, David Attenborough, and he says, oh, I don't know, this baby zebra has wandered away from his mother. There's a crocodile about to pounce. You think, well, why don't you rescue the little thing? But they don't. <laughs> no. They film it and then expect us to sit and watch it. And I know, no, no, I know, no. I know, I know. It's traumatic, it. isn't it? Yeah, it can't be the, doing the, I think the worst one of those that I ever watched was, I think they were flamingos. Oh, no. It was the most tragic thing I've ever... And I was like, oh, my no. goodness. I, I, lo I love David Attenborough. I think he's a national treasure. Absolutely. But, um, yeah, yeah, but exactly. this baby, I think it was a baby flamingo that was, it was collecting... Oh Salt. yes, on his feet and couldn't on his walk. feet, and he couldn't walk, and they all and they all. I'm like, oh my god, someone Mother help! Mother nature is beautiful, but it's very cruel sometimes. It is. And, yeah, we can't be doing with that in our. I don't think <laughs> I don't think I'd be brave enough no. to go on a safari no. either, no. just for uh, just for like, no. things like the no. the beasties as well. No. No. Anyway, yes, yeah, so it's all safari themed. Which not, that you'd, not that you'd imagine it. It's absolutely torrential out there. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. Or was it Storm Anthony is Anthony. wending his way across? I mean, that's fine for the next five hours. Yeah. As long as he can yeah, yeah. be on his way after home. that, yeah. that would be very... You're off for a barbecue, aren't you, this Meant afternoon? to be. <laughs> <laughs> Meant oh, to we, be. Were, we were always thinking about these, these people who have been planning their weddings. I know. And today is their wedding day, or last Saturday was their wedding day, or the Saturday... But it's rained every Saturday <laughs> for six or seven weeks. One of, um, one of our friends got married a couple of Saturdays ago, and, it was, and they oh. had a marquee. Oh, no. And it was, it was torrential. Such a shame. It is, it? yeah. It was torrential. Yeah. But I don't think it's spoiled. It was no, still no, a special no, day. No. Um, OK. It is going to be a super Saturday. Amazing. We have the one and the only Mark looking very dashing. Uh, I, I do think you could be our very own Indiana Jones. Well, I wear Jones. it like that. 
Oh, yeah. Yeah, like that. Does that yeah. look better? Yeah. I think so. Okay, I'll wear it like that. Yeah. Only for the first hour, because obviously it's going to get in the way of demoing. Oh, yeah. Can you try oh, and demo it? I know. <laughs> <laughs> Just I'll be like this. This little cat. <laughs> um, you've got your elephant. Elephant. Oh. What are we calling them then? Charms. But they've they're got gorgeous. little bells in. I didn't um, As your four. early bird. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Four of Amazing. them. You can shop ahead and pre-order on those right now as well. They are available. They're in item number one on the website. Oh. Heads up. There's 120. Um, they are 925 sewing silver. <sighs> Oh, oh they're amazing. beautiful. The detail. They're gorgeous. They are stunning, aren't they? Yeah, um, and you get all four of them. So you can shop ahead on those. Um, Mark's amazing kits with faceted Botswana, which I'm know, trying to think back. Did we have faceted rounds in the showcase when we relaunched You relaunched it, didn't you? I don't think we had I faceted, think, though. I think we had one strand, if I remember rightly. Okay. Maybe. But um, these are, I mean, look at these. Look at these. Huge! Look at the 16 millimeters. Oh, look at this. I'm just going to show you this one. Look, look at that. Oh, we this. definitely look we can that. confirm we didn't have 16 millimeters on the relaunch. Look at that, look at that quality. They're just beautiful, aren't they? They're coming Absolutely. up at nine o'clock. Yeah, five um, kits. <clears throat> five kits, yes. Um, and all incredibly, incredibly affordably priced Are they? for Botswana I Gate, yes. Okay. Um, your deal of the day today, we are welcoming the wonderful Dave Troth back into the studio, fresh from his show adventures, which was I was... amazing. It was, it was an uh, unbelievable. Incredible show yesterday. How many wow. of us actually kept keep, keeping an eye on the website? Yeah. I'm bowled yeah. over. It might just be my new, new number new one. Thing. You know. um, <clears throat> was everybody saying that yeah, behind yeah. the scenes? Yeah, totally. It's, it's absolutely beautiful. Um, however, not to be outdone today, would be the perfect combination stone, actually. Absolutely, we have yeah. Cotan mutton fat in, oh, my goodness me. That is so Sizes, yeah. Um, up to 18 millimetres in their size. That's oh, what's on your word. screens right now. And you can deconstruct it if you want, but it is a complete bracelet. Um, and you have got that graduation. Yes, so fresh on the back of um, their trip to China. I was chatting to Jake after the show yesterday, talking about um, his trip to China and the food. And the food. And the food, yeah. The experiences of food that oh, they had over there. Amazing. Because it's very different cuisine, isn't yeah. it, somewhat? Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, <coughs> yeah, um, chatting about wow. that, and it did sound absolutely incredible. So he is relaunching Kotan Mutton Fat, but this is of the purest purest white color and it's totally natural so that is at 10 o'clock today and then mark um your master class these are amazing oh my goodness me so you have that's these isn't it yeah. the ones we've just spoken about so yeah. you've got your elephant you've got your leopard and you've got just on the end here your lion so beautiful if you could be any animal i just a simple oh question word. really any animal in um like on safari, which would you be? You're going to say lion, aren't you? Quite like giraffe. I quite like to be a giraffe. Yeah. I like the way they walk. Have you ever seen two giraffes fighting? They, where they swing their necks. It's and that's horrendous. <laughs> yeah, it, it is. Yeah. Um, oh, I like that. Yeah, yeah uh, Adam's just yeah. said um, I'd be an elephant. That's true. That's true. Elephants are fairly high up there, aren't yeah. they? Yeah, yeah. Nobody's messing no. with elephants. Well, apart from. Silly old men. <laughs> um, yeah, up there. Text in, what's your favourite? I'll tell you what, what's your favourite safari animal? Okay, yeah. What's up there? I do, I do like wildebeests. Do you? Yeah, I like wildebeests. Can't be a good warthog. Warthog. That's and it hurts yeah. that my friends never stood downwind. Sorry. Is that a like, quote from something? It's Lion King, yeah. yeah I've never seen the Lion The warthog, King. nobody, his friends yeah. won't walk, walk behind him because he's... Trump's a lot. I'm surprised they've not done the Lion King's Christmas Carol. Yeah. That'll be next. Oh, don't get me started on Christmas Carol. You know, <laughs> we, won't go down, we won't go down that route. <laughs> right then, shall we get cracking, lovely jewellery makers? Come and say hello to Mark and I. We'd love to hear from you on a very blustery, um, windy and wet Saturday morning. But we're going to have lots of sunshine indoors, lots of inspiration, of course. So do text in. Also, you know that it's lounge hour this hour, so you can absolutely shop ahead on your items. Take a look on the website or the W's at jewelrymaker.com. Click watch live um, and if you scroll down you can see all these items for example the peach botswana <gasps> would go perfectly with mark's kits bead caps bead caps Forever. carnelian 
Oh, purple flash baroque pearls. You've got Ethiopian opal in there. There's a cheeky little Botswana satellite strand in there as well. Sterling silver. Love number 15. Some stunning pearls. Oh, by the way, item number 18 does have your Sakura agate in there as well. More peach Botswana, but these are very, very, very limited. That would go perfectly with Mark's nine o'clock kit. Um, I'm going to start with, um, am I? Oh, yeah. There it is. Sorry. Sorry, Roscoe. It's like, ah, oh, first item and she's looking around for it. Sorry, Lauren. Here it is. Now, there are only three available. Um, it's your Bronca Onyx, brought to air last week. Safari theme graphics. Uh, oh, yes. Love it. Just swap it for green. When it was my anniversary last week, they had my head as the graphics coming down when we were reducing. Did they actually? Yeah, it was hilarious. I'm intrigued. Were you doing this? It was, just, it was just a still of my head, and they were just raining down. Oh! Yeah. Oh, I wonder. Oh, we're gonna have yeah, let's see what it is yeah, now. Let's see what happens yeah. with our graphics. Now, this always closed at a certain price point, and then during clearance, Wayne dropped the price. <clears throat> and it wasn't just by a little bit. Bearing in mind that this is totally natural bronchoronyx, no dying. I've got 85. Oh, sorry, oh, 85 wow. were launched. I've got the final three. Gosh. Okay, um, the final three opportunities is, again, to get onyx is one thing in a carved bangle, but to get natural white onyx is another. Oh, yeah, I love it. Jeep. It's, it's you in the Jeep. Jeep. <laughs> I, lo I'm not, oh, I love it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> 49.99, we didn't do that, did we? Hilarious. Yeah, lots uh, of price crashes so we wow. can see Mark in his Jeep. Would That's you get hilarious. a Jeep? Would I get I love quite fancy a Jeep? Yeah, I can quite see you in a Jeep. Jeep. Yeah. <laughs> That's brilliant. Look yeah. at the split payment jewelry makers. One of these is gone. I only had three. Oh no, sorry, I'm looking at the wrong graphics. Um, sorry, I'm on I'm on hobby maker oh. graphics, so I can't see you as of yet. Um, <clears throat> there's three left. Forty nine ninety nine. Always closed at what, sorry? Ninety nine ninety nine. Popped it in clearance, half that price tag. 85 were available. Now we've got the final two because they've once been snapped up by Maker. You've got East Sussex, Kent, and another anonymous collector. Glasgow's on the phone lines. I only had three, so you're going to be quick. And it's That's totally incredible. and utterly natural <laughs> white onyx. This is not dyed, which is what we should really wow. expect most onyx to be. Not all, granted, but most onyx to be actually on the market. Um, hand carved in the same way that your type A jadeite is. We had uh, only three, so I'll leave that one with you. I've got one now. Amazing. Well done, everybody. Uh, shall we do which one? Ooh. There's two sizes. This is amazing. I think I've got eight mils. Oh, These incredible. have got to be with your Ellie They're Flumps, amazing, haven't they? they? Oh. Uh, Seven millimeters. Seven mils. Beautiful. They would go perfect with your kit. We never had them before, had we? No, it was the launch yeah, of Peach, right. wasn't it? Yeah. Um, Peach Botswana. Wow. Now, we have already sowed the seed with our beautiful powers that be that we need more. We need more of the Peach Botswana. We're never happy, are we? <laughs> Bring it to air, launch it, sells out, now we want more. <clears throat> but look at that, natural colours, and you can see that wonderful warmth, that beautiful glow from the peach saturation that's not dyed, that's all totally natural. And up until that relaunch, and it was you and I, wasn't it, Mark? It wasn't, no. Oh. It was Alison. Were you watching at home? I was fuming. <laughs> but that's why I've got it in. I've got it oh, in did kids. you kick off? Yeah. Did you? Yeah. I love it. I love it. Yeah. I wanted the Botswana. I was promised the Botswana. Were you? Yeah. And oh. I think, I think, I think, and I think something didn't arrive, so they bought the Botswana forward only by a day, but I missed it. It but happens. Never mind. It does happen. <laughs> yeah. It happens to us as well. Like, oh, don't. This is so beautiful. It is beautiful. The king of all yeah. our gates with yeah. your beautiful peach colours. Now, we've not dyed it, impregnated it with a peach colour. No, that is all Mother Nature's amazing doing. And you get that those same beautiful kind of florets, beautiful banding. That's why it's celebrated. It would be an amazing addition to Mark's kits because you've got the kind of earthy yeah, tones yeah. in your kit yeah. um, and also facets um, So as a, as a contrast. How many do we have then, Roscoe? 17 oh, left no. out of the 100 that we relaunched just a week or so ago. Good luck. There he is. 
a wimba way, 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 a wimba way. Thirty pounds. In the jungle. Sorry, I know. And it's one of the rarer colours, this peach colour. Never seen it. You got to remember, we've been broadcasting for thirteen years. 13 years, and we wow. have never brought Peach uh, Botswana, to our recollection, any. anyway. Um, look how beautiful. Like yeah, the that. look of Morganite. And, and like carnelian like colours. Um, so, yeah, we wanted lots of price crashes so we could see Mark in his Jeep. <laughs> Let's do it again, shall we? There's only 17 available, though. Hiya, Joy. Hello to you, Sarah and Maker. Wet, windy, blustery Saturday morning, but don't you worry. We'll have fun indoors. Yeah, I don't think my, the barbecue's going to be happening, is it? <laughs> the final 14 that we have, good luck. In 60 oh, seconds, we are taking it lower. From what is, you, you were shocked at 29 oh, that's incredible. For a brand new gemstone that we've never done before. Well, you're, you, incredible. you'll back me up with this statement, mm. Mark, because I remember way back when, you know, when we were babies here at Jewelry yeah, Maker, yeah, yeah. if you put Botswana in a kit, it massively it bumped the price did, up, didn't it? You did. Do you remember the presenter Fiona yeah. from Gemporia? I do. She had this thing about Botswana, and whenever we had it on the, on the show, she would shout it. Botswana! Do you remember? Yeah, I do. Yeah. I do. Fee. Fee. That's fee, right. lovely yeah. fee. I do remember. I think yeah. they're in Panto now. They are. They do Panto things, don't yeah. they? Yeah, uh, twenty nine ninety nine already incredible, but we're going even lower. A wimble way, a wimble way. If you keep an eye on the website, there are already sellouts, lovely jewelry makers. So yeah, if you see something, don't assume there's quantity. There is of your early bird. There's there's quantity of the elephant, um, but not of items. Not the majority of the items anyway. Seventeen available. I'll always try um, and tell you that quantity. Good luck. I mean, twenty nine ninety nine isn't it is a fantastic price, especially for one of the rarer colours of. Botswana Agate. $24.99. Amazing. It is amazing. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Beautiful colour. Such an amazing complementary shade. I mean, you could put this with pearls, couldn't you? In fact, Gorgeous. as I have a strand here, why not? Let's do it. What do we think to that? Be lovely alongside the pearls as well, just to bring you. And guess what? I've got one more peach Botswana okay. strand. We'll do that, this one straight away, and the pearls will be coming your way. Um, I've only got 10 left. Susan snapped up two. Um, oh, yes. Yeah, Ross has just said, mm. oh, they look a little bit fire opal. They do rather, don't they? You could use this with your spiny oyster, couldn't you? Oh, that, that would be, be nice. That'd be beautiful with it. Oh, there's another gemstone we've got to get back yeah. in stock. Spiny yeah. oyster. Love that. Yeah, it'd be beautiful. Hands up. Who likes oysters? Never As had an oyster. Never had an oyster. I've had my like mussels and cockles and yeah. wrinkles and things, but I, oh, it was the way they look. I, I can't. Well, you've seen how queasy I get when we see the picture of that, yeah, that that's oyster. True, yeah. yeah, yeah, maybe they're not for you. <laughs> that's true. Not. No. I want to like them. That's the thing. I love shellfish. Right. Love shellfish, but I can't, I don't no. like oysters at all. You have tried one? Oh, lots of times. Right. I, want, just, I want to like them, but that. Apparently, you have to swallow them. I just think, what's the point? You can chew them. Really? My brother puts my brother puts Tabasco on his. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah. Isn't that a hangover cure? Is it? Yeah, it's an I'm aphrodisiac. Sure. I know oh, that. Is it? Yeah, yeah, apparently. Apparently, you got that in quick. <laughs> <laughs> like I say, I, I'm not really, I'm not really a fan of them. I did try one Valentine's Day. Um, pre kids, this was when you could right. be romantic. And right. I was like, okay, I'm going to cook a nice meal for Tom and I'm going to do oysters to start. And I forgot to get the tools to open the oysters. Oh, and no. it's like, he's packed never in with a screwdriver. Packed in with a screwdriver. <laughs> Oyster went in my eye, salt water. Ah, oh. not romantic at all. Yeah, not romantic. And I didn't like him anyway. Um, <laughs> uh, yes. If you like spiny oyster, we've got gold and Mojave turquoise coming up. When? Next Monday. How exciting. Because that would go beautifully too, wouldn't it? Mm. Amazing with your Botswana. Um, okay, shall we bring you the six mil? Is that what you said? The six millimeter size? Yeah. Um, let me move those to avoid confusion. They are beautiful, aren't they? In yes. the um, nine o'clock kit hour, I'm going to be demoing a little technique with six mil rounds. Are you? I'm just trying to guess mm. what that demo is going to be. Mm. That's beautiful. Is it on one of your pieces of jewellery? Yep. How about, how, where? Oh, 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 yes. Oh, 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 yeah. 
very nice. This is going to be the demo. Mm -hmm. Oh, beautiful. Mark, that's amazing. How have I not seen that piece of jewellery? And it's double-sided as well. Very or, Van Cleef. Or I'll reveal all. Ooh, very Van Cleef and Arpels. Yeah. yeah. Amazing. Now, there are only how many did you say? Nine oh, no. of the six mil. Um, again, perfect to go alongside Mark's beautiful kits coming up at nine o'clock today with the peach honey tones. Morning, Susan. Morning to you, Sarah. Morning to you, Joy and Cheryl and Penny. Nice to see you all. Text in. Do you like oysters? <laughs> um, Adam likes oysters. Do you like oysters then, Ross Rossi? Do you? You love seafood. You love an oyster. You had a nightmare you had to eat a whole octopus. <laughs> and he woke up. Uh, uh. But you like seafood, though. Mm. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. I mean, I love seafood. It's my favourite food. Mm. If I have I've to never eat... had octopus before. Mm. Yeah, I like octopus, yeah. yeah. I like octopus. Mm. Quite a, yeah, 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 that's how I would describe it. Quite a strong mm. taste, absolutely. Okay, um, but yeah... My oyster's not for me. Um, hello, Alison. Morning, now, Mark and crew. I have to say, you look amazing in your safari <laughs> kit, Mark. You do. Things I do. Things I do for this. You're always world. game, though, I'm Mark. Always, yeah, I'll give it a go. I'll give it a fair, go. You fair play. Whenever yeah. it's fancy dress, you are always game. Yeah. And you're, you're very organised, so you plan things well, Absolutely. whereas I'm very lastminute.com. Oh, right. So we work together. <laughs> <laughs> we work together if ever in fancy dress, because Mark organises me effectively. Yeah. We've done well over the years. We have. We yeah. have. Yeah. I wonder if it's off us this uh, Halloween. You have to check. I have to double check. Um, well done, everybody. Make sure you check out your baskets. Uh, moving on to... Let's do those pearls. That makes sense, doesn't it? Again, with those charms, your elephant charms, and they'd be absolutely gorgeous They'd be fantastic. Your elephant charm. Yeah. yeah. They we hold one of them up. They're adorable, aren't they? And the fact that you actually get four of them, too. Yeah, just one of your little elephant charms yeah. on there with your Botswana. How beautiful is that piece of jewellery going to be? Amazing. We're at £39.99. pence. Genuine cultured pearls, not faux, not similar, not glass. Popped into town yesterday after work, just because I'd pick up a few birthday gifts and whatnot. A little mooch round. It was like a supermarket sweep kind of... Yeah. Well, it wasn't in the supermarket. Yeah. It was a shopping centre. Um, but, again, walked walk through the clothing shop, saw your faux pearls, and they're, you know, more expensive than what we bring actual pearls. Mm. It's just, you know... Amazing, isn't it? No. Nice to so solidify just how good the deals are. There he is, marking his Jeep. Let's, dr <laughs> let's, dr <laughs> let's drop yeah. that price. We've only got 15, what? and at 9.99, they're not hanging around. The oh, pearl really? is the perfect accompaniment, isn't it? It's like yeah. the diamond. The perfect accompaniment to all of your gemstones. This will go beautifully with your kits. Go amazing with, say, Carnelian. Yeah. What do you think? That's incredible. Beautiful. It'll go fabulous with, say, some black spinel. Amazing, amazing. It'll black go. Spinel. Love a bit of black mm. spinel. Look at that classic monochrome. It complements absolutely everything, but you do need to be quite quick this morning. Kathy, hello to you, Jackie, and Maker in Northumberland, Lorna and Ella. First hour is always quite limited and um, very busy, actually. Very, very busy hour. You're up and at it, which is great. Especially, I'm not surprised. I'm expecting it to be busy today because, let's be honest, it's rubbish outside, isn't it? <laughs> it is rubbish. <laughs> Um, if you're planning on going for a nice, leisurely summertime walk, don't. Don't. Because, you know, when you get to step outside your front door and you're like that, you pull that face. Crazy. So I got, up, I got up this morning and made Andrew a cup of tea and thought, right, where are the cats then? I'll get them fed. Pouring down with rain and they're sat in the middle of the lawn. Are they? Yeah. Not they, bothered? Not bothered. They've never been bothered by the rain. None oh. of our cats have strange things. I have, to, I have to push Bo, uh, Bo my Sharpe, out the door because she oh, hates dude. the rain. I'm like, Bo, go on, go for a wee. And she's like that. <laughs> hates it. Uh, the Sharpe's hate rain. Moving on to what, sorry? Black Spinel, let's do it. Brutus doesn't care, but Bo hates it. Strange, it? Yeah. Bear in mind, we are in August. I know, it's crazy. It is crazy. So what are you thinking? Bear in mind we are in August. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Sorry, I was a bit Ross slow. No. Was Wait, let's not tell Ross, let's not tell Ross. Just don't tell Ross. Yeah. Don't tell him. He's not listening, so it's okay. That's amazing. It's also a 43 centimetre strand. Wow. I was this a bit slow so cottoning on to what That's you were right. referencing That's then, Mark. You won't mention it. This is totally natural, beautiful, black spinel, 
faceted to perfection, mirror-like luster. I love black spinel. Had a showcase of it, didn't we, not so long ago? Did, yeah. Absolutely yeah. flew. Likewise, Mark, this will complement all of your oh, kits. Yeah. Um, nine o'clock and also at 12 ah. o'clock. Now, 100 of these sold on launch. We've got the final 46, okay. It's actually a decent quantity. Is, yeah. But again, the perfect accompaniment to all of your gemstones. Now, first price crash, just to ease, wake us up, ease us into our Saturday morning. Wow. First crash, did he say? Yeah. Oh, yeah. First price crash. Phone lines have lit up because our viewers know. You know what Mark's talking about, don't you? Not nine ninety nine. <laughs> <laughs> he sussed us. He says, "I know there's no flies on Ross no. there." <laughs> he sensed it. He said. He sensed it. There you go. That's what you're talking about. Ah. The people know, people know. Use August 20. You can't go back on your crash either. He says, yeah, listen, I've only no, said first no. crash, so he's got to do another. Got to do it. Go on then, Roscoe. We've only got 50, haven't so we? So it's already just eight pounds already. Eight pounds. Half the but, stock's gone yeah. already. It's a long strand too. Yeah. Yeah. I know. Yep. 20%, not 10. It's already eight pound. So it's eight pound. Plus one pound sixty off that, so that's six pound forty. Six pound forty for a forty-three <laughs> centimetre faceted black spinel yeah. strand. That's madness, isn't it? Look how many people are multi-buying. I don't blame you. Hi, and Natalie, Una, wow. Pauline. Hello to you, Heather and Kathy and Ella and London and Elaine, Elizabeth and Jane and Tracy and Merthyr Tidfil. Hello to you all. Um, yeah. Oh, you can't go wrong with black spinel, can you? I mean, it would be, if I borrow this necklace for a second, Mark. Oh, yeah. Your beautiful... Is that a leopard or leopard. a panther? What leopard, do you think? I think. I mean, if you could imagine some black spinel in amongst oh, Mark's... Yeah, that would just finish it off perfectly, oh, wouldn't it? Beautiful. Or if you wanted some yeah. up there, that would work too. £7.99 pence only. Lovely jewel maker. Sold out. Well done. <laughs> well, done well done, well done, well um, done. <laughs> yeah. Not surprised. Oh, a nice gemstone oh, to go alongside it. With that. Don't forget the Ellie flumps. And if you put the pearls in as well, that yeah. would make an amazing kit, wouldn't it? An elephant? A real old school kit, yes. How about with the early bird elephant? Where's the bell then? It's actually embedded in the body. It must be in the it inside be in elephant. Wow. So they've made the two pieces and yeah. sold to them clothes with a little bell inside. Little bell inside. Ah, oh, that's going to oh. make the most amazing yeah. sound, isn't it, while you're wearing your jewellery? Yeah, oh. compliments. Perfectly. Classical, a very Halloween. I love very carnelian, Halloween. and we don't see it very we don't. often. No, 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 it's no. such a beautiful. Well, to me, orange is such a happy colour. You, again, you know, I popped to mm. shops yesterday because yeah. it's my um, father-in-law's birthday, um, and we're going down for his birthday celebrations. Anyway, so popped to the shops because I need to pick up a few bits, and I went in a certain chain that sells things for less. Do you know yeah, which yeah, one yeah. I'm on about? Mm -hmm. Um, and they've got all the Halloween gear out. Already. Already, your pumpkins and everything. Surprise it's not Easter eggs. No. Uh, Ross is just saying, on Tuesday he got home from work. Chloe said to Ross he'd got a, uh, got a present. Christmas themed chocolate on August the 1st. <laughs> Well, well, I mean, it's it, that's very sweet. It's very sweet, but we are still in August. Mm. It's like we've given up on summer, yeah, isn't it? I think uh, we've it's yeah, gone. I think we've had our summer. Rubbish, yeah. isn't it? We've bypassed Halloween as well, just straight to Christmas. I don't know. I love, I love, the, like autumn stroke winter. I, I do like well. it. I don't yeah. mind a bit of rain. A bit of summer would have been it, quite nice. I'd rather that than it be like 40 degree heat. Mm. No thanks. No. No thank you. Um, okay, so we're bringing you Carnelian, that beautiful, zesty, semi-translucent, orange, vibrant gemstone that we rarely ever see. Um, and this is faceted into your beautiful bicones. 29.99, how do you feel about that? Amazing. It's a beautiful cut stone. Um, Carnelian, well, a, a, lot of, a lot of the big designers are working with Carnelian once again, um, and rightfully so. It's, a, it's a, a very versatile gemstone. I like to contrast it with something like, you know, um, green onyx or something like that. Yeah. Ooh, 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 so what about your Sanan Scan? 
yeah. that we had yeah. yesterday. This would be beautiful in amongst sand and scarn. Um, yeah, turquoise yeah, would be fabulous. Yeah. How many do we have, Roscoe? 17 available within the vault. Um, make sure you're checking out those baskets, everybody. I can see you there. And you've got hematite. Hematite. H A E M. Um, <laughs> um, hiya, Kathy. Saying good morning. Uh, what's that? Machete Mark. Machete Mark. <laughs> Looking forward to going on safari with you. Oh, isn't that like machete? <laughs> <laughs> Just hacking down the reeds yeah. and everything. Ah. Oh. Um, hello to you. Dorset saying we have been on safari. It was amazing. Um, oh, wow. What's that with elephants trying to get in our oh, hotel? Wow. Wow. It's the kind of thing, you know what, I would love to say, I'd love to do, but I think I'd be a little bit scared. Mm. I would be quite scared. So, but that's, that's like bucket list, isn't it? It's a bucket. My mum and dad went on safari for one of their anniversaries and they loved it too. Mm -hmm. but they you, see, you see lots of videos on Facebook of people on safari and they, they never see an animal. They're always really shy and that would be another one, wouldn't it? Yeah. And Prince William, um, proposed to Princess Catherine on safari. Yes, yes, I remember that actually. Yeah. He kept that engagement that. ring in his backpack for five days oh. before he plucked up the courage to ask her. Oh, oh bless him. Even yeah. princes get nervous yeah. too. Yeah. Um, now we've got 17 left. Oh. Down to 12. <gasps> Let's go again, shall we? Beautiful colour to go alongside your kits, Mark. Perfect. Carnelian perfect. with Botswana. Does it get Ooh. any better than that? We've and some that lovely thread, yeah, that. nice cord. Be beautiful with your sari thread. Oh, yes, make sure you tune in on Wednesday. Wednesday? Mm. Pretty exciting show on Wednesday, haven't we? Yeah. Are you, are you going to say any more or are you keeping it closely guarded? Right, in the nine o'clock hour, we have got a nugget nuggets, theme. Nuggets, nuggets, nuggets. Nephrite. Yes. Aquamarine. Yeah. They're, they are amazing. Um, try a malachite. Oh, lovely. With tiny little charms. Oh, nice. And in the 12 o'clock hour, Brand new cord launch, 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 <laughs> launch, designed by yours truly. Yes, Mark's first ever cord exclusive launch. To JM. Love that. Can't get it anywhere else in the world. No, very exciting. Can't wait. Uh, so get your carnelian ahead of that, everybody, mm. and also Mark's kits. It would be amazing with Mark's kits too. It's a fantastic deal at twenty nine ninety nine. Those wonderful warm colours. I mean, for me, orange is that one of their most happiness inducing colours. I love orange. Absolutely adore orange. Good for the soul, I feel, because and, and multi seasonal, you know, summertime warmth and then obviously winter, cozy. It's mm. all of those things. Orange spice, yeah, oh lovely. Very nice. Adam said to me he made pumpkin spiced soup. Don't mm, like pumpkins? I'm not a fan. No? no? Do you like soup? I love soup. Yeah. I love soup. Yeah, I love I like a soup. soup. Yeah. You don't pumpkin. like pumpkin. No. Not a fan of pumpkin. Oh, yeah. Mm. Adam, next time you make pumpkin soup, can you bring some in for us? Because I think I'd like that. I'll provide the bread if you provide the soup mm. deal. He's got an allotment, so he gets lots of lovely vegetables. Um, 19.99, Pauline and Tracy and Heather and Antoinette and Davinia and Christine and Glynis and Lynn and Paula and Maker and Heather. Um, well done. We only had 12 of them, so make sure you are checking out those baskets, folks. And use this time, bearing in mind there's only 27 minutes left on this hour to make your confirmations before each item actually disappears. Um, shop ahead on your elephants as well that are coming up as your early bird. Um, there's also some lovely components on the website. Have a little look. All the W's at jewelrymaker.com or download the app. Um, and you can shop ahead knowing that you only pay one potion packaging all day. Five of these left, many more than five on the website. I can see your names. Um, hiya, Ted. Hi, Alan Hello. Mark. The Romans used to say that Britannia had one saving grace beautiful oh. oysters uh, they used to pack them on ice to ship to rome there we go wow. do we have the best oysters then do we We must do there's special rules aren't there about when you can harvest them yeah. like lobsters and things isn't it yeah, yeah. my father-in-law wow. bought came up uh, this was a couple of months ago actually i think it was the beginning of summer um came up and he was like here just brought a bag of oysters <laughs> neither tom and i like them thank you thank you after a few glasses of wine, we did tell him that we didn't like the oysters. He's like, oh, okay, that's all right, I'll have them then. But yeah, he'll know for next time. He'll know for next yeah. time. But yeah, um, yeah this will be on the verge of selling out any moment now. But oh, I didn't know that, Ted. That's a fun fact. My 
my brother took Willow crabbing on the weekend. I loved just crabbing. Gone. Yeah, she was in her I element. Loved crabbing. She was in her absolute yeah. element. But of course, putting the crabs back after. But there was one yeah. that properly got. It, it, it was that one off Nemo. A a a. Fighting feisty, back, yay. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, what is it about bee caps? I love bee caps. They're probably my favourite finding at the moment. I love these. And these are sterling, I believe. Yeah. Aren't they? These are the posh. Like posh a bead stargazer cap. lily. You could. No, they, they just, I mean, just your simple pearls, just a bead cap either end just transforms your jewellery. Little, yep. little chain tassels underneath. Absolutely beautiful. And you can flatten them as yep. well with your hammer and make, turn them into connect. Uh, yeah, you can turn these into connectors because you've got those large holes in the petals. Oh, okay. These are amazing. Look at how many you're getting as well. Yeah. 50 of them. We used to, I'm, I'm right wow. in saying we used to sell them at like in packs of 10. Yes, right, absolutely. And here I've we are with 50. Them in sterling. This is amazing. Beautiful. Yeah. And because of the shape of the petals, whichever size bead you put on, you can mould them around that bead. Oh, okay. So you can have them hugging to the yeah. halfway point if you had a 6 mil round. If you had a 12 mil round, you'd slightly flatten them. So nice. They're perfect shape for bead caps. They could almost replicate as yeah. well a bale couldn't Absolutely. they so if you had yeah, like just nice a head bin and have just one on the top so yeah. it kind of brings you that nice bale idea. appearance yeah um yeah 925 sterling silver we've only wow. got 11 of these though um never mind one pound each although yeah. that would be amazing <gasps> no 50p that's amazing wow they'd actually almost sold out before they're we even amazing. crashed the price tag like I said, I, this, is, this is the first lot I've seen in sterling for bead caps. Yeah. Normally we get them in plated and... Uh, well, they are fantastic. beautiful, aren't they? What a deal. Makes such amazing... And, and yeah. 925 is very malleable, isn't it? Absolutely. So it, it will yeah, sort of absolutely. frame. There are yeah. so many of you there. We will endeavour to get more of them, I promise. So, uh, But make sure you check out if you need them right now because we yeah. only had 11 of them and I've got Charmaine, Tracy, Hertfordshire, Ruby, Conway, Heather... Natalie, Anna, oh, and wow. Hertfordshire, and Alan live sold out. Well done. Um, amazing. Shall we do? Uh, no, I don't see one. A link bracelet. Lauren made you a drink, but she didn't put your sweeteners in. That's okay, bless oh, her. Yeah. It's a good egg. We got, yeah. <laughs> got my cover jewel maker mug. Um, hello, Heather, saying hiya. Oysters oh, do, used yeah. to be peasant food yeah. in Ireland. You eat them with chilli on. And a pint of Guinness. Oh, Can I go with the chili and the Guinness? I like I like Guinness. Ah, uh, that's actually, and I like chili. I like chili, yeah. Wow. Um, I discovered something about Guinness last Christmas, what? which which is the oh my lord. If we go out to a pub or a restaurant and I'm driving, which is all the time, I have a, I have a shandy. Nice. Depending how I feel, it's a bitter or a lager. Yeah. So every year, Andrew, as you know, he makes the Christmas puddings yeah. and the Christmas cakes, and he buys a bottle of Guinness, and we only use half of it, and it sits in the fridge, and we throw it away. And I wondered what it would be like to make a Guinness shandy with lemonade. Oh, my word. Is it nice? Best drink I've ever had. Ooh. A Guinness shandy. Does it not? How do no, you... no, it's just... So, so half the Guinness and then tip the, tilt the glass, yeah. gently pour the lemonade in, full pint of, of lager, of um, shandy Guinness. It's the best ever. I like Guinness with black currant. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's a cocktail, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, just a little bit of black currant yeah. in the top. Yeah. That's... It's yeah. Guin I, I actually found out I was pregnant with Willow when I... Uh, really? Through Guinness. Oh. <laughs> So basically, we'd gone, Tom and I had gone out with friends for the day, and obviously we were trying for baby and whatnot, and um, Tom was like, what do you want to drink, El? And I was like, do you, do, you want, do you want a glass of wine? I was like, oh, no. No, do you want, do you want? I said, no, I'll have a Guinness. And Tom looked at me and he was like, a Guinness? I, like, it's not something I drink very no. often. I was like, oh. And sure enough, I was pregnant. Yeah. So I was clearly craving, craving the, iron the iron of the Guinness. Yeah. So I'll have, have a Guinness, please. <laughs> <laughs> um, OK, uh, moving on to... Oh, there it is. There's there the bracelet. Is. I love this piece. I'm amazed we've still got them that in stock, actually. That's quite heavy. Quite it chunky. is. Yeah. And it's got that lovely hidden oh, link. So beautiful clasp. Um, I've bought a few of these. They're in the present drawer already for Christmas. Yes, It'll yeah. be here before you know it. Before you know it, all that 925, 2.8 grams of solid sterling silver. Do we have many of these available then, Roscoe? 23 left within our vault. Um, and I think every time, um, every time we've spoken about, uh, we've spoken about this bracelet, we always say that it would do, you know, lots of people would love this, all ages. You know, wow. if I was to give this to my mum, she'd love it. If I was to give it to my sister-in-law or my daughter. I think it's one of those that you can absolutely, um, Amazing. absolutely, uh, um, 
gift on multiple mm. occasions. It could be the base or foundation maybe of a charm bracelet. Uh, 69.99, yeah, elsewhere. I think that's a fantastic price, don't you? Uh, none of us would be surprised at that price no. point. No. You know, if we were to walk into Pandora or Gucci or Tiffany's and Co. Oh, yeah, with your elephants. Yeah, it'd be perfect, wouldn't it? Yeah. Oh, that would be lovely. Would you go for the elephant here or would you go for the elephant at the Halfway. other side? Halfway. Halfway, so say there. Nice, yeah. yeah, nice. So beautiful. How easy would that be to do? Just a jump ring. There's a loop, isn't there? There's a jump ring attached. Just oh, open and close. Yeah, yeah. So if you go to Sif Jacobs Jewelry, Copenhagen, okay. Oh. Um, so a bracelet very, very similar, £175. Yeah. It's not a bad price, considering. No, no, no. It's still £175, don't get me wrong. We're at £69.99. How about this? £69, not a bad price. I don't like that one that much. I'm not keen on that. No. I think they could have done with the hidden bail. One of those links being a clip yeah. cl clasp. Yeah. Um, that one's nice, Pandora, loving that. Again, with a hidden clasp, actually, £70, not a bad price, but actually when you look at it on her wrist, it's quite like, you know, it's, yeah. not, it's not a heavy, heavy, chunky chain um, to justify £70. We're at that price point right now, but we don't stop there. This bracelet has been um, incredibly popular. I've bought a few of them as well. 11 of them left. Uh, once they're gone, they're gone. Pop them in the... Put them in a nice box, which we had the other day on Jewelry did, Maker, didn't yeah, we? Yeah, yeah. Snapped up some of those. Um, well, yeah. It's more than that. Yeah, it's chunky. It's 2.8. Yeah, it probably it's is. It's a lot more than that. It probably is, it? to be honest. 40 pounds. 40 pounds. <laughs> 39 pounds and 99 pence only. I mean, if this was in wow. Links of London or in Gucci or Tiffany's and Co., there's no way it's going to be a double figure price tag. Um, again, love the quality. Still, right. same 925 yeah. sterling silver. This isn't base metal. It's solid precious metal. We're not even stopping there. We're going even lower. Remember, though, at the end of this hour, all these deals will disappear. So you've got about 18 minutes to make those confirmations. Just simply add it to your order and you pay just one post and packaging all day. Julian Antoinette and Gillian Hazel and Renfusha and Ayrshire and Marion, uh, Jacqueline and Margaret, Charmaine and Fife and Maker. Loads of you there. I only had how many 11 okay so you need to be quick um the fact i bought multiples tells me this went to an amazing price so i didn't just buy one i bought three because they're gifts perfect gifts they're perfect aren't they perfect gifts and they're not going to yeah, think for one yeah. second that i spent anywhere near what we go to i can't remember exactly but the fact i bought three tells me it was a great price this with your elephants how perfect Lots, I think most people love elephants, don't they? I think they? so, yeah. They are one of those species, like sloths. Sorry, I just love sloths. <laughs> I think they're adorable sloths. And pandas. Oh, pandas, £24.99 pence only. I saw a video the other day, um, yesterday, actually. I was, I was like, look, Willow, Willow, look, look at the sloth. Because I always talk about how their features look like they're really close in the centre of their faces, oh, yeah. don't they, sloth? But it was a, this is the most handsome sloth you'll ever see. And he was, he was very handsome. He was wow. a very handsome sloth. <laughs> Didn't look grubby, he was nice and clean, black and white. <laughs> I love them, I think they're so funny. I can relate to sloths. Um, 24.99 only, um, so many of you there. Pauline and Diane and Julie and Amanda and Joan. Well done to you all. Um, make sure you are checking those baskets out. Just a little bit of a heads up. If you loved your Peach Botswana that would go perfectly with Mark's kits and your early bird, um, there are only how many? Three mm. left. Wow. Three left. I don't want to send three back. You can put one Peach Botswana on there as well, couldn't you? One Peach Botswana, one elephant. Yeah, that'd be amazing. Sterling silver bracelet. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. I think gents would wear that as well, that bracelet. Do you Definitely. Think? Yeah, because it's chunky, it's chunky absolutely. enough, isn't it? Yeah. Loving that. So there's only three of those left if you've got it in your I'm basket. I'm intrigued about those head pins up there. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's a big box of head pins. Yeah. Um, Ethiopian opal with flashes wow. of red, the rarest colour to actually get because of the distances of light that it actually has to travel from the gemstone to the observer, a.k.a. you and I. Um, a fascinating stone that forms out of silica. Basically, over millions of years, water gets trapped between the host rock and gradually, hopefully, 
forms this beautiful gemstone. Um, lovely Linda yesterday was saying this is her favorite gem. I didn't she know did. that. She yeah. did, I didn't know that. I can see why. It's like the Aurora Borealis trapped within your opal. And that's all down to the arrangement of the silica. Not every single opal has the same display. But shine an example of why I love Ethiopian opal above Australian, because it's more semi-translucent, mm. isn't yeah, it? So you see the play of color in the heart as well. We're at 99.99, but we're not stopping there. Totally natural. <laughs> Are they still talking about Guinness? And oysters and... They're talking about Guinness facts. £20. Nineteen ninety-nine. yeah. That with gold. Accent in diamonds. Gosh. You won't be anywhere near what's on your screens right now. It's a trillion cut. Absolutely mm. beautiful. And, and... Do you remember? That this is a sentence that I say quite frequently. I read it once upon a time. It's always stuck with me. Anything over 80% play of colour in an opal is an exceptional opal. Oh. Um, so, pretty full on, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, 100%. Yeah. You've got, if you focus on one fraction, one proportion of that gemstone, you're going to see a colour. Uh, 1999. How many did we have of these? 16 of them. Annie and Mary and Jerry and Julie, well done to you. Make sure you're checking out. Keep on dialing through, everybody. Um, okay, let's bring you. Oh, I love this. This with that bracelet that we had a few moments ago. And at nine o'clock, we've got the last 11 Ooh. of the pearls that we launched last week. These, yeah, they're um, um, unbelievable pearls. So what about that, Mark? Perfect. That is so cute. Looks like it's a chestnut collection, doesn't it? Pete? It does. Yeah. That's beautiful. Absolutely love that. This pendant is beautiful. So you've got mother of pearl, and then you've got a wonderful, perfect button pearl perfect. Um, set into, and I'll pick it up now, um, set into all that sterling silver. Oh, oh sorry. No. Here you are. Well, it's not enamel, it's... Um, no, mother no, it's of Mother of Pearl. pearl. Wow. So the same component that we use at Van Cleef and Arpels. We oh, saw yeah. one yesterday, didn't we? Like a coin, just a plain coin framed in sterling silver. Mm. Nowhere near the detail of this one. Um, how's that, Adam? Uh, this is far more detailed, far more beautiful in my opinion. I'm not just saying that because I'm biased. I generally do think it's much more beautiful. Um, all set into 925 sterling silver at £39.99 pence only. That's an incredible, incredible deal. In 17 seconds, they were taking it lower. This was one of our early birds, wasn't it? And it absolutely flew out the door. I know we haven't got many of them left. Mother of Pearl and Pearl, what a perfect combination. And if you think about Queen Camilla. Yes. Yeah, you know, she wears her mother of pearl, doesn't she? Her Van Cleef and Arpels uh, collection, um, drenched in the Alhambra. I mean, how amazing. <laughs> but look how beautiful, how beautiful that looks. It works perfectly with that sterling silver bracelet, and it's just what a jump ring. Wow. Or on chain. 11 99 Get them at Shop Ahead, get them for your gifts That's on a stretchy amazing. bracelet. Do you remember I mentioned a couple of weeks ago, um, Georgia came to the house with yeah. Alice to look at my old school JM stash. Yeah. Well, I've got a plastic box of mother of pearl beads. We yeah. used to do the flat double-sided mother of pearl. Nice. And um, they've, they've come back and spoken to Wayne and he can't get them because they're too expensive. Really? To buy mother of pearl strands, strands is far too expensive for us. It's probably because yeah. all the watch brands are using yeah. it, I would so imagine. Just, so to see mother of pearl on the show, that's quite yeah. rare. Yeah. Um, I'm not surprised by that, yeah, because yeah. watch brands use Mother of Pearl a lot. You know, you've got mm. Rolex as yeah. an obvious one, but you've yeah. also got things like uh, Chopard, they use it really? too. Louis Vuitton. Wow. You know, it, and it is a beautiful material, isn't it? Love it. I so love it. So I'm not Mother surprised. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm not surprised at all. 11 99 I was looking last night, actually. Lola Rose have got a Mother of Pearl watch, which is really lovely, really nice. Really simple, just a square mother of pearl, just leather yeah. strap, really gorgeous. Eleven ninety nine. I might have to get some of these with you. Um, feed them onto a chain. Earrings, yeah, I beautiful. With really the black nice, spinel. Yeah. Black uh, spinel okay. that we had a few moments ago. How many did we have then, Roscoe? Twelve, but again, straight away, people on those phone lines. There's a delay on our call screen once again, so if I don't holler out your names, it's not because uh, I'm being ignorant, it's because our call screen's playing there. Uh, there you there all are. So all of a sudden it springs yeah. into life and then I see all They're your names. Right. I love them. They are beautiful. Well done. It is time now. 
Oh, one more. One more oh. before the elephants, OK. Um, sky blue appetite. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Full of fire, full of scintillation. The summer's day sky blue that we are all craving. <laughs> it's up there somewhere. It's up there somewhere, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Somewhere on this big, beautiful planet, there's a summer's day sky blue. Um, appetite, in all of its glory and splendor, comes in a lovely selection of blue colours. Sky blue, yes, it is reminiscent of beautiful summer's days. Um, oh, my goodness, we're straight away at £9.99. Oh, oh. Even though these are two millimetres, most, so, well, I shouldn't say most, some gemstones would lose that, that glow, that... Uh, um, presence if you like of color because of the size not appetite it cannot be tamed six pound 99 i'm thinking with your kits mark because you've lovely. got some beautiful blue be, cords it'll be, it'll be gorgeous with the pots okay yeah. what did you just say yeah. final auction before your elephants <laughs> should we go out with a bang we're already at 6.99 a minute on your screens. How about under five pounds? But there is a catch. You only have five minutes to make your confirmations. And that goes to the elephants too. Yeah. So you do need to make sure you're checking out. Have we got quantity then? Tassels, just shy of 80. Use them in Mark's Kiss Cross inspiration. I think would be lovely. I'm looking at this lovely elephant necklace, Mark. That's coming oh, yeah, in. I did a bit of Kiss Cross in there. Well, that's gorgeous. Yeah. Micro. Micro, mi very micro. Micro, lovely. micro. Yes. Yeah. So it would be perfect alongside uh, uh, alongside one, one of the pieces that Mark's created for his 12 o'clock kits. And you've used, obviously, your 11. Mm. Is it 11 O's 15, or 15 O's? 15, um, but you yeah. could substitute that out, actually, with... Um, your two millimetre stones just here. Six ninety nine, but we are going to take it even lower. Use them as alternative to your spaces. Use them um, in your kiss cross. Use them in your looming, in your tassels. You know where it's going, everybody. Mary and Jerry, Joan, Carolyn, Elaine and Swansea, Brenda and Tina, Dawn and Sharon and Fran and Christina and Paula. There he is, Mark his Jeep. <laughs> I was having a cream tea with Dua Lipa on my last show. Were you? Yeah, the picture still might be on... Um on the server. With Dua Lipa. She's beautiful. Mm. Very beautiful. Mm. I actually would have believed you then if you'd have carried on to, I was having cream tea with Dua Lipa. Oh. There's a picture. Are you actually serious though? Because I... There's a picture, yeah. Tom, did Tom put it on the show last week. Oh. Yeah. Is it, is it like an edited one? It's very good. You wouldn't, <laughs> you wouldn't know in a million Amazing. years. Amazing. It Amazing. might be on there. We need to find that. Fabulous. I'm not sure where you would look. Um, where did you go out for a cream tea with Dua Lipa? It, it, was, it looked like Burford or one oh. of those quintessential little, little villages. Very nice. Yeah, lovely. Yeah. Very nice. We went on safari together as well. Oh, did you? We did. Very nice. <laughs> She's a yeah. talented lady, is Dua Lipa. Very beautiful too. Love her. Um, yeah. Four ninety nine, amazing! Congratulations, everybody! Make sure you are checking out. Your elephants are coming up on the back of this auction, and I think these would go beautifully with the elephants. Actually, um, make sure you stay where you are on those phone lines. Heads up! We are rapidly approaching right. your nine o'clock hour with Mark's beautiful Botswana, but also the closure of each item in this hour. Now, is there a single species on? Well, I know that's a sweeping statement, but. Everybody loves elephants, don't they? What's not to love about an mm. elephant? I reckon 99% of the country have an elephant ornament in their house or in the kitchen or in, in a, every, everyone. Yes. And if you're into feng shui, you have to have an elephant, don't you? Yeah, they're lucky, aren't they? Very, very yeah. lucky. Well, we'll talk about yeah. that during yeah. this next opportunity. Elephants, you know, mm. are quite often featured in jewellery for many a yeah. reasons. You don't just get the one charm, though. You are getting all four with a little bell inside that we've Very just cute. discovered. Your really bird is up next. So you say every household should have an elephant? I think so. I'm just to think, if we've, I think we've got one in our, we've in our got, bathroom. We've got yeah. one. We've got one, um, uh, but only to recently, actually, because my mum and dad used to collect the Swarovski ornaments. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, and got we've got elephant. an elephant in that. Oh. It is lovely. They're worth a lot of money. Yeah, they, they've got... Yeah. They used to get the ones, the anniversary ones. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Um, so I think we've got a uh, lion as well. They're very yeah. impressive. Um, but yes, in jewellery, elephants are 
incredibly, incredibly symbolic. And I thought we could talk about that because you are getting four beautiful charms. Use this time, though, because whilst we have quantity, I don't think it's going to be enough. No, no. Um, because we have got this fondness to, to this beautiful species. And they are, you know, despite their size, they are elegant. They are graceful, aren't they? And I think we can all just, I don't know, I, I, I relate to them. They're very similar to us in their feelings and um, their family bonds. Um, but as I was saying, in jewellery, what do elephants symbolise? Well, elephants represent strength and good fortune. They also symbolise health and happiness and are thought to promote, to, to promote spiritual well-being in our daily lives. Elephants are strong and nurturing. They are loyal to their family and are determined and protective. Elephants remind us to always be true to ourselves and keep those we love close to our hearts. They also teach us that with a little strength and determination, we can overcome any challenges that arise in life. In Hinduism, elephants hold a sacred symbolism. The Hindu god Ganesha sorry, uh, features the head of an elephant and is thought to bring good luck as well as representing Aww. wisdom. And here's some photographs. Oh, I mean, look, that's just one little elephant charm on, in amongst some turquoise and some sterling silver components. Inspired, it's not, it's beautiful. Not, it's not very detailed, though, is it? I mean, you can see it's an elephant, but... Yeah, and it's £164, mm. which is, I think, quite a lot yeah. of money, especially as it's something that we could definitely recreate, especially yeah, with, easily. say, those yeah. uh, bead caps that we had a Absolutely. few moments ago. Yeah. I've got yeah. another one I can yeah. show you. Uh, family bracelet, loving that. So you've got a hood. Herd of elephants. Yeah, okay. um, next one from Chloe, uh, sorry, Clobo, £91. So it's half price at the moment. Um, lovely, simple, stretchy bracelet and actually a very similar elephant. Yes. Very actually. similar elephant is a decorated elephant. Um, but again, you get four with us, not just the one. Yeah. £91 for that stretchy bracelet. Um, and then lastly, I think we've got a bit of macrame mark, just oh, one perfect. simple elephant charm on some macrame cord. All absolutely beautiful. And the only reason I ever show these is just for inspiration, yeah, effectively, because I truly believe that these are things that you can easily create. Now, with the little bell, your beautiful elephant, symbolic of determination, family, wisdom, lots of meanings behind them. Um, overcoming fears. At $49.99 for four sterling silver charms, not one, that's for all four of them. I'm fairly sure, I don't know, but I'm fairly sure if I was to sort of go into that famous charm shop, the one which oh, is yeah, the most yeah. incredible marketing. 50 pound, 50 quid, do you think? Got to be, for an elephant, yeah, yeah, definitely. Would you get one in there? I don't know. I've never been in there. I have, and they, I, like, I, I have, and I've even, I've even gone in there because I saw a bracelet that I loved and I quite quickly turned around and walked back out again because I realised how expensive mm. it was, but... Mm. Um, yeah, I'm sure I'm fairly sure you'd find an elephant, but it's not going to be 49.99, I don't think, especially not for four no, of them. I might be wrong. I might be wrong. But that's not your early bird price tag. And your <laughs> elephant has a little bell inside, which is ever so sweet. The detail is, is incredible, isn't it? He's a happy elephant too, yeah. an upturned trunk Doesn't is it a mean, happy I, elephant. I was going to say, it's something to do with that. If, it, if it's, it's pronounced all down, it means different things. Yeah, upturned yeah. trunk. Yeah. It's like, it's like a horseshoe as well, yeah. it holds the luck. Yeah. Happy. Oh, Russ said something about that the other mm. day, about your horseshoes being the right direction. Mm. Because your luck falls out if it's the pointing the wrong down. way. I didn't, right. yeah. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. So upturned trunk, happy elephant. Downturned trunk, not so much. Um, we're at £49.99. We've got 120 of these available, but they are absolutely flying out the we door. We could have had 480. Five. We could have done. Yeah. If we'd have split them out, that's yeah. a really good point. Yeah. We could have done. But with the bale as well, so you don't even have to add a jump ring to this. So they are all ready, ready and waiting. Um, if you've got sterling silver chains, bracelets, you could use them in your knotting with your malas, for example. Uh, market is cheap. Nineteen ninety nine. That's five pounds. It's not base metal. This is nine two five sterling silver. Should I hold one up? Sorry, Lauren. They'd be lovely wine glass charms, wouldn't they? Oh, very That'd nice. be really nice. Yeah, but for the for the for the host who has everything, elephant wine glass. Fifteen sterling charms. silver. Yeah. I think they're ace. That's a lovely idea. Four legs, look. Instead of three, we've just seen one for three. No, that one's got three legs, look. This one's got four legs. Oh yeah, some of them. It's like they can't be bothered yeah. with that fourth leg. <laughs> and where's his tail? He's cute. He's lovely, isn't he? Yeah. 
I think they're lovely. Absolutely beautiful. You don't just get the one, though. You are getting all four of them, plus the jump rings, so you can secure them to your piece of jewellery of choice, be that a bracelet, be that knotting, be that um, a chain, be that in amongst your malas. Um, earrings, I think they'd be lovely, because yeah, we just relate to them, the fact that they are incredibly, uh, incredibly loyal, incredibly protective, the fact that they um, sort of nurture and all care for their babies. Some fun facts is that, uh, you know, the grandmothers are often with the same herd. That's you know, right. They never yeah, leave the herd. No. Um, elephants can run up to 35 miles per hour, but as, what is it, but technically they speed walk because <laughs> there's always feet, uh, feet on the floor. Yeah. They can step oh, on a word. daisy and not crush it because they're that delicate. Half the stock oh, is gone. Gosh, what are you doing? Phone lines have lit up. In a minute's time. <laughs> We're going even lower, and that is for all four of your sterling silver charms. Hi, Mandy. Um, wow, I love them. Thank you, jewelry maker. They're amazing. And they ring. They, they're, 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 they've got a little Hang bell on. inside as well. Again? Ready? Yeah. Oh, that is so cute, isn't it? <laughs> Very cute. Adorable. I just turned these into little stretchy bracelets. Yeah, no, absolutely. With your Botswana yeah. that's coming Perfect. up as your kit. Super simple, but I only have 120 of them available, which you might think, and that's loads, Al. Not for a, not for a Saturday morning, it's not yet. Um, and not for elephants. We love elephants. Flying, absolutely flying. I'm going to say it, Dumbo, tragic. Never seen it. It's tragic. Mm. I'm not a fan of Disney. Their cartoons. I've never have been. No, strange. Oh, I, I, I used to yeah. love it. Dumbo was one of the films we used to watch at Christmas. Mm, right. But it's really sad. Mm. Poor Dumbo. If they're not in tights and a cape, I'm not really interested. <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> tights and a cape? As superheroes. A, oh, I see. Yeah. I get you. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I get you. See, I'm not really into your superheroes. No, you're not, are you? No, I much no. prefer. I much no. prefer your animations right. to that. Give me Dumbo or, mm. or any Disney film. But well, that's, that's the joys. We're all different, yeah. aren't we? Everybody loves elephants, that's though. That's amazing. £15. Oh, it is. So that's working out at what? How much is that each now? What, £3? Three, pounds, three six, nine, no, more than that. Four? Three yeah, seventy-five. Yeah. There we go. Three pounds seventy-five for a sterling silver. You could put them on your stall and sell them for a tenner each. Definitely, because it's nine two five sterling silver. On a leather cord. Oh, nice. Just a piece of leather cord. You could sell them for a ten, fifteen pound each necklace, couldn't you? Beautiful, yeah. beautiful. Yeah. I've only got ten yeah. left, so I'll leave it with you. If you press your option one, stay where you are on those phone lines. Uh, don't abandon those calls. Um, now, last of stock opportunity. Um, I'm just. It's coming up straight after wow. the break. We launched these the other day. They are highly metallic in the Very gorgeous. world that we are in right now with pearls being at they're probably some of the most expensive they've ever been and yes that is on the back of the pandemic mm. it has had an influence to the price of pearls and the availability of pearls supply and demand etc um, but even when it was not in the current state even when pearls were being harvested on a regular basis and you know we didn't have to wait the years for uh, those mollusks to mature etc you know a strand like this would be considered. They are all natural colours. You've got um, natural metallic as well, which is incredibly rare, and they are also sizable. They're coming up straight after the break. Last opportunity, high quality pearls. Um, the elephants, by the way, have sold out. Amazing. Coming up also after the break, there is a reason why Mark is dressed like he's on safari. <laughs> um, and that's because your kits are very Botswana yes. themed. And on our, uh, not our last show, the show before that, I said to you that one of my ambitions in life at some point was to make a Botswana agate mala. Have you done I've it? I've done it, look, <gasps> look. Look, isn't that the most, or fully knotted, Ah, Mark, that's that absolutely exquisite? beautiful. So this is the first Botswana Mala that you've yeah, done? Yeah, It's stunning. Botswana it's Mala. Absolutely stunning. And if you're loving it too, maybe that's yeah. one of your goals, then nine o'clock kits are going to be absolutely perfect. Prices, they are right? beautiful. Yeah. Amazing yeah. prices and with facet. Um, don't go anywhere, lovely jewelry makers. Make sure you check out your baskets on your 8 a.m. and join Mark and I after this. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, 
Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Hello everyone, it's Mark here. I'm delighted to be inviting you to join myself, Eleanor and the crew this Saturday, 5th of August. Come and join us on our safari. We've got an amazing lineup, including eight o'clock show opener, the most incredible elephant pendant, nine o'clock, we couldn't be going on safari without Botswana Agate. I've got five incredible kits to show you. I'm not going to tell you about the deal of the day, that's a bit of a secret, but at 12 o'clock, keeping the safari theme, I've got three kits, including the most incredible tassel toppers. We've got a leopard, we've got a lion, and we've got an elephant. So join us all this Saturday morning, the 5th of August. You heard it here first. <laughs> Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Now, I'm just going to tell you there are 10 of these available and that's it. I had the honour of launching them not so long ago and they absolutely flew out the, day, out the door because genuinely, you know, you know how, how, how frequently I say that one of our greatest strengths here at Jewelry Maker is our pearls. Um, you know, I genuinely believe that, genuinely. And I, I buy 
pearls probably more than any other gemstone from jewelry maker and at some point they'll be knotted they'll probably go on to 18 karat gold i might sell some for profit i will absolutely be keeping some uh, for my girls moving forward but um because my experience and i'm going back 24 years um, of when I first started in luxury jewellery was strands like this. Well, you didn't see natural me um, metallic pearls then, but high quality pearls would have been four, high four figures at the very, very least. And I'm not exaggerating that at all. Um, I'm not valuing it. I'm not qualified to do that. But the pearl market has skyrocketed because if you think about it, Pearl harvests were, dr were drastically affected during the pandemic because obviously the harvesters couldn't get out to care for those mollusks. So it meant they all were lost to the sea. Um, and it has put the estimate about a decade delay on pearl harvesting. So the supply and demand, the price of pearls has gone absolutely through the roof, mm. um, especially for luxury pearls like this. Now, even as I said a few moments ago, even when you know all was well and you know the harvests were plentiful, etc., still then a strand like this would have been very expensive. And that's because they are incredibly rare anomalies. Um, now, you know that we can get saltwater pearls and freshwater pearls. The days of freshwater pearls being in the shadows of saltwater pearls are really behind us, to be truthful. Um, and also, you can bleach and dye pearls. Fine, nothing wrong with that. They have their place, absolutely. But natural is best. 100% natural is best. But it is a rare anomaly. And I just want to explain, I know you hate this photograph, Mark, so I'm so sorry. But, um, <laughs> but um, I want to explain to you why and how a pearl will get, like, particularly the strong colours, like your papayas and your purples. So here we have, like, uh, and this was a discovery, um, somebody literally eating, eating their dinner and they found, uh, um, eat, uh, or rather preparing dinner, I should say, a clam which actually had a, a natural pearl inside. So That's amazing, it? amazing. So that wouldn't wow. have been cultured. No. That's a natural pearl. Um, so what an amazing discovery. But the reason why I show this photograph is the fact that it's positioning. Because if that pearl had been more central within the flesh, if you like, of the yeah. of the of the clam itself, it would not have been no. purple. It's fascinating, isn't it? Yeah, it would have been white. Mm. If it had been, uh, um, I don't know, maybe closer to the other uh, circumference, if you like, of that clam, it would have probably been more of a golden mm. colour. But because it was positioned so closely to um, almost the darker part of that shell, that's where it has achieved that natural purple. And the same applies with your strand. But what we've got to consider is... Um, you think how a clam or an oyster or a mollusk, whatever it is that cultures your pearl, the proportions of them, where's the narrowest part? The circumference of that, per, uh, yeah. of that mollusk is the narrowest part. So these will have, have to have been huge mollusks to be able to culture a pearl, a strand oh, of yes. pearls of this size yes. at, that, at that point. Um, and that does bear an influence. That level of rarity, like I said, it's like winning the lottery. That level of rarity uh, um, absolutely is reflected in the price point. And you don't have to take my word for it. Let's have a little look at, the, at Tucson, which I had the privilege of going to um, um, a couple of years ago. So this was a display that was in Tucson. Um, and this was a cabinet, which was, by the way, with armed in America. What's they it? had armed uh, okay. security, et cetera, surrounding it. For example, the red coral necklace was a Sophia Loren necklace. Um, you've got made pearls in there, hand carved. But if you look at number nine, you'll notice that it's a pearl necklace, Chinese culture, freshwater pearl, not saltwater. And it's totally natural in its color, totally natural. Now, that's been displayed at the AGTA Awards as wow. one of the finest pieces of jewellery. Why is it so fine? Yeah, perfect spherical beauty, amazing luster, but it is down to the rarity mm. of that colour. Um, sorry. And also our, our suppliers have relayed that message back to us. They've actually said, sorry, uh, Roscoe, um, they've actually said, look, to source strands like this um, isn't impossible, but it is expensive. Um, strands of this grade are likely to retail for around $10,000 today. Um, next year, you could be looking at double that with the way the, the farms have been affected, aka with the pandemic, pandemic. There isn't many strands right now in the world as it's more valuable to sell these as singles um, at this size. We won't be able to offer you anything like this for maybe five years, and even then it wouldn't be financially viable. So that's our, our suppliers saying, look, expect a price increase. And believe me, the price increase has mm. happened. Um, 
Uh, we're uh, taking these to Hong Kong, not just to the Asian market, where pills are huge at the moment. A huge demand uh, from the West also, after the biggest jewellery house in New York started buying these too. Everyone wants these pills, and, uh, and they're talking coloured pills, by the way. And these pill, uh, farm, sorry, and the farms can't provide. Uh, these are all from the same source. They're talking about one particular parcel there. Okay, so coloured pills are a rare anomaly, and it does, like I said have an influence on the price tag. Now, this is a photograph that I took in Tucson, in Arizona, not this year, last year. Um, that's at wholesale, and you can see, it's, it's actually underpriced, I think. 1,250 US dollars wholesale. Wow. And when you bear in mind, most jewelers work off about, around about 400% markup. Yeah. So that means that's gonna be about, what do you reckon? I'm terrible at maths. Five, six Five, thousand. Five, six thousand pounds or dollars. Yeah. Or dollars. Yeah. And that, I think, is actually quite an affordable strand for natural purple pearls. They are natural purple pearls like yours. Um, flicking forward, I can also show you the GIA are writing about those wonderful, strong, pinkish purple, fresh water, not salt water, uh, cultured pearls, um, talking about how they are... Um, very limited now in their supply and the prices that they go up. You, unusually intense color and larger size for pearls immediately drew our attention. So that's them writing about naturally colored pearls. Um, flicking forward. Now, let's bring it closer to home, shall we, folks? This is Yoko of London. If you go onto their website and you can purchase natural pearls with gold, POA. Do you want to know what that POA stands for? <gasps> yes, price of application, uh, but also £22,500. I, I saw the, um, the split pay just on the picture before, the finance. Go on. He said from £937.50 a month. Per month. <laughs> per month. That's your mortgage. That's isn't your mortgage, it? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Goodness me. Wow. From as little. As little. <laughs> Are you having a laugh? Um, yeah, wow. just, just there we go. I Gosh. mean, they're beautiful, and this is luxury jewellery, and then some, and then some. Twenty-two and a half thousand pounds. So you might think, oh, okay, I'll just get the earrings, perhaps. That's going to be much more affordable, isn't it? Natural pink pearls, love those. I'm um, still going to cost you eight grand, by the way. Eight thousand pounds, and then you have the pink sapphire and diamonds at the back of the ear. Yeah, that baffles brand. me. This but do you know what that notice? Uh, what I notice is it's not the diamonds and the and the sapphire that's at the front. It's the pearl that's at the yes, front. Yeah. So the sapphires and the diamonds behind. Behind, it's strange, isn't it? But the thousand. level of luxury and rarity that we have within these pearls is on another level. Um, there are ten available. Oh, there is no. no dying. Plus, can I just add one last thing? From a normal harvest of pearls, when harvests were you know much more fruitful. Um, let, uh, harvest of 10,000 freshwater culture pearls, less than 10 will be metallic. It's amazing, isn't it? You've got an entire strand of naturally coloured, naturally metallic freshwater cultured pearls. There are 10 available. You'll need to be, look at those. You've got an, uh, sashes of beautiful, warm papayas, pistachios, and purples. These are Baroque pearls, which we absolutely celebrate. They're one of the hottest trends, and you can thank Lady Gaga for that, I think, actually. Lady Gaga wearing them on, on sort of, uh, in the movie House of Gucci, um, hugely has pushed up the desirability for your organic pearls. Look at the start price. I mean, you know straight away that's wrong. Well, we had to do it in one price crash, because we did what? We, should, we could have started from, what do you reckon, three? Three grand. Genuinely, my experience, if I, if, if, if I was, if it, yeah, it, that's our job to do that, is to sort of show you prices that it could be. Um, in my experience of the jewelers that I previously worked at, that's where this, but even more than that, I know. What? Close out deal. Yeah. Hmm. Right. And that was what it said okay. on launch. Hmm. When have you ever known us bring naturally oh, no. metallic naturally coloured pearls of this scale and started at under £500. If you're lucky enough to get those um, bead caps. Ah, oh, lovely. I choose the whole lot. Yeah. I just think they'd be so beautiful. Easily mark 299 Would we all agree that tends to be a price point that we have for a strand like this? In a minute, though, we're going even lower. <laughs> um, 
Oh. You've got your split payments. There's 10 available. It's last chance saloon. First bidder's got well two. Done. Well done. Yeah, this is probably one of the best pearl deals I've brought to air in a very long time. And I actually think it's an error on our part. Yeah. They're naturally metallic. They're naturally coloured. They're huge in their size. Um, you've got between 10 and 13 millimetres. So they, they are that milestone um, uh, of pearl. Each and every single one of them um, has got those wonderful sashes of, of purple, pistachio greens, and they look like they've been coated, don't they, in like oh, wrapped in gold. Amazing. It's all Mother Nature's doing. It was a lovely viewer that messaged you yesterday about her earrings she sold for £350. Oh. I don't know who it was. Gloria. Gloria, that's that it. That was amazing. I know, incredible. That was so lovely to hear. Absolutely incredible. And 100% yeah. and, and right. No, that's incredible. our expectations yeah. for, uh, for pearls of this yeah. grade. We could so easily close at 299 would we all agree and i'd say that's an absolutely incredible deal well done to those of you that have already confirmed this is why i buy pearls from jewelry maker <laughs> and jewelry maker only because i do not know anywhere else in the world genuinely that can do that even if that was a sample 20 centimeter strand that would be incredible yeah but the fact this is a full length strand. even if it was two that's if it's two amazing. pearls wow 149 pounds your split payment That's incredible. It's not coming up. Wow. Just takes its time now. Thirty-seven pounds and twenty-five pence. I had ten. I definitely don't have ten now. I've got two wow. now. Um, wow. uh, hello to you, Francis. Morning all. I think we get so used to jewelry makers' yes, low prices yeah. that we forget the real value of gems and findings. Fantastic prices, yeah. Francis. You're so. It's so true. I totally agree. Yeah. And and we're as guilty of that as any, aren't we, Mark? We are. I think you mm. do become quite blasé. Um, you know, uh, oh, you kind of think, oh, yeah, yeah, pearls of this grade, you know, 100, 299, 499, 149. Oh, 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 we, we've lost the plot, haven't That's we? That's more like it, look, for £37 a month, not £937 a month. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit different. <laughs> They're on a, it's a different, it's a different planet, isn't, isn't it? it? Um, but you know that's yeah that's wow. the ethos of the company is yeah. to bring you that level of luxury at a, at a more affordable price tag but my goodness me there's there, there's limits though aren't there this is unbelievable i wish i had 200 of these when i first launched them a couple of weeks ago we had quantity they absolutely flew i've got the final well one now antoinette jeanette jane debbie lorna and tracy hazel yorkshire they've sold out well done um massive oh, congratulations I've always, wondered with pearls. I've always wondered with pearls I probably, I've mentioned this before. So the, the, the shell closure, I mean, yeah. it's pretty hard to open, and the, mus yeah. the musculature inside that, that mollusk must be extraordinary. So why, after millions and millions and millions of years of evolution, doesn't that mollusk realise that if he used those muscles to eject the irritant... They do spit out. Sometimes they do spit Sometimes it out. Sometimes they do. Sometimes. But you think they'd all spit it out, so... Yeah. But then we, we wouldn't have them, well... Well, I guess sometimes, like, we get things stuck in our eye or we yeah, get... Yeah, it's strange, isn't it? So they get you think things. they'd kick it out rather yeah. than... They can spit listen, out. Yeah. They can, though. Fascinating. Um, naughty little mollusks. Yeah. I know. It is amazing, <laughs> yeah. though, isn't it? Absolutely amazing. Yeah. Um, OK. Well done, everyone. <sighs> Are we ready oh. for your kits? Ooh. Now, Mark, talk us through your beautiful... Show us your jewellery first, because these are absolutely oh. amazing. And you did have a, an ambition and a goal, didn't you, to make... Well, my, I, as I said, when, when I heard that Botswana was coming back, we, I mentioned it, I think it was with you, actually, when we were talking about... I saw David Beckham wearing a Botswana or yes. some sort of Jasper or, or an Agate Marla, and I thought, I'd love to replicate. But we never, we never get the, the, the kits no. with enough gemstones in until today. So we've got five kits... And we've got nine strands all together. I definitely recommend buying them all yeah. and just having a because the, well, they're, they're affordably priced as well for Botswana. Absolutely incredible. So first part, first piece I made, I had to do a mala. It was just, it was just, it just had to be. And I've used some of my tapestry threads that I always use. That, we'll show you that in action when we come to do the twelve o'clock oh, kits as well. Um, and then I made one of my. I love that's this. beautiful. I and love that's that. one of one of the endless. And again, all I've done is I've popped in some little shell pearls just to break up. There we go. I love this piece so much. Yeah, that is so I love cool. that too, Mark. Very wearable. Yeah, I would sell this, this piece here for the price of all of the kits combined this morning, mm. without, without a doubt. I can believe that. Should we, pull them, should we put that in the, middle, in the middle? Oh, yeah. Okay. So we can admire some yeah. of these. Yeah. And then yeah. I've, um, 
I've done this as well. So this is Kiss Cross stations in between these 14 mil rounds that we've got coming up. This, this, this is using gun metal. So I've used six oh, so you've picked out the greys. Yes, yeah, so I've picked out the greys. And again, you, you can do that on every single strand. You can yeah. take the peaches, the pales, the greys, the beiges. You can, so no, it's just, it's just, just brilliant. And I made some bracelets, some earrings, and then I finished with the, um, this, shall I show you this? If I bring with your demo, well. very Van Cleef. So, so this is the front, which is quite nice. Very I've got, nice. I've got a sterling silver heart toggle. Very at the back. nice. Okay, but if we just turn it over. Oh, dun, dun, dun. I can't choose. Side. I can't choose now, Mark. I know it's tricky, isn't it? And that's using the six mil faceted that we've got coming out. So that's, that's what I'm going to demo this morning. Well, should we bring the kits yeah, then? Because as should. you said, which there's five like kits. First? We're going to start with a 16 mil, which if you wouldn't mind scooching yeah. those the over. The faceted. Uh, 16, 16 mil, mil faceted. faceted. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Um, and you're good to go, aren't you? If you wanted to do that Marla necklace, yeah, yeah. you are good yeah, to go. Absolutely. Because you've got yeah. everything that you need. Yeah, yeah. Botswana agate, a very rare variety, only forms in a couple of locations around the world um, and celebrated for these reasons. Look, you get the most fascinating oh, markings that. within your Botswana agate, stories, aren't they? And um, we had a relaunch, look at this one. We had a relaunch of your Botswana, um, what, a couple of weeks ago? Mm -hmm. And it was an entire sellout, but we had nothing like this. We didn't have the faceted, uh, the faceted rounds. Oh my goodness, and we didn't have these sizes. So starting with, um, these are 16 millimeter faceted rounds. You don't just get that though, you also get a strand of your 10 mil, is that right? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, 10 millimeter. Look how perfect this Botswana agate is. You should have, uh, you should be able to distinguish the markings, like pages in a book. Yeah, you can, with every single bead, it's just unique. It's just beautiful. Verses within a poem. Yes. Oh. I don't know where that came from. That's lovely. <laughs> I'm not sure where that came from. But it's true, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Um, and, and to be honest, at £169, um, <laughs> OK, we're going to go with that one. Uh, Adam's just said, like, layers of an onion, oh. which are, if you actually really simplify it, very beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember in my art, in my art A level... I had to, cut, I had to do half an onion. Did you, in your art? Yeah, I had to, I had draw to cut it. it in half and I had to do a feather. Which yeah. was really hard to do. I drew the skin. It was just oh. onion. Oh. So I, I, oh, I wow. magnified it and drew the skin. Wow. Under magnification. I remember school days. Um, £169.99. Mm. Look at the carrot. Wait, you're talking about just shy of a thousand carats of Botswana agate. Um, I don't know if, if uh, you can, if you have my Botswana, just to, just to recap. Um, just to recap. Oh, Mark, they're absolutely beautiful. That's just using two. And that lovely blue cord. How amazing. If you're is. looking for 0.4 Eslon, this is it. This is your 0.4? This 4. is your 0.4, yeah. No. I'd get this kit just for that. Yeah. <laughs> now, when we relaunched Botswana for the first time in ages, the 10 mil rounds on their own sold out for 24.99. Oh, yes. That was the price for your 10 oh, mil. Oh, no. Okay. That's a 10 mil. 16 millimeters we didn't have. So where do you think the 16 Oh, double mil? that. That would yeah. be 50 quid any day of the week. Yeah. 49.99, yeah. So 75 pound plus the cord. We'll just give them the cord. Yeah, yeah. free yeah. cord. That free sounds cord. good. We always say the kit should get a great point deal. Point four Eslon. I'm just going to point that out again. Is that like gold dust then? You can do your double your double um, knotting. Okay. That, that, oh, that I did. yes. Yeah. 74 pounds Amazing. and 99 pence only. So basically it's 24.99 for your 10 mils like on launch. Um, and then fifty pounds for your faceted six millimeter, uh, sixteen millimeter rounds, and then you're getting what? How many? Seventy meters yep. of your point four blue cord. Yep. We call it so. In a, it is, this is Eslon, but it's our version of yeah. Yeah, our so our own in-house version. In yeah, version. That, so it's point four Eslon, which is perfect for your foolproof knotting. Yeah. And the, and the drill holes are big enough to do that with all of these oh, kits. Do you know what, Mark? I bet you've sown a seed now that mm. people want to do Marlers. Mm. And this is the perfect kit perfect, to do it, isn't perfect, it? Perfect, yeah. Um, we, all, we are bringing you a significant saving already. We didn't have the faceted 16 millimetres during the relaunch of your Botswana. Let's <laughs> bring you, though, the kit really? at an even bigger deal. How about if we said we're going to bring you the entire kit 
for the price of the faceted 16 millimeters. Ridiculous. So you buy the 16 millimeters that we didn't have on the relaunch for 49.99 and everything else is for free. I'm assuming we haven't got huge quantity no, of these. No. 30, yeah, yeah, just because of the size and the scale, you know, much like, you know, most gemstones, the bigger the size, generally speaking, the rarer they yeah. are. Botswana is often referred to, um, often referred to as the king of agate. It's natural in its color. This is not bleached and dyed and only found in a few places around the world. The phone lines are absolutely lit up. Kathy, well done. Linda, Susan and Brian, Nicolette, Mary and Laura, June and uh, Murtha, uh, Sharon, hello to you, Fife and Kathy um, and Alison, well done. People multi-buying on this. I only had 30 and that's well over a third of the stock already being allocated. So we didn't have the faceted 16 mils, which, you know, which with Botswana, I think you can really go for the big Absolutely. carrot weights, can't Absolutely. you? So I, as I said, I've used the 16 mil for your gurus and your, and your tassel tops or your just simple earrings. Beautiful, Mark. I love Lovely. And the bigger the size, I guess the easier mm. it is to see those wonderful patterns. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Do you know what it always reminds me of? It's like in places like, I guess, Arizona or somewhere mm. like that, where, um, you know, when they have those really amazing underground caves yeah, yeah. and you've just got this beam of sunlight going through and then you can see the layers of the sedimentary yeah. rock. It always reminds me a bit of that. Like otherworldly, fascinating, but only found in a few locations around the world. We had 30 of them. We definitely do not have that quantity now. Um, half the stock gone? Well over half, says Roscoe. Um, you're purchasing your 16 millimetres, your faceted 16 millimetres, I should say, and you're getting your 10 mil natural Botswana and your uh, 0.4 nylon um, for free, of which is 70 metres. Well done. June, Linda, you've done it. Sharon, you've done it. Laura, you've done it. Carol, you've done it. Um, amazing. I've got Angela. I've got Marion there. I've got so many of you still with it in your basket. Good luck. Next up, shall we do the 14 millimetres and the eights, which is what you made this piece with? It yeah? is, yes. Okay. I expect all these kits to sell out, by the way. Um, oh, there's only 30. So if you love this. I love that so much. And you wanted to yeah. recreate that beautiful piece. Oh, what I like, because in your seed bee stash, you've got your bronzes, your golds, your silvers, yeah. your greys, your beiges, your ivories. There's so many different colours that, that work. Yeah. You just, you just take one bead and then get a, go into your seed bead stash, choose the colours from, uh, from one bead, and it will work with every one of them. Absolutely. That's what I love about it. And, and it works with all colours because it's yeah. earthy tones. Oh, look, look at that. <laughs> it's so cool. These are Love brand it. new strands. They have never been on your... Oh, look at this one here. Look um, at that. Looks like a face, like a little penguin. Oh, it does look like a penguin, <laughs> like a little beak. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. These have formed totally and utterly naturally. So this includes 550 carats of your 14 millimetres. Um, and then you also get 150 carats of your seven and a half to eight millimeter mm. faceted rounds, which I don't think we had during the relaunch. Right. And you're also getting your uh, um, 0.9 black nylon cord, of which there's 10 meters. So you can just thread that. Absolutely. You? So that's what I did the Marla with. That's what, that's this what one. I'm not, yeah, so you can get, so, you, so if you can get your 0.9 through all of those, and I've knotted. So the drill holes are really good. Oh, amazing, Mark, because he was me thinking, oh, is that going to be too big no, to no, go no, in those drill no, holes, no, but not at all. Through them all. The only one it doesn't go through is the point three four that we've got. Fair enough. Up, but all the rest, your, your point nine will go through. Can we borrow that bust yeah. and we'll pop it on, show everybody? Because that's beautiful. First time, we, we think it's the first time we've done a Marla. Or... I should send it to David Beckham. You should. Yeah. I reckon he'd wear that, you know. Would he reply, though? Would he thank me? I think so. He seems well-mannered. He does seem very well mannered, does David? Lots of you there, like I know on first time basis. <laughs> uh, seriously though, we're at thirty four ninety nine, Ross. What? There no. was only thirty available. So you oh, need to be quick God. on this. Laura, straight in there. Well done, lovely, in Somerset. Nicolette, not mess messing around. Alison, Anne and Mary. Dawn, Lincolnshire, Kathy, Angela, Christy, Michelle, Fife. Um, I can't keep up with you. Wow. Bedfordshire, you're there as well. London, congratulations. Tyne and Ware, we only have 30. Um, it had been, up until like a couple of weeks ago, it had been years yeah. since we'd had Botswana Agate. I don't think we did a quantity. diving house. 
and it's the first time since we've been no. back here. So it must be six, seven years at least. I think so. It might yeah, seem the odd occasional it. strand, but yeah. very seldom that you, that we did. Um, I think that's going to be a sellout. We had 30 of those, and they're absolutely flying. Fasted rounds, nine left, but way more than nine of you with it in your baskets. Um, next up. Ooh. Which is? 12 and 6 12 millimetres. And six. Now this comes with like a sari Comes cord. with a mermaid sari, yeah. Now there's 30 available. These are limited kits, that's because it's Botswana. Look how beautiful these are. It is a gemstone that you could just lose yourself yeah. in. Look at these here. It's quite difficult to make jewellery with it, actually, because you just start at one end and you just look at every single bead to the point where I even got my eye loop out and had a look. Oh, did you? Yeah, it's fascinating. It's the areas of translucency that yeah. you see and, and opacity that create these uh, wonderful journeys. And it is basically... Mm. Um, have you got that information, Roscoe? It is, it is, it is basically... Yeah, cause only because there was something in there that talks about how it forms and the poetry that this gemstone mm. actually forms within. Um, there's only 30 of this kit. Um, so here we go. This comes both faceted strands. So this is your um, six and 12 millimeters. And then you're also getting these beautiful colors of your sari cord. I'd never think to use mm. sari cord to knot or thread with. You made some lovely bracelets with this one, didn't you? With the red I did, yeah. Yeah, beautiful. Turn that one around. There you go. Twenty nine ninety nine. The twelve mil and faceted, six mil and faceted. I think the Zari thread is seven nine two five something like that. I think. Oh, look at that. What per spool? For the pack of three, you get a pack of three. I'm so, sure that's about seven ninety five for the three. Okay, that seems fair. Yeah, so you've got your two strands for twenty pounds. But you've also got one yeah. of the most expensive, usually yeah. varieties of agate, and it's wow. natural. Most agate that is um, sort of out there. Most, not all. You know, you've got your Sakuras and your Nanhong, haven't you, which are natural. But Botswana blue lace, natural variety, and that's why it commands the higher price points. Now, I've got. Wow, this is on the verge of selling out already. This kit's wow. beautiful too. 12 and 10 millimetres. So this is the penultimate Botswana yeah. kit. Um, okay, wow. how many do we have of these then, Ross? 50, oh. slightly bigger quantity. I think we're going to need it though. Because um, 12 millimetres and 10 millimetres. Oh my goodness, Mark, these are I really like this. If, you, if, you, if your budget will... Let you will allow you to buy all of the kits. You've got faceted graduation and you've got plain graduation in four sizes. Beautiful. You can do some beautiful pieces. But I also love to mix them. Yeah. I think they look absolutely yeah. amazing together. Plus, you also get your pre threaded silk. Um, uh, so, two meters off, more than enough there, and that's in the 0.5 millimeter. Yeah. 49 pounds and 99 pence only. So, looking at is that right? 70 carats? That can't be. No, yeah. I was going to say my graphics are incorrect now. I've got, I'm looking at the last one. So how many, how many, what sizes are these? 390 and 250. There you go. Thank wow. you. Um, and then you get your Griffin pink, which is like a sort of nude tone. Remember, um, on the relaunch, your 10 millimetres were what, sorry? 24 pounds and 99 pence. Did we have 12 mil? I'm not sure we did. I think 10 was the larger size. I've slept since then though, so I can't remember. <laughs> I love it. I'd love a bedroom with all these colors. Love it, yeah, love, it relaxing, love it, love it, love it. <gasps> what? So the 10 mil were 24.99. How about 10 pounds for, <laughs> no, for the 10 mil, for the 12. Yeah, that makes sense, doesn't wow. it? And you've got your silk in here is free, uh, for free. Um, that, again, going back to when we were babies here at Jewellery Maker, um, Mark, a single strand of Botswana could have been that price tag. Yeah. And I think we had, back then we only had six, eight and ten. Yeah, we didn't have, yeah. We definitely didn't Sometimes have Sometimes had tumbles, yeah, didn't we? Sometimes. Right. Yeah. But every time I used to add Botswana to, say, a kit for Mark or any of mm, the amazing mm. designers, then I knew it would push yeah. the price uh, upwards yeah. dramatically. Um, we've got 50 available. Bigger quantity of this kit. Shouldn't be doing this, especially on the back on the eve, really. 
um, of the relaunch of Botswana. It's probably been, Mark was saying, I agree with you, about six, seven years that we've actually it seen be. it in any yeah. quantity. Yeah. Straight away, you've got people making multi-buys. Uh, multi I don't blame you at all. It is a vision. Um, yeah, right up that I shared, whilst that clock's ticking away, Botswana agate, a stunning stone known for its rich, earthy tones and intricate patterns, making it a popular choice for jewellery makers and crystal enthusiasts alike. But Botswana isn't just a pretty face. It has a rich history and a variety of fascinating properties that make it a valuable addition to any collection. And I totally agree. Um, it's called the Sunset Stone. Oh, I didn't know that. Referred to as the oh, Sunset Stone. That. It's a special kind of agate that's really popular and valuable. Um, it has beautiful bands of white, black, grey and blue. What makes it even more special is that it can only be found in the... Um, see if I can pronounce this right. Um, or should I just say Botswana? Um, making it very, very rare. Bobanong, is that right? Yeah. Bobanong district of yeah. Botswana. 29.99. And that gets you 10 and 12 millimetres crazy, in their size. Crazy, crazy, I, crazy. Yeah, the fact that we are quite confidently saying, look, go back, go back 10, 12 years, um, strands like this would have been probably this price tag, if not more. We had 50 available. Would you like, no, Adam just said, would you go back 10, 12 years? Um, where, um, was, where was I? No, I was here. I just started here, so yes. Um... The only thing I ever say when asked that question, I would, and I'd meet my husband sooner. Yes. I'd meet him sooner. Oh. That's the only thing I would change. I In October, suppose. Andrew and I met 16 years ago. Oh. That's amazing, isn't it? It's 16 flown by. years. Time flies. Time oh, does crazy. fly. Oh. Another celebration there. Another yeah. anniversary. <laughs> uh, 29.99. Well done. There's loads of you there. The finale kit now, lovely jewellery makers. Here's a size we rarely ever see in Botswana uh, and is always popular. Yeah. This is, I love and, this design. I mean, Do you want to put that one on? This is one of my favourite types of memory wire bracelet. So you, you cut five coils yeah. and you have 11 on the outside, a whole coil, then 8 -0. Then you have your gemstone in the centre, and then you you do it in reverse. So you get, and it's so elegant. Yeah. So so elegant. Let me turn it around there. Yeah, yeah. It's just beautiful. I love making bracelets like this, and I think this kit is going to be a ridiculous price. So I've got that one. I've got the I've got the silver and gunmetal. So I've, I've taken all the browns, and then you you take out all the greys. So you can do this. And then a pair of that with the elephant charms as well. Yeah, exactly. And then oh, I love the you earrings. You could suspend an elephant from each of those yeah. loops, couldn't you? Oh That'd my! That'd be really nice, actually. I never yeah. 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 Yeah, That's elephant amazing. tones, absolutely. Yeah, yes, oh yeah. my goodness, look at the start oh, price. No, no. Now this brings you four millimeter Botswana agate with those same visual beauties. You also get your Zari thread, which I think is wow. very complimentary of this beautiful gemstone. They're all totally and utterly natural. That's amazing. We start at 19 pounds and 99 pence, but we are going low. We've got quantity of this kit. 130. And you can make four of those memory wire bangles and I'd sell those for £20 each. Definitely. Any, any day of the week. And oh, I bet they'd fly as well. So elegant. Love this type of bracelet. Yeah, me too. Very, very, yeah. very wearable. Yeah. Beautiful, Mark, as always. And again, if you don't knot, you could use your four millimetres as, a, a, as an alternative Absolutely. to a knot. Absolutely, in between, yeah. They would work yeah. that way. Should we read on just while the clock is ticking by? We've got about 30 seconds, haven't we? Um, because it goes on to talk about, for thousands of years, people have been using banded agates for beautiful carvings, designs called cameos. Oh. Um, uh, the layers of different colours in the agate are important for creating designs. Among the var varieties of agate, Botswana is highly valued because of its fine bands of white, black, shades of grey and occasional pink and salmon hues. These special stones have been used as talismans uh, and amulets since the ancient times and the Greeks were one of the first civilizations to appreciate their beauty and durability. In an archaeological site dating back around uh, 1500 BC, such, a, uh, such as the graves of Griffin Warrior, both plain and carved Botswana agates had been discovered. So this is steeped in history yeah, and beauty. Incredible. Nine ninety nine. My goodness me, when have we ever done Botswana agate at a single figure price point? Well, the, as I said, the Zari thread is seven ninety five. Yeah. What? Oh my so, word! So it's like two pounds. Two quid. 
Two quid for Botswana, I get in a full meal. <laughs> My goodness me. Make sure you're using this time to make your confirmations, lovely jewellery makers. And of course, Ridiculous. as ever, if you have um, any um, questions for Mark, then make sure you drop us a message into the studio. So, Mark, um, are you going to make this amazing, very Van mm. Cleef inspired? It's very quick as well. It's really, it looks really complicated, but it is isn't. Really? really simple. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, really simple. So all you need for your each of your little motifs, you need four of your six mil. Mm -hmm. You can do it with eight, you can do it with four, but obviously you'll need to change the number of CBs you use. Then you will need 15 O's, good old friend 15 O's. And normally I went for silver in the design, but I'll go for black 11 O's just so I can show you the difference in the beads. So I've got a size 12 needle. Yeah. And I'm going to use some white fire line. And the first thing we're going to do, you, probably, you only probably need, I don't know, two feet of thread. You don't need a huge amount. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to thread on four of our six mil. And you can colour coordinate. I've gone for four really vibrant patterned. So that's one, two, three. No seed beads in between. You're just, you're just threading on your four Botswana. And as I said, I'm using six mil, but you can use any size you like. But you'll just have to change the number of beads you use to do your design. Okay, pull that nice and tight. So I've done a couple of knots and you've got your little cube of four. So I'm going to sew away from the knot and we're going to do our first set of beads. So the first thing we're going to do is, can you see we've got the cotton, we've got the thread you can just see in mm -hmm. between the beads. So we're going to disguise that by threading on an 11-0 in between each of those beads. And the reason that we don't do it before, we do it afterwards, is the bead would sit in between the bead, not, not um, allowing the next rows to be added on. So that's the only reason that we do it. I wish I'd use black, actually, on my design. It's, much, it's really nice. It makes contrast, doesn't it? So one, two, three. I like it with the silver, though, too. Four. OK, so that's our first round. So we're just putting one 11-0 in between your four beads. So I've done all the maths for you on this one. So what you'll need to pick up for your first set of arches around your beads are four 15s, one 11, and four 15s. And what we're going to do is we're going to go round, like you do with a with kiss cross, we're going to go round the gemstone into the next 11-0. So you have a little arc. You see it fits perfectly around the outside. Yeah. And all we're going to do is we're going to repeat that so one, two, three, four, and then your 11, and then four. Go round the bead into your 11. So we're going to do this all the way round. Once you've done this little round here, you can stop if you want to. It's got quite a medieval Elizabethan look to it. Yeah. I was just thinking that looks yeah. nice as it is. Yeah, as it is. Very, as you said, very Alhambra. Okay, so four, one, four, all the way around. And then we're going to do the same again. If you've, if you've never done seed beading before and you want to have a little practice, this is perfect for having a go because it's really simple, very effective, and it gives you a, you could probably make one of these once you get to grips with it in about five minutes. So it's a real quick make, and then you just join them all together. Okay, so we've got our first little, little Alhambra pattern. And what we're going to do next is we're just going to repeat it, but in front of the row you've already made. So again, exactly the same combination. So one, two, three, four, then your 11, and then one, two, three, four. And as I said, this is perfect stone because they've got so many different colors and tones in one strand that you've probably got, I would say, a good 50, 60 tubes of seed beads you could use to, that would complement yeah. a whole strand. All those colors, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Again, so 414. God, considering I'm sat two feet away, I'm not doing too badly with the old picking up 15s. <laughs> so I'm going round, and again, I'm, I'm sitting in front of the row that I've already, I've already made. So you can already see we've got two, two rows. And then one, two, three, four, and then again, an 11. Is that screen for this kit, the four mil kit? Yes, wow. they've flown out. Oh, yeah, absolutely flown out. We oh. had what, 120, was it? Oh, 130. 
22 oh. kits are oh, left. Great. But there's loads of people with the oh, baskets wonderful. as well. Oh. Could be a set out this one. You could do micro kiss cross for four mil as well with your 15s. Oh, that nice. would look amazing. Yeah. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to do my fourth of my second row. Okay, so I'm coming up. So you can now see we've been cased twice all the way around. So again, it's like a flat kiss cross, if you like. And then what we're going to do next is we're going to now do another row, but going through the middle. So we're going to use the 11 O's that we did on our first row. And the combination is going to change now. So it's going to be three 15s, mm. three 11s, and three 15s. One, two, three. And what we're going to do is we're going to go through the center this time, 11 O to 11 O. There's plenty of space. So now you can see we, it, it stands out slightly proud around the outside of that bead, just gives you a little bit of decoration. So one, two, three, then an 11, an 11, and an 11, and then one, two, three. So obviously this is the combination that you'd use for a six mil. So if you were using an eight mil or a four mil, you'd have to sort of just decide on the combination that you wanted. One, two, three. So as you see, it's quite, it's quite self-explanatory. Once you work out your combination, you just repeat it for two rows. And then for your middle, you come up with a different combination. So three, three, three. Pull that through. And I'm going to do our last group. So what's that been? Five minutes so far? So it's a quick, it's a very, quick, it's I, a quick mate. I love watching this though, Mark. It's very therapeutic. Okay, and then Relaxing. we're going to go into... So you need to sew through that first 11-0, but make sure you don't sew through anything else at the moment. Okay. So we're going to pull that through. Okay, so that's your completed motif. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you've got your three groups. So what we're going to do, we're going to, it doesn't matter. What I did was I looked at my sides of my beads and I thought, which side has the most pattern? So I think that side is going to have the most pattern. So that's going to be the front okay. of your motif. So what we're going to do next is we're exiting through that 11 0 and we're going to sew up through. So this is the row on the top, so row one, if you like. We're going to go sew through the four 15s and we're going to exit through that middle 11 0 OK, and what we're going to do then, this is where the magic happens, is we're going to jump all the way across into that 11 0. OK, don't pull at the moment because we want, we, want we want to see the magic happen. OK. Then we're going to pull across. OK, so you can see the thread. This will make a really nice ring as well if you want to. Yeah, to. that's a lovely idea. And I've used four Bs, but you can use five, you can use six, you can use three. You just, as I said, you just need to change the combination of your, of your beads. Get that tail out of the way. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to pull <gasps> nice and tight. And you can see we've got that, that sort of Celtic cross. I wish I'd used the black now because it, it does look like a cross, doesn't it? And then all we're going to do to finish is we're just going to go from 11 to 11 to 11 all the way around. <laughs> what was that noise? Oh. Okay, so you're just going to sew 11 to 11. Just, just put, your, put your thumb on the top in between your thumb and fingers and just pull nice and tight. And all you're going to do is you're just going to sew round and round and round until you can't get the needle through anymore. And then you're simply going to cut your tail off, cut your... Um, go through. Because you probably need to go around, I don't know, seven or eight beads before you can't get your needle in anymore. But I'd, I'd rather do that than have to tie off and make a knot. Because however tidy you try to make your knots, it never is. It's no, my, I, I can't. I, no. I can't hide knots. It, not in a no. stretchy bracelet, no. not in... <laughs> okay, so make so sure that's nice and, nice and secure. And then we can go in and we can cut off our thread. So that's our working thread. Nice and secure, we can cut off our tail. And then what I've done with my necklace, I'll bring that across. So that's your, mo that's your motif. So can you see, because you've pulled the back, you've got a small amount in between your little cross on the back, mm -hmm. and then your main ex exposes. Can you see there's a lot more on show of the front? Yeah. So you just need to decide, once you've done your initial rows, which side you want to be the front and which one you want to be the back. And then what I've done on my necklace here, is at the points 
on the front or the back. I've made little picots just to add a little bit of decoration on all four corners. And then to make this, I flip that over. So what I've done, I wanted a bit of weight underneath. So I've taken some of the 12 mil faceted and all I've done is I've using the bottom of Pico, I've taken a piece of thread through mm -hmm. all the way through and tied a knot. And that's got seven 11 O's either side. You can do the other, you can do the bottom if you wanted to and then do another little flourish if you want to. And then using that Pico that I've got at the top, I've just taken a separate piece of thread to make my necklace or you could pop it onto necklace memory wire if you wanted to depending on how you wanted it to Mark, sit. I'm just lo looking at that. Mm. That would be a lovely earring as well, wouldn't it? It would, one, yeah, absolutely. One yeah. section. Just, just, a, just a Pico loop with that hanging yeah. suspended. And, it, and it, it's, it's fidget as well, because it, it moves as well. Oh. Around. So, but that's your initial little motif. And just from pulling the back, A, it becomes double-sided, but also it gives you a little bit of flourish, a bit of design, and then also on the front. If you wanted to, you could do the same with the front, yeah. so you could bring them, I won't do it because I don't want it to break, but you could if you wanted to, you could bring the front forward and then do the same as well, so. But it's a great little thing, and as I said, you can make one in five minutes, make 20 of them and then decide if you want to. You can join them together to make a bracelet oh, on the diagonal or on the flat. Really we don't need little... Van Cleef and Arpels. We don't, We no. just need Mark Smith, <laughs> that's all we need. Um, no, some great. messages Lovely. for you, Mark, as well. Beautiful jewellery, absolutely beautiful jewellery. Um, hello, Patsy, saying beautiful make, Mark. Thank you. Totally no, it's lovely, lovely make. Yeah, make really, that. and it's so lovely to watch as well. Um, hello to you, Margo. Magic. Magic. <laughs> I, yeah, that moment when you cinched everything in. It's just yeah. a pleasure, a real pleasure. Um, another message then from Sheila. Hello, Sheila. Good morning, lovely people at Jewelry Maker. Mark, I love this tutorial. You did this design right. with pearls a few months yeah. back. I love yeah, it. It's gorgeous. Yeah, amazing. And it really does complement the Botswana, yeah. doesn't it? Um, yeah, lots of you showing your love for the beautiful demonstration. And there's more still to come as well in the masterclass. Hello, Tracy saying, hi, Mark and Al. Morning. Do you think this will go with Mukite? Oh, my word. Definitely. Absolutely. Because they're definitely. both earthy, aren't they? Yeah. So choose your four stones and make sure that you, when, once you've made your piece, just turn the bees round so you have all of the colour, you know, all the patterns on the top. Yeah. Because you don't, you don't want to hide them. No. You, you don't have to bring the, you know, the, the corners together at the back. You can have it. Whichever way you like. It, yeah, so. definitely. Well, but I think it would absolutely complement yeah. Mukai. I definitely think yeah. so. Gold and turquoise, that would be stunning, wouldn't it? Well, we said earlier yeah. on, didn't we? We've got that oh, um, yes. Mojave. Mojave. We've got Mojave yeah. uh, um, turquoise coming up that I also think will be fabulous with your Botswana. Yeah. Heads up, stock levels. This kit in particular on your screens has flown out. It's on the wow. verge of selling out. Um, very, very, very limited. Who's just bought five? Diane in Bristol. Diane in Bristol. Yeah, yeah I don't yeah. blame you. I don't blame you, especially if you want to do something like Kiss Cross. And at $9.99, why wouldn't you? Um, yeah. yeah, keep an eye on the other kits as well because they were quite limited. Um, okay. I've got faceted rounds in 10 mils on their own. Okay. Wow. Um, we're going to show you. There's only 20 of them left. I don't physically have it here. Um, so 200 carats are you actually getting. No, um, there we are. Oh, beg your pardon, they are faceted. They're so patterned, it's difficult to tell, isn't it? Yeah. How funny. That was classic L. Yeah, I was just having a moment. I was like, no, 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 no. They're smooth, 10 millimetre round. I watched Lauren, I was like, yeah, but they're 10 mil smooth. They're not it's because of the faceting, it's that, it's that smooth facet rather See? than the half. Mark's, yeah. no, I was Mark's, it, Mark's yeah. defending me. Yeah. Yeah. It, oh, smooth, amazing. yeah, it's a soft facet, yeah. isn't it? Should we call yeah. it that? A Let's soft facet. $24.99, there's only a couple of those left. Um, I've also I got one strand of beautiful tumbles. <laughs> Grab three or four of these and knot them. Oh, and lovely. Knot I love knotting. I really enjoy knotting. And I like tumbles because, you yeah. know, they, they, it's, it's, a, it's a gentle way of wearing jewellery. Does mm. that make sense? Yeah, Much yeah. more casual, yeah, yeah. relaxed. Um, beautiful. We don't see them very often. I think this is the only tumble strand we have, a Botswana agate. What is that? Grab three and knot them. Honestly, it will look spectacular. Six by 99. Yeah. That's amazing. Uh, incredible. Six pounds 99. Just simple stretchy. 
Use that turquoise we had. No, right. the um, appetite. Do you remember the two oh, yeah, that would be lovely in too. between the spaces? Oh, amazing. They've gone, have they? Yeah, sold out. Wow. Uh, fabulous. Well done, everybody. I love Botswana. We're going to bring yes. you that head pin bundle. I've been waiting for this. You have. It comes within the storage, and if I go... And it's not the best display, but, you know, you get... <laughs> You get an idea, but you know, you use this, you could, uh, do you Sorry. know what I would do? I would make this my designated sterling silver head good idea. Yeah. Um, so a storage, uh, oh, storage box. Get? So you get a selection of your eye pins, different lengths of your head, flat pins, head pins, flat and ball. I love that. Which obviously we're not always going to use the same size and same design, no, are we? No. So um, in total, five grams of sterling silver. And how many, how many jump rings or, sorry, head pins? I think there's 80, I think. 90? Wow. And they are 925 sterling silver. Now I launched these. Yeah, this has been dipped into this one here. Yeah, I think, oh yes, it has, hasn't it? Yeah, there's a, uh, yeah you do get more oh than yeah. what I actually have here in the studio. So, um, yeah, that's a, pound, that's a pound per sterling silver um, head pin. Sterling wow. silver. And you also get your storage, uh, storage box as well. Storage? Storage box. I said that earlier. I can't say storage today. They're extra long, aren't they, as well? The ones that by your finger there yeah. on the end. Do you remember we were talking about extra long head pins the other day? I had to do it with wire, do you yep. remember? You have to, didn't, yeah. Because I didn't have any. You need some oh, of these I need then, some don't of you? These. <gasps> wow. 20, is that a good price? That's amazing. Five that's, grams that's of 33 silver. 33 pence each. Yeah, that is incredible. That is really when you say it like that, it's incredible. <laughs> yeah. um, so you're getting 10 of each, basically. Not only yeah. are they different lengths and designs, oh, yeah. they're also different gauges. They're 50 mil, so they're the longer. They're the super long ones. Yeah, brilliant. Fabulous. Well done. Oh, you got time because we're yeah. going to dive into a break yeah. so you can grab yours grab those, then. Yeah. Um, amazing. Well done, everybody. $29.99. Um, but yeah, not often we see sterling silver head pins. And when we do, I think it was Amanda, wasn't it, that messaged in saying we need 50-50. We need 50% of, um, of your findings and your essentials and 50% yeah, of yeah. the genuine gemstones. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and I was like, that, yeah. I'm going to take that message back yeah. to the powers that be because it yeah. does make complete sense, no, doesn't absolutely. it? Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, amazing. Make sure you're checking out your baskets, everybody. Awesome, awesome. Now, coming up after the break... We have Kotan, arguably, certainly the most historic, surely, the most expensive, the most desirable variety of jade in the market, and that is Kotan. Um, but this isn't just any old Kotan, if you could say that sentence. This is Kotan with the purest of white, the finest mutton fat quality, and there is no other gentleman that I would want to welcome into the studio other than Dave Troth to bring it to air. It is breathtakingly beautiful. So join us all after this. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. 
You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Makers. Now, genuinely, I didn't think we could beat yesterday. Um, but yeah, I think we've done it. Or we certainly are bringing you the perfect combination, the perfect marriage. And as I said just a few moments ago, there can be no better person to launch them to us all than the wonderful Dave Trump. Oh, thank you, Al. And uh, good morning to every single one uh, of you that are tuned in. Um, I did know that we were going to top what we did yesterday, which was absolutely amazing. It was incredible. The Sanans yeah. gone uh, from Pakistan. But I also knew that we had this in the pipeline. And we are talking about an irreplaceable treasure, the original Jade. So w over the last three years, we've had this incredible journey with Jade. We we've got to know it you know, intimately. We know yep. about Jadeite, we know about the different kinds. Yep. We also know about Nephrite, we know about the history, the cultural heritage, the value, the mining situation. But when we talk about a 10,000 year history with that gem, we talk about well, 8,000 years, going back to the Neolithic period, you mm -hmm. know, there's evidence to suggest that the earliest civilizations there were working with uh, this gem. Well, the original jade is this material. Right. Um, for 8,000 years from this location, this material, when you talk about you know, notable provenance from different locations, we talk about sapphire, it's Kashmir, we talk about ruby, yep. it's Myanmar uh, or Burma. When we talk about jade, Khotan, the Xinjiang province, the yellow Karakash River. This is where the finest material comes from. There's swathes of mines of nephrite jade around the world. You know, there's the ones in uh, North America. Mm -hmm. There are those in Siberia. There are those in uh, uh, Kaz uh, Kazakhstan. There, there are different locations, uh, even in China for nephrite. But the ultimate is this material. And the reason it's the ultimate is because it's the only location that produces what, what is known in the, the trade, like a trade name, as mutton fat. It doesn't sound like a, a very sexy name for anyone that's new. It's like <laughs> mutton fat. It sounds horrible. But that, that is the thing with the Far East. You know, they're not about marketing. They're not about making things sound sexy. They're about saying what you see. And, and that's what I absolutely love. I subscribe yeah. to it. You know, when I think about what we do in the West, and I get it, you know, when they found a blue, a natural blue zoocyte in, in Africa, in Tanzania, they, they, you know, that's the gemological name. It's zoocyte. And Tiffany and co got involved and they said, oh, we don't like the name. We don't think it will sell well. No. So we're actually going to, where's it from Tanzania? We're going to call it Tanzanite. Yeah. You know, because it sounds more beautiful. Here, they look at this material and they say it looks like mutton fat. But it is 
the most expensive gemstone on planet Earth. When we talk about the Imperial Jades, the Barbara Hutton Strand, the most expensive jade I ever sold at auction, $27.4 million. When we think about, you know, my friend Stanley Chu selling jadeite for in excess of three million US dollars mm -hmm. uh, just two years ago. Well, the auction record still stands, but it's still held by this gem. This is more expensive, more valuable, more coveted than Imperial Jade. And when we think about um, the different jades, there's maybe three, but let's say there's two jades, right? Yep. There's Nephrite and Jadeite. That's the traditional two. Yep. The tale of two stones, both known as Jade, uh, shorthand. Um, well, there are two Imperial colors as well. So the original imperial color is the white, or the mutton fat. That's the, you know, that was the material that had imperial, the imperial yeah. court ruling on it, that only the, the imperial court could own it, that's where it comes from. And then when they found jadeite in Myanmar about 800 years ago, they said they weren't really finding white, we know how rare white jadeite is. And the, the imperial color for that region was known as the green, the imperial green, the emerald green, fei shei jadeite jade. I have just spent a week in China um, touring, you know, much of China from the very north and northeast in Donhao, which is literally just above North Korea, where Russia curls round in like a, a forest town, which is incredible, uh, to Shenzhen, uh, to Guangzhou, and then through into Hong Kong. You know, we've been all around bullet trains for like wow. seven, eight hours, you know, internal flights. The one thing that was always mentioned was this material. When I was in Hong Kong, when obviously I finished up on the Canton Road, which I couldn't go to the Far East without going there. It's like their Bond Street yep. or their I don't know, Place Vendôme or Fifth Avenue uh, in the Far East. It's the uh, um, jewellery uh, uh, retail section, mm -hmm. you know, the, the most premium real estate. And it's just a row of stores that offer the finest well, jewellery in the world. And it's all jade. And predominantly, I'll be honest, imperial jade. But the, the, the mutton fat, and I was showing Jake, because I was talking to Jake on the flight over there, and you know he leans on my expertise uh, for Jade, mm -hmm. I lean on his for much other things as well. And uh, we were talking about it, and I was like, it's still, it's still crazy, even with the Financial Times, even with the big jewelry houses working with Jadeite, that the Kotan mutton fat is still the most valuable. He goes, it, it, it's not still though, is it? I said, yeah, yeah, it's still the most expensive. And I took Jake, who's our managing director, our group managing director, you guys know him, you've been on the screen a million times, Jake Thompson. I took him out to the Canton Road, and I showed him the prices. And the, like I said, the whole Canton Road, there's far more Imperial Green Jade out than you're gonna find in this material. Yeah. You have to ask to see this material. And the price, if you know, I saw an $11 million strand of Imperial Green Jade out. Yes. And I wow. also saw a strand of Kotan Mutton Fat, and it was more expensive. And although we know the mining situation, for jadeite, and I want to be really clear, and this is why I always lean on the expertise of the people that understand it. I don't claim to know everything. I don't consider myself an expert. I'm, I'm, I guess I'm very well versed in the West on jade, but no, I mean, there's so many people in the Far East that have forgotten more about jade than I could ever wish to learn in a lifetime. That's yeah. the truth. Though. You know, I could read every book, talk to everyone. Jade is something that you live. And when it comes to um, jadeite, which is this incredible, incredible gemstone, although it was mined out in the summer of 2020, so we now know that there is no mining in Myanmar. There's some mining in Guatemala, but you know, you're not finding the Imperial Green. No. There was for 800 years. Well, I don't know for 800 years. It has been mined for 800 years, but certainly the last 100 years. There's been about 30,000 tons of jadeite mined every single season. Right? And that's not all gem grid. It's not all Imperial Green. A lot of that weight is taken up in the whole rock itself. Yes, yeah, yeah. It's got to be host. carved. But I'm talking about vast amounts of jade that is mined each and every season. Remember, they're going to try and cater to 1.4 billion people. Yep. And everyone wants jade. So although it's mined out, there's still a healthy supply of jade in China because they can't use it all at once. Um, so they would acquire it. They would, they would buy it um, every season, take it into China. That's where it's all processed. That's where it's all carved. That's where all the expertise uh, exists. And then you've got jade dealers, jade wholesalers, whatever it is. So there's still a lot of jadeite mm. in China. Never for once said it's gone. I've said it's mined out. And the problem with that is, obviously, the people that are wholesaling, that their whole business is based on, they go and source it once a year at the end of the season in Myanmar. They bring it back. They buy tons themselves. They bring it back. They process it. That's how their business works. Um, one great example of this is the jewelry house Ilya, who I talked about. Yeah. It's the number one jade destination in the world. They're the people that have sold the fifth most expensive bangle of all time, $3.88 million, the $11 million strand. And basically, they've got a 60-year history of working with Myanmar, okay? Uh, three generations. And what their business was is a wholesale business. Never heard of them before. They weren't called Ilya. Um, and what they did was they supplied the biggest jewelry houses on the planet 
with the world's finest jade, the record-breaking jade, wouldn't have their stamp on it. It would be, you know, for instance, the Cartier Barbara Hutton Strand isn't a Cartier piece. No. You know, it's, it's it is a Cartier, Cartier piece cast. by virtue of the fact they bought that strand in China yeah. and they put their clasp on it and it becomes a Cartier piece. And, and but I'm talking about the people that supplied those jewelry houses, mm -hmm. and I'll call them Ilya, uh, one of those, this family. Now, when the mines closed in 2020, that business doesn't exist anymore. That wholesale business that they had for 60 years does not exist. And the next generation, like I said, it's three generations, which is Stanley Chu, the, the, the son. He, he's very well educated. Um, I, think he, I think he was, I know he's educated in the US. I think it was Harvard. I think he did a business degree. Incredible guy. He was like, when he comes back and he wants to take over the family business, and all of a sudden there is no family business, I'm not saying they don't have jade, but there's no wholesale business because there's no source. Yeah, he was like, well, what direction do we take it in? He was like, well, it makes zero sense to sell this wholesale to the jewelry house anymore because we can't replace it. So what we should do is create our own brand and sell what we have, and we'll go and make the profit. I'm not saying they didn't make a profit. I'm saying you know, the profit is made at the very end of the Yeah, chain, absolutely. The heavier the profits, the line, right? Yeah. So he was like, that's what we're going to do. And that's what they have done. So they opened their store in 2020. And it has just gone from strength to strength. They have the best jade in the world. Like I said, they sold the record-breaking bangle. They are incredible. And the reason I'm telling you this is that there is more jadeite than there is mutton fat. Right. Although this is still being mined, they're not, they're, they're, they've never mined 30,000 tons even in the last 20 years, let alone every season. Wow. So there's l much less of this material in circulation. Mm -hmm. and, and, and you know, compounding that is the fact that the Chinese government did a survey last year and they, they went out there, they looked at it. And remember, it's just had a much heavier investment in the area because now there's no jadeite. So all the miners, the tens of thousands of miners, Chinese miners that were mining and have been mining uh, uh, Burmese jadeite for the past God knows how long, have no other option but to mine the Kotan mutton fat jade. And they've taken in the big mechanized machinery, they're going for it. And the government have come out and said there's six years left of mining. Six years. Six years. And there is still nowhere near enough. Yeah. So what I'm gonna say is although all the headlines are jadeite, because it's mined out, when you get into the nitty-gritty, when you get behind the curtain, when you understand, there's a reason this is the most expensive. There is a reason that for jadeite, let's just say there's an ancient proverb, you know, an anecdotal tale which is it kind of serves the purpose of showing how much the Chinese value jade, and it's that famous saying we always use, gold is valuable, jade is priceless, amazing. For coat and mutton fat, it's a fact. Mm -hmm. Like ounce for ounce, this material is more expensive than gold. What does that mean? Well, I'll show you, like this is 18 mil, I believe. Yes. Yeah, 18 mil, right, extremely heavy. Imagine if that was just solid gold. Yeah. Solid, not like uh, hollow. Imagine if that was solid gold. That's, That's what so we're talking true. about. Weight for weight, ounce for ounce, gram so for gram, true. carrot for carrot. This is more valuable than gold, globally. And you've got this opportunity. You're probably thinking, well, how can you do it? How have you got it? Thank you so much, Adam. This is, by the way, when we talk about cotan mutton fat, what, they, what they're talking about is this tallow-like luster. You can yeah. see it here. It's majestic, it's incredible, it's sensational. And I'm gonna let you into a secret, I don't even know if I've said this on Jewelry Maker yet. I only broke the news to our Gemporia collectors this last week. And forgive me, I'm not going to take up too much more time, so I know you're all chomping at the bit. In 2018, we went to Myanmar. Mm -hmm. You all know that. I remember, um, yeah. And it was an incredible journey. Went with Steve Bennett, who was our founder. I went with Jake, I went with the cameraman. An incredible opportunity. Now, I know people can backpack and travel, and you can go, or you could, before what's happening right now, could go to Myanmar, get a Mandalay as a tourist, cross yep. over the border, do, you know, and, and many people have been there. Mm -hmm. But within Burma, within Myanmar, let's just call it Burma for now, the, the name in the industry, within Burma, there's a, another part of Burma called Magot. Yes. Because you guys know, but it's its own sovereign entity. So even people that live in Burma, that are Burmese, can't go there. Right. Right. So it's it's a locked off area, okay. and you have a separate visa to get in. Really? Yeah. And so in the last 800 years, or the last I don't know, recorded history, it's only been three times in history that Westerners, tourists, or whatever, have been allowed in, granted access. Okay. You couldn't wow. just go. Any, the GIA were, I think, the only people other than us to have gone there, Western, and they went there in 1957, and then it closed, and then you you just couldn't go. This is Magot. I'm not talking about Burma on a wider scale, and so. We were actually planning to go to Nepal. We had this whole trip lined up. Then we got a phone call from a guy that we know who's, who we buy ruby from. 
and he said they've just opened the borders for Magot. Like if you don't go now, they could close them tomorrow. Yeah, you never. You know, it's like now or never. It's one of those moments. And we said we're going. We know a lot of people in Magot because they can leave. We meet them in gem shows around the world, and we said, right, we're going. So we cancelled our plans. We booked a plane. We went out there. We go to Magok. It's incredible. We see. We, we just go for rubies, sapphires, and spinouts. That's what we're there for. Amazing. Did a lot of buying. Uh, documentary. It's on YouTube. It's an unbelievable experience. And we went with Bernard, who you know really well. Yeah. Uh, because he goes to China, uh, to Burma every single season for the past 25 years to buy jade. Mm -hmm. That's his family business. And he was like, I'm interested in seeing the rubies, spinels, and whatever, because he's never been allowed into Magok. Yeah. So we all go on this trip. And it was an amazing experience, as I said. And then at the very end of the trip, Bernard's like, right, guys, I'm going now. I'm going up to Catching Hills. Now, like, forget how educated we are now. And if, all of us are so educated on jade right now without even knowing. Mm -hmm. Back then, the only real information that existed on jade was a half-page mention in The Secrets of the Gem Trade. Yeah. That's it. That's all we knew. Even UL, yeah. who's worked in the industry. Yeah. Like, even the GIA in the 1980s didn't know where jade come from. Mm -hmm. That's the truth. Like, yeah. no, like, the information was so opaque. It was, yeah. it was so shrouded in mystery, and we were like, oh my God, read about this gem. Obviously, I've seen it in Hong Kong at the gem shows, but I've only ever seen the million dollar suites, the, the Imperial Green. I was like, I want to see where this is from. Bernard said, you're more than welcome to come. Again, it's invitation only in the Catching Hills. You can't just rock up there. <laughs> and, but we were with Bernard, and so we cancel all of our plans. We ring home, we change our flights. We're, like, we're adding an extra four or five days. We're going to the Catching Hills. We want to see Jade. The reason that it piqued our interest is because in Magok, when we went to the gemstone market, I picked up a bangle. Like, I'd read about jade, never, ever seen it in the West. And obviously, I've seen the glowing green imperial greens in the books. But I picked up a really low-grade bangle, or what I deemed was a low-grade bangle. I knew nothing. And I was with Roshan, uh, who's a Burmese spinel dealer, so he's fluent Burmese. And I said, oh, could you ask the lady how much this is? Because right? all the ladies do the business in Burma. Yeah. The men do all the mining. Uh, and so I, I remember thinking, I don't even know why I had this figure in my head, because I'm an idiot. I was just like, <laughs> genuinely, I was just like, if this is a thousand pounds, and I thought that was the top end, because yeah. this isn't even wholesale now, this is at source. I was like, if this is a thousand pounds, I'm going to find the money. This was years ago. And I was like, you know, Steve can lend me a thousand pounds. That's what I thought, and I thought I'll pay him back, but I could be the only person in the West to have like a jade bangle. It's like the holy grail. And so I, um, I asked the price, and it was $15,000. Wow. Right? And so we were like blown away. Now we was going to go and see where it's mined. So we go up there and I am going to wrap this up soon. Don't worry, Ross and, and the team. No, this is, say, I love okay, this. Okay, but, like, so, do you know, I've never heard this uh, okay, kind of detail so, yeah. to this. Yeah, it's so amazing. we get in a Land Rover and we drive the whole country all the way up to the northernmost point, which is the Catching Hills. The only way I can describe it is that it was like, a, it was like how I'd imagine the Amazon to be. Yeah. Dense rainforest, wow. you know, mist of clouds above the canopy, wow. like really cinematic, really scenic. We weren't allowed to film, so our documentary that you will have seen on YouTube, which is Magok in Burma, features no footage of the Catching Hills because it's okay. so secretive. Okay. There's gunpoint, checkpoint borders, and they're like, right, no filming, no problem. We go in, there's a clearing in a rainforest. It's just a clearing in a rainforest. And this is the end of every single jade season. It's called the Jade Eye Emporium. And this is where they sell the jade, the miners. And there's dozens and dozens of just rocks, some huge, some small, whatever, just laid out in a field, right? And we walk in and we're like, what is this? this is amazing, right? And um, they are, there's about 100 suited Chinese businessmen stood around. And they're there to buy jade. And I remember uh, just watching what was happening. I don't know if they were speaking Cantonese or Mandarin, because I don't speak either, but Bernard speaks both. And he was translating what was happening. And he was like, they're at $4 million. They're at $6 million. They're at $10 million. And they were buying this jade. It was mad. It was crazy to see. It's like what you'd expect from a really glamorous, sexy, yeah. glitzy Christie's, but it was in a jungle, yeah. right? It was just rocks. And I was like, this is happening in front of me. And it was wild. And then Bernard was there studying the jade. And then he was like, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm here to buy jade for his family business. And that's what he does every year. And that's, then he just spends the year car, you know, cutting carving. it, carving it, selling it. And Steve said, I'll come in with you. Like, let's partner, let's buy jade together. I've never told this story, right? So he says, I'm willing to buy some jade with you. And Steve's vision was, we've just seen a bangle for 15 grand. Yeah. We could be the first people in history to make jade affordable in the West. This is what we do. We go to Tanzania, we buy Tanzanite. We cut out all the middlemen. We could do it for the, probably, I'll stay this unless someone corrects me. And you know, there's a lot of you that work in the industry. I don't believe a Western jewelry house has ever, ever bought rough jade. No. I don't, it's all secondhand, thirdhand yeah. acquisitions. That's how it works. So Steve said, I'm willing to do it. Bernard said, um, 
I'll tell you one thing. I remember that we were having a coffee, right? Because it's like a four-day trip. Bernard said to him, I'll tell you one thing. It's going to be like a big capital investment. It yeah. is, because we're going to buy tons of this material. That's how it works. And he said, and it's always a risk. He said, but I'll tell you one thing. You won't lose money. Mm -hmm. That's all Steve needed to hear. He said, you're not going to lose money, but you also might not make money. Right? That's the risk. He says, because Bernard's expertise, he's not like buying blind that I would. He says, I can tell if there's jade in the rock. I just can't tell what grade it is. Yeah. Right? That's the reality. So he said, we won't lose money, but some years I don't make money. Some years I make big money, some years I don't. That's the, that's the thrill of jade yeah. buying, right? And so Steve said, okay, he said, but the, 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 the real concern is, because the, you know how we work out. We go to Tucson, we buy gems, we send them to India, we have them created into jewelry, and they're on TV in three months, two months. Yep. We're, we're very fast turnaround, that's how we work. Bernard was like, it's probably gonna take three years though to even know if we've made money or not. He said, so you've gotta be, you've gotta be confident that you can tie up that capital Which for this, this amount of time. Which is making sense, those time frames are making yeah, sense. So, so he was like, you know, if that's okay with you, that's the reality. Yeah. And Steve said, and I couldn't make this decision, but Steve said, yeah, let's do it. Right, let's do it. Wow. If we don't make money, we don't make money. If we break even, fine. We took the risk. It's what an experience. Let's do it. I mean, Steve's bought mines before. Yeah. You know, like this is you know, entrepreneurial, visionary. Mm. And so we do that. And we, we, we have never spoke about this. So we bought metric tons of jade boulders, all different sizes and whatever. Super exciting. And then Bernard took that and was handling all the distribution to the different centers, you know, carving, cutting, polishing, whatever. And, and we were going to find out what we had. Then we get back. Then we go to Nepal, um, we go there for the kyanite, and then when we come back from Nepal, we're plunged into COVID-19. Okay, yeah. so, and obviously we went to the Himalayas, no phone reception, no internet, no nothing. We go out there one day, we come back, and they're taking our temperature at the airport, we're like, what's going on? And then, um, quite honestly, we had the opportunity of a, of a lifetime. We went and bought finished jade, closeout deals, because no one else could um, trade. Mm. We managed to get these incredible, and that's, by the way, that's what we've been bringing you for the past three to four years. Jade that we acquired that was finished. But now I'm about to bring you the jade that we acquired in Myanmar. Now, this is Myanmar, this is Khotan, but I'm going to let you know how this happened. So, for the last four or five years, our teams in, in the Far East have been working through our jade. And some of it was, like, not great quality. Some of it, you know, that's the reality. And what we do is we polymer impregnate it dye it, mm -hmm. type B, type C, sell it back into the industry. You know, there's a massive appetite for it. We would have brought that to you, but the problem was in COVID-19, we bought type A jade. Yeah. So then we set this bar so high. So we was like, right, just sell it back into the industry, sell it back into the industry. But then we started finding incredible jade. And Bernard said to Steve, every time we found an incredible boulder, he'd send us pictures and he'd say, sell this. Like into the industry, just sell it. Because what's happened in that time, jade don't stop mining. Price mm -hmm. has gone through the roof. No one can even get rough jade. We're sitting on this incredible stuff. Some of it was so amazing that Bernard was like, sell it. And Steve was like, no, no, because we want to bring that to our collectors. And he's like, yeah, but I wouldn't even sell you this. <laughs> this is the truth, right? And the problem is we're in a partnership with Bernard. So there's been times where we've carved open a boulder. It's insane what's inside. Bernard's taken his half, and it's to his discretion, he sold it. Right, just sold it, made a huge profit. Steve, true to his vision, said, no, we're going to offer this to our collectors. That's the so, ethos, though. Yeah, the so brand. over the next maybe two years, you're going to see a level of jadeite we have no business bringing to you. Because when I did the big closeouts in 2020 and in the subsequent months, when I'd buy a shipping container of Taipei jadeite, the material you're about to see over the next few months, they'd take out. They're not stupid. They'd be like, no, 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 that's not for you. <laughs> you can have all this stuff, which is amazing. It's still type A, still the best value in the world. The only way I can get this Kotan material is trading some of our jade out for it, and that's exactly what we've done. So we've traded some of the finest jade that has come out of, out of the ground. Wow. Like some of the material we've found is insane, like unbelievable. Wow. Uh, and like I said, you're going to see it. And we've done some really special things. We've traded some of it for Olmec that we didn't buy, but Olmec that we have no business buying. And we've, we've traded for this very small collection. You wouldn't believe the amount of jade I had to trade for it. Because this is more expensive than jade. Yeah. This is also coming to the end of its life expectancy. Mm -hmm. And you're about to see carat weights and sizes that quite literally should be 
not just like thousands of pounds, but probably tens of thousands of pounds. Dave, what a fascinating story. Th and, and, and we're often asked that question, how do you do yeah. it then? Like, uh, all I'm saying is if I paid for this, you'd be paying for this as well. We traded for this. Yeah. Okay, that's the reality. Okay. And we have traded Jadeite that has a market value astronomically with what we found for Kotan, for some Kotan. Mm. And we've got the most sensational collection of, of Kotan jade oh my goodness. anywhere in the world. And just so you know, and you go to any authority, this is Jade Artisan, uh, and this was written in 2022. And they say, which type of jade is the most valuable? And they say that, you know, when it comes to green jade, jadeite is generally considered to be the more f uh, valuable than nephrite. It's rarer, it's more difficult to find. The imperial jade, for example, that's the ultimate. However, if you find mutton fat jade, it will still beat the imperial jade on final price. Yeah. It is, I'm saying it, we can never bring you imperial jadeite. Today I'll bring you something more expensive, expensive, valuable, and rarer. That's the reality. When you go to the In Colour magazine, they show what coat and mutton fat should be. It's the top left rectangle there. Yeah. Okay. This is the Hessian jade, the coat and mutton fat, the ultimate material. We brought one strand before yeah. on Gemporia. It sold out in 10 minutes. It's never come back. We've never ever bought another strand. It's 227 carats, very small millimeters. And it was about 300 pounds for that. Wow. I'm this just looking incredible. over to you, it's incredible, I'm looking over to you right now and I'm saying to you, we'll never have these sizes again or these carat weights or this colour, this is 100% natural. This is the original jade, the finest such quality and the most impressive crystal. And this is the material we have no business offering to our collectors. Maybe, or for me anyway, but to you guys you can make your own decision. I, I'm saying this is the most important show we've ever done. Mm. That's why I spent half an hour explaining to you how we can do it. So we can't buy this material. We don't have the funds to buy this material. We have to trade for things that no one else can. Yeah. And we were very fortunate that we got lucky with some of our jade. And we've traded some of it for this very, very small wow. boutique collection of Kotan Mutton Fat. And I am going to say, and I said to Ross a moment ago, I said, go and do your research. To our own producer, Ross, go and have a look online. Go and see what mutton fat is in the Western world. Because I'm going to say something right now that will shock everyone. I don't, I don't think there is mutton fat of this grade available in the Western world. Not with that Even purity. though it's on jewellery maker. The size, the carat weights, yeah. the matching. This is, unfortunately, we, we traded for as much as we could get. And that's not a lot. Like, you, you, believe it or not, there's not endless supplies of this material. Mm -hmm. But you are about to get the best of the best. It doesn't actually get better than what we're bringing. It doesn't get larger. It doesn't get bigger. It doesn't get finer. This is it. This is where we peak. This is four years in. The most sensational showcase we'll ever offer. The um, ultimate. And and again, highlights Dave just how important it is that you you know you go on these journeys. Yeah, yeah. You go on these travels mm -hmm. because had you have not, yeah, oh, yeah. then this wouldn't be possible. This wouldn't be happening. Yeah. The material that is more valuable than gold. Jade from China's West surpasses gold in value. That's the New York Times saying that. It's not some obscure Chinese publication no. or an anecdote from 300 years ago from Wang yeah. Shao in some Chinese literature. Ounce for ounce, the finest jade, the finest of all the jade, yeah. has become more valuable than gold with the most prized nuggets, like small amounts of mutton fat jade, which is so named for its marbled uh, white consistency fetched $3,000 an ounce, which is a tenfold increase from a decade ago. It's doubled in value every single year for the last 10 years. Do you know, one of the things that's really registered with me with this conversation over the last half hour, Dave, was the fact that you said, look, if I was holding this and it was solid gold, this is more valuable ounce for ounce than solid gold. Do you know, you say the anecdote, but it doesn't quite register. Whereas today, that, and, and over the three years that we've been learning on this amazing adventure, that's the first time I've actually gone, goodness me, yeah, that is like I, if I was holding a 24 karat gold bracelet, this would still be more expensive. We do get quite complacent. Look at how beautifully pure the most valuable, the rarest of all jades the most historic, Kotan. And I love the fact that Dave's, Dave was apologising then, bless him, for telling us that story. And I was like, 
No, 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 this is fascinating because we're often asked that question. We discussed it this morning, Mark and I. We're often asked the question, well, how? How do you do it? And it's and trade. And I wanted to explain. Yeah, it's trade. And uh, Ross has just been through our own system. Okay. And it's true we brought you mutton fat material before. The largest ever bracelet we ever bought was 12 yep. mil. Wow. That's 18 mil. 18 millimeter. Right? Strands. We've only ever done three strands of mutton fat. They were all 19 centimeters. These are 38. Wow. And they were like, what, half the carrot weight of what we're bringing. Okay. So, these so I'm just saying this is not just the most important show in, in jewelry maker history. It's the most important show or offering or collection of mutton fat anywhere in the Western world. Like we're saying that. And you're about to own it. Yeah. We're going to start with the 18 mil, I think, aren't we, Ross? Wow. I'm going to give you a 30 second clock. There's 50 of these available. I'm just letting you know that straight out the gate. This is material, by the way, and I don't mean to sound crass, it sells itself. I just wanted to tell you how we got it. You see this material, you know Jade, a lot of you know Jade better than I do. I'll show you something else as well. 18 mil. Oh, this is unbelievable. It's huge. It's huge. Oh, I, I spoke to Jake yesterday after the show, and he was also saying about the Financial Times doing that um, They want to do a feature on us, yeah. It'll be things like this, won't Thank it? You. For oh, those reasons. My God, yeah. Like, we're going to record this show and show it to the Financial Times. Yeah. Because there won't be any left. But look at the, look at the glow. It should wow. glow like a light bulb, right? Look at that. It's crazy. Uh, Mark, Mark, I can see you smiling as well. Just, we can't believe it. No. I've never seen this purity of white. No. In any, in any strand or, or piece of jewellery. It is pure. Pure is the yeah. word. Yeah. Oh, my goodness me. Wow. Kotan. Look at the call screen. And I'm just going to be honest again with everyone. Um, when we buy like this, which is monumental, mm -hmm. like the deal we did in 2018, the trade that we've done here, we, we have to think about both channels, right? So Gemporia yeah. and, uh, and Jewelry Maker. Yeah. And that has to be data led. It can't just be like, I've got a gut feeling, right? So we know here at Jewelry Maker that we have a very different type of collector. Mm -hmm. It's not like me buttering you up. I work on there even more than I work here. But we have data that we look at, and we know that you're after something a little bit more special. That's why the offerings are much smaller, much more curated for you. This collection was bought for you guys. It was traded for you guys. Like there, is, there isn't any of this ever going next door, mm -mm. OK? It, it's, it's not going to happen. We don't have the quantity, and we traded with you in mind. The only, the only strand ever that they had at Gemporia was, I think, seven mil. Seven this mil. is 18. Eight, that's staggering. One strand we only ever had. There isn't, I don't, like, we can, you, I've, uh, the reason I told Ross to do the research this morning, live, like as opposed to me looking last night, yeah. is because the, I've done mine too. There isn't anything like this. No. That's why I confidently state there isn't an offering like this in the Western world. There's a nephrite mutton fat jade bangle you found here, Ross, on first dibs. It's sold. It's not the asking price. It's sold for the closer to £4,000. It's opaque. Yeah. Okay, it's, it's beautiful. It's stunning. It's a bangle. Yeah. But Jesus, look at what you've got. You've got 18 it's, mil it's, match strand there. It looks like something out of the Flintstones. It's ridiculous. Yeah. It's so large. It's so impressive. Yeah. It doesn't feel real. No, I agree. That's the size of the oh that's the size way. of the max out point of the Barbara Hutton strand, by the way. Yeah, yeah. In Jadeite. So it was graduated, but it topped out at 18 to 19 mil. So if you want to create a graduated strand, the white version of the Barbara Hutton strand, and if 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 this was a finished jewelry channel, that's what I'd have done, by the way. Mm -hmm. I'd have created that strand and created like 50 of them because the Barbara Hutton's over 27 million, and we know this is rarer and more valuable than Imperial Green. Yeah. I'd have gone and got a ruby precision cut clasp and I'd have put it on a graduated stranded yeah. necklace and I'd have done an identical offering to the Barbara Hutton mm -hmm. but in something even rarer, something Cartier couldn't even do. Even that price on your screen is, it, is just like, it's ridiculous. Like, and I don't mean ridiculous as in it's too high. I mean, I don't think you'd get something like this for that price. No, 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 no. That, that, to, uh, Ross has just said in my ear, that's 44 carats. In each, in, in each in, round. In each round. Okay, then I'm going to go even one step further. We've never done a single even carving of mutton fat next door to that caraway. Yeah, well. And you've yeah. got, I mean, you've got 530 carats. 
Yeah. Ross has found a carving here, mutton fat, white, nephrite, jade pendant, certified, as is ours. You're closer to 3,000 pounds. And, and, and we're casually like offering 530 carats. It's just wire wrapped. Yeah. Just wire wrapped at the top. On cord. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just on a bit of cord. That's the value of this material. Yeah, I mean, it is this, like I said, it's not even anecdotal. It is more valuable than gold out Yeah. Do, again, I, I said it a few moments ago, that's really, really resonated with me, Dave. Mm -hmm. The fact that you said, look, I could hold this, this bracelet. Mm -hmm. And it'd be solid 24 karat gold. Yeah. And you'd, everyone would think, oh my goodness me, that's so yeah. expensive. But the reality is, this is far yeah. more valuable. Yeah. And not just to the Chinese, but globally. Yeah. That's the price for Kotan mutton fat. And it's only going one way because there's six years at best left of mining of it. Mm. And there's never been much of it. There you go. I have the 12 mil bracelet and the color is pure white. Gorgeous piece. Thank you, Suja. Yeah. Wonderful to have your message this morning. Um, it looks like clouds trapped in a sphere. Yeah, there's yeah. those plumes of, of color, that tallow-like luster we talk about. I'm going to give you um, a 30-second clock, and we're going to take, uh, uh, um, you know, thousands and thousands and thousands off this price. Amazing. Good luck, everybody. A huge, huge, huge congratulations to those of you that have taken the initiative to secure yours, not leaving anything to chance, because this is... I agree. The, it's the most holy grail. Important. Yeah, it's the holy grail. This yeah. is it. Coat and mutton fat. We should never have anything like this. No. Good luck. There were 50, which is incredible to be able to say that. Yeah. 50 in existence. Okay, I'm going to take this straight down to 2,000 pounds from 19,000 or 20 grand. Take that? it down to 2,000 pounds. And by the way, I'm nowhere near done. Nowhere near done. What do you think that carving on first dibs? Yeah. You know, it's not from a Ming dynasty or anything like that. It's a mutton fat, white nephrite, jade pendant, yeah, yeah, yeah. wire wrapped on cord is £2,760. Mm -hmm. And you're already beating that price tag. Oh, yeah. I mean, 530 carats. Uh, let's, let's do um, a 30 second clock and give you an incredible deal. I've said so many times, and I know I, I, I'm not so. I don't know if you'd agree with me because I think I know what, you, what your answer is going to be, but you could so easily put this on first dibs, couldn't you? Not that oh, you God, would, because yeah. not that any of us would want to part with it, but you know, you could so easily do that. Yeah, I mean, yeah, absolutely. Well, there's nothing stopping you doing that. Good luck, everyone. This is going to set the tone for the whole show. We started with 50, lots of multi buys. Thank you for trusting us. Thank you for getting in early. I'm going to go straight, I'm going to half the price straight down to £1,000 and I'm going to tell you I'm not done, which is crazy. I don't know how many we have remaining, but still hundreds and hundreds of pounds coming off this. How many, sorry? 19 left. Okay. In existence. Um, Adam, please maybe just go straight in with another 30 second clock then. I'm going to take hundreds and hundreds of pounds. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. Um, good luck to anyone who wants to own this. Yeah. Truly, I mean that. It's incredible. It's pure. It glows. It's natural. And it is certified, laboratory certified, Kotan mutton fat. Um, six, nine, uh, you know, you know, when we said earlier on, six years left of, of, of mining this amazing gemstone. I mean, it's already the most expensive material um, in the world, the rarest variety of all your jades. Okay, this is going to sell out super quick. Uh, we had 19 left, I don't think we have that anymore. And we're at 999. Thank you for trusting us. Ross, we're going to half the price. We're going to go 499, which is, as you know, far less than a pound a carat. We're at 530 carats here. That's, yeah. that's crazy. We are 499. under a pound per carat. Is that yeah. right? Yeah. Or there yeah. or thereabouts? Yeah, yeah, under a pound a carat. It is the largest size we have ever seen yeah. and will ever see. Yeah, they just don't find material like this. You know, no. They don't come out in huge boulders like jadeite does. It comes out in pebbles, river-worn yeah. pebbles. And you've got to get an 18 mil round. Oh, um, oh I'm sorry for that, Rosie. <laughs> Hopefully this will make up for it. Um, ne never good to burn your toast. Margaret, you've got two. Maker in Swansea's got two. Lots of you multi-buying. 124 pounds on interest-free split payments. Yeah, hello, Mark. I know, but look, we, we never look at the market value. We look at, you know, what, what we traded for it. 
you know, and we give you the best deals that we can, tiny, tiny margins that we operate on here. It's fascinating to know that backstory as well, because, you know, you, we could, and like I said, and it goes to solidify and confirm what Steve said to you on that occasion, um, or to, to Bernard. No, that's not what we're about. We're not yeah. going to sell it to Van Cleef or yeah, 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 yeah. Place Vendôme. Yeah, you we can. To our Bernard, collectors. you can with your half of it. But, you know, we had this kind of mission statement where we said we're going to actually try and make Jedi affordable in the Western world. And some of this we've traded for things that we could never even buy. Mm -hmm. And that's what you've got here, an 18 mil, pure, incredible moment. We're gonna do a minute clock to close on this, We're down to our final 10. Wow. There's lots and lots of you within your baskets. Please make sure you're checking this out if this is the piece that you've fallen in love with. Yeah, absolutely. Good luck, everyone. Massive congratulations. And remember, as yesterday, mm -hmm. Wishlist is your friend and do keep an eye, keep refreshing that website yeah. page. Um, the fact that we had, you know, anywhere near the numbers. Um, uh, yeah, gobstopper like, size. Yeah. Such a great analogy. It really is, that's how huge it is. It's massive. Yeah. The biggest we'll ever see, 44 yes. carats per stone. And the pure, beautiful white color throughout those huge, huge rounds as well. Just a Perfect amazing. symmetry, amazing polish, no imperfections, no discoloration that tallow light luster and crystallized to perfection as you saw the light passing through each and every one of those spheres. Look at how amazing, five chances remain. Yeah. You know, one on a bit of cord. Yeah, 44 uh, carats we said. Yeah. Wow. You know, on first dibs, good luck everybody. Well done. Down to the final five. Stay holding, see Kuruba. if you can check it out. Karen, you just got two, well done. Amazing, absolutely And now we amazing. jump to 16 mil. And for anyone who's intent on building the kind of replica Barbara Hutton piece, mm -hmm. you know, creating that graduated size, this is the way you do it. You get involved on these impressive, incredible moments right now. I'm going to put the two together. Just I mean, please. seriously, Dave, just, just, just look at that. Just. <laughs> it's an embarrassment of riches, that. isn't it? it? It really is. Yeah. It really is. There you go. This, is, this, is just, this isn't even mutton fat. This bangle that you found here is beautiful carving, impressive, nephrite white jade. But you see how that wouldn't and can't become mutton fat because although it's deemed white, it's not that the, the white that we expect or no. need for it to be to be called it's more mutton yellow. Fat. Yeah, uh, and that is fifteen what, grand. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Fifty of these available. Wow. We'll do a 30 second clock to open up the graphics on this. You saw how in demand the previous one was. You saw how uh, competitive it is on the phone lines. You're about to get your chance at the 16 mil in 28 seconds. So here was your 18 that you've just seen. Four chances remain, super over allocated though. Straight into the 16 millimeters again, look. Here in the studios, you know, we're not like we're not like your fancy jewelers, your high-end jewelers. We've got the twinkly, twinkly lights, you know, that's really complementary of all the different gemstones. We have floodlights above above us and TV screens. They can be quite, uh, uh, I don't know, um, quite harsh, I suppose, in terms of their lighting. But yet, look at the glow. Look at the quality, even from distances away. It's pure. Yeah, and, and look, if any, like I know we have the Wall of Fame here. I've never actually been here for it, but I would love for someone to create the Barbara Hutton strand with this. Mm. You know, something even more elegant, even more impressive. And can we, I know we talk about it all the time, can we get a picture of that Barbara Hutton doubly fortunate strand? You got an amazing one up the other day, which they were holding it and they had the black and white image next to it, yeah. uh, Ross. And the, the reason I want to show you that is because these are the sizes we're talking about. Yeah. I think the, the Barbara Hutton piece goes up to 19 mil at the pinnacle, at the peak but it builds out in these sizes. And you can create that, you can get, I mean, go and get like an antique clasp or, or source the ruby clasp, it's worth it. Absolutely. With the thousands that we're saving on this, mm -hmm. spend the money on the clasp, create that incredible look. There you go, thank you, Ross. Imagine that in the Kotan mutton fat. And it's rarer. Yeah. More valuable. Yeah. You hear that all the time, they say the mutton fat beats the Imperial at final price every time. Yeah. No, I can't believe no one's ever done that. Yeah. We should do it. We should. It should be in our museum. Yeah. Alongside the Arthur Ivy mm -hmm. pieces that we have. Um, third of the stock's already gone. Right now for the 16 millimetres. I don't want to yeah. part with the 18 mils just no, yet. No, I get it. Greater London, well done. South Yorkshire, well done. Hertfordshire, well done. Surrey, you've multi bought. North Yorkshire, you're there. Merseyside, you're there. Somerset, again. Another, another maker's just jumped on the phone lines. Let's go straight down, Ross, to £1,000. 
we know what we're going to do here. We know we're going to do something special. And we also know how many collectors are intent on securing this. Mm -hmm. Can I take it a second and put sure. the light through it? Is that all right? If, sure. Apologies. It's pure, absolutely pure white. This one. I'll put oh, the 18 wow. mils down. You know, the finest jade in both variations, jade and the mutton fat. And the mutton fat n should never even crystallize, really. You're asking a lot of the mutton fat. Mm -hmm. To get the colors, one thing. But to get the size is another thing, but to get the crystallization in line with that of jadeite, which should never happen, it should be more of an ornamental stone, is almost impossible. But today, because we traded for such a high quality jadeite, we've unlocked the ultimate, what many would consider oh. the unachievable. Look at that. Unbelievable glow. Glowing like a light bulb. Wow. And these are huge, 16 mil. You can see that tallow. 16, like this. yeah. Wow. And, and just so everyone's aware, if you've just tuned in or maybe you're not aware, I've got to move the light away so you, it doesn't, you know, so you can really see it. But that's not like some parlor trick or some cheap kind no. of trick. That's, this is a jade torch. This was gifted to me by uh, an incredible jade authority in China. And this is how you value jade. It's how, li how, how much the light penetrates mm -hmm. through the chosen jade. If it goes all the way through, especially at this depth, 80, 16 mil, 18 yeah. mil. You'd expect it's it maybe to the surface. 12 possibly. mil is usually your peak, because that's your kind of slice thickness. Okay. But to go beyond that, well, this is, this is genuinely the, the jade money can't buy. Yeah. Yeah, we had to trade for it. We wow. had to trade for it. And that's happened, historically, that's happened before, Dave, hasn't it? We've done, you know, we got whole, we've purchased other gemstones, gemstones with our you know, that's Moroccan it amethyst. Yeah, yeah. And but this is, on another, this is another league. Yeah, this totally. This is truly another league. Totally. Probably one of the Gempora's greatest success yeah, stories. You're not trading say. Moroccan amethyst for this. No. You wouldn't, you could, they wouldn't <laughs> even trade you the mine for this. No, I agree. Um, half the stock right, has gone, 30 everybody. second clock, let's do something sensational. Well done to those of you who are multi-buying. A special mention to those of you who are intent on creating the graduated strand yourselves. You know, they're kind of almost replica, mm -hmm. uh, doubly fortunate. Um, if, if the doubly fortunate is the Imperial Jade, this is the, the quadruple wow. fortunate, isn't it? You know, yeah. it just, it's beyond anything we've ever seen. It doesn't have the same ring to it, but you know. Uh, Lanarkshire, Maker, Maker, Cardiff, Lancashire, another Maker trying to multi-buy. Yeah, good luck. There was only 50. It's a limited quantity. And the Super reality limited. is... Right, so a... let's, let's match the price of the previous one, 18 mil. Okay. We're at 400 carats. Yeah. And you know I'm going lower. I'm going a lot lower. But this is where you can have the confidence to jump on, get involved. Everyone pays the final low deal. Uh, Kotan mutton fat. That means something truly special I'm, to true jade collectors. I'm, I'm curious to know as well, because obviously, uh, you know, this Bernard was very much part of this journey, oh, yeah, so yeah. he knows about this amazing acquisition and these opportunities. But I'm intrigued to know how you would, uh, what would his stance be? Uh, he on thinks we're crazy. Like he thinks we're crazy. We should never be doing this. Uh, Adam, please, may I take another 30 second clock? We'll start it straight away. There's a lot of you already confirming. Yeah. But the, the, the reality is, we should never, ever even entertain the idea of doing no. this. This is why the Financial Times want to do an editorial on us. Because, you know, we are, even though we know about us, we're still a secret in the eyes of the industry. Yeah, of course. The Financial Times knew about us, but didn't know we did things like this. And they were like, we cannot believe it. Yeah. I was on the phone to our editor whilst we was in China and just saying, we've got to go and do a story on these guys. Like, what they're doing is insane. She was there at the Asprey unveiling in January with their 18 million pound jade. And we're telling her, look, we've got the original jade. We've got the biggest sizes. I'm going to go wild right now. I'm taking more than 100 pounds off. What? I'm going to 349. Pardon? 399 should be our price. I agree. We're going to go to 349. We're taking over 100 pounds off the price right here just because we want you to be able to build those incredible pieces, oh. those collection moments. And this is collection defining. The only reason I'm not running for my phone right now is because my hand is in shot. Yes, there you go. <laughs> There you go. Keep oh her in shot, God, because she'll, she'll go. Uh, Karen's got two. Patricia, Linda, Maker, Maker, Anne, Anne, Margaret, Maker, Valerie. We've got uh, Pauline in Cambridgeshire, Elizabeth in Germany, Julian Somerset, multi buyers in Yorkshire, Vesna in Greater London, Gabrielle, Morag, uh, Essex. There are how pounds. many, sorry? 13, lucky number, yeah. isn't it, in, yeah. in China? Oh, yeah. yeah. Very lucky. So 13 individual rounds. That's 31 no carats each. each. Yeah, and just to remind you, the only strand we've ever done next door, like I said, we traded for this, especially for you guys here at Jewelry Maker, um, 
we did 227 carats for a higher price than this. Wow. 227 carats for a far higher price than this, and they sold out. You've got 400 carats at a better deal right now. Goodness that me, that's is, amazing. This is why it's And you've this got business. split payments there as well. There it is, yeah, that's the piece. 87. The only strand we've ever done. Wow. I think it was seven or eight mil. I've actually been a fly on the wall during those negotiations for the trade-off. Yeah. I think I've been fascinated. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and this is it, you know, th th these are those moments that, that are like, this is why I love to talk to you guys and tell you about these special moments in our history where, you know, you're sat with someone who deals in the original jade. We've got the jadeite. And you wouldn't believe how much jade we had to trade for this. It wasn't like for like. No, of course not. This isn't like for like. No. You know, yeah. that's just the, the reality, the sad reality. But look at what we've achieved for you. Look at what we've managed to get for you. Absolutely unbelievable. You know what? You want to do something crazy, Ross? Let's do a minute clock. I'm going to take you for We didn't off. answer then. Oh, okay. Well, that's the problem with not having an earpiece. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it was a rhetorical question. It wasn't meant to be, but we're going to do it. The clock's already started. Sorry, Ross. Um, <laughs> we're going to take more money off. Um, we, we have about 15 chances remaining. We had 50 opportunities. I'm going again. Oh, my goodness. I am going lower for anyone who wants to uh, you know, get involved on this. And by the way, everyone who's already got it, everyone who's already mortified, we're putting money back in your account. Everyone pays the final low deal. That's the other thing, you know, the Financial Times couldn't get their head around. Because it is such a strange model. It totally is. Um, it's, it's, we, it's backwards. So, it's so, it's so, um, we're so accustomed to it. Yeah. Second nature we for are, us, yeah. is what we do. Oh, they were like, yeah. what do you mean? And we were like, yeah, yeah, just everyone pays that final low price. Even if they bought it earlier at the higher price. Yeah, yeah. Everyone pays the final Yeah, price. yeah. You know, when you walk into a car That's dealership something. and you buy a car and then someone comes in later and they get a better deal on the same car, which happens all the time. You yeah. see people negotiate all the time. Yeah. They don't ring you up and go, by the way, someone got a better deal on that Monday. I'm <laughs> gonna, so we'll send you yeah. two grand back. They negotiated better. You know, it never happens. That's why it's so crazy. Ross, we're going 299. We're going <laughs> oh 299. Oh my goodness. And, and, and we that's, such the, that's such a perfect analogy it's though. so true though, isn't it? That's why, because to us, we, we, I always say we exist in a bubble. And sometimes we forget how unique, how revolutionary yeah. we are. Yeah. It's crazy. It's mad. And how many times, by the way, have you spoken to friends and you've got a vacuum and they've got a vacuum, but they've got a better deal than you? Yeah. You know, and you go, oh, God, I wish I'd known. You know, it happens it all the it. time, doesn't it? It yeah. happens all the time. Not here. Everyone gets that final low deal. It pays to get in early. <laughs> it does. You know, it, it really, really does. does. Yeah, and, and you're there now, sitting there, knowing you, you've got it, you've secured it, you've multiple. This is two nine. It's insane. It's madness. It is it's madness. madness. By the way, when we bought this Jadeite, this incredible Jadeite, obviously I'm not going to say the figure that, that Steve paid and what Bernard paid. That's you know, not my place to say that. But you know, there's a lot of money tied up in it. When we buy Tanzanite, Here's mm -hmm. a great example. When we buy Tanzanite, when I buy Tanzanite, we buy 20,000 carats. And I always tell you, we, we buy big because scale of economy, it means you get a better deal rather yep. than buying one stone. So we buy everything, buy all the grades. So we buy like quad A, all the way down to the silver pieces that we put single A. And we pay one price. So say we buy, let's just say, we buy $20,000 of Tanzanite. Mm -hmm. In that parcel, it's one price. In that parcel, you've got the quad A's, triple A's, double A's, single A's of Tanzanite, the different yep. grades. What we have to do, when we process that, is price allocate, mm -hmm. right? It's not all the same price, no. right? Because then you'd be like putting uh, pieces that uh, should be 40 pounds in 18 karat gold or yeah, vice versa, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. So you go, well, th these need to account for that much of the, the price. This, with the jadeite, we didn't. And we're not doing it right now. We traded jadeite. Some of it we, we sold and broke even. Some of it is incredible. And we've traded that incredible material for this. But we've never gone, well, actually, that this should be priced far higher. That, that this is insane what we're doing. It actually makes no sense, even by the way, our standards. Well done. Amazing. The final one. Well done, everybody. Please do stay holding. And remember, wish list is your friend. Absolutely. That's definitely what I'm going to be doing today. Um, now, would you like me to repeat what you've just said? Producer Ross has just said. I'm just going to show you something. Dave, oh. can we be careful now, please? <sighs> I'm just going to show you something, because this is madness. It's a 38 centimetre strand. I wish I had a black top on. In fact, should I hold it in front of this? Yeah. Is that all right? Can yeah, we still a bit see more. This bit way? more, yeah. Oh my goodness me, Dave. As if. That is the white Barbara Hutton. We've never had 12 millimetres. It goes on and on and on. In Kotan mutton fat. I'm sorry, but I don't even want to sell this now.
The like, I was so excited when we did the deal. I was like, this is incredible. Yeah. You guys are going to lose your minds. It's going to be amazing. We're going to be the people that have the best Kotan in the West. And I'm looking at it and I'm just like, we don't, we shouldn't sell this. It's so glassy. It's so, um, you know, highly polished with that incredible. Look, look. at that. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's incredible. I want this. How many of these, Ross? 50. 30 second clock then, please. Um, there are 420 carats in this piece. It's double the length yeah, of, any, than, of, of any other strand. And it's, we've never had 12. No. We've had 10. Never had a strand of 12. This is the largest strand we've ever done. So this is, well, it's all a moment in history, isn't it? It's just the best thing I've ever seen. That with a red silk. I think. Mm. Yeah. And oh, a, and, and a Cartier inspired clasp. That in a boutique in Hong Kong. And again, just before I hand it to you, well, let's put the light through it. Yeah. Because it's just unbelievable. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. I, I can't, I have no words, Dave. That's absolutely unbelievable. This is the most valuable jade in the world. That's it. It's like, the, if any time any one of those has been sold in the last 20 years, it's price and application. That's it. It's price and application. There is no price. Mm. There is no price. That's appointment only jewelry. Yeah. Invitation only. Can, and this is why we're unique. Every single one of you is invited. Can I get uh, permission to jump on my soapbox once again? Mm -hmm. This is why we should be selling 18 karat gold class of the highest quality. Do we not? No. Yeah, well, then we need to speak to the team and get them in. I have. Okay, mm -hmm. then we do it. We do, you do know, it. We, we, sh we should source it elsewhere. This is worth... Look, well, I, I, I mean, it, look, if, if we weren't as reactive, I get too excited. That's the truth. So I'm like, I want to get this on right now. But had I thought about this, I'd have reached out to my friends in Bangkok yep. and got them to have made the precision cut invisible set yep. Cartier ruby clasp. Yep. 18 karat Amazing. gold and platinum. And look, so what if it's a thousand pounds? Yeah. Like, I don't, I'm, I don't mean that in, uh, you know, what kind of money is that? I'm not saying that. It's expensive. It's considered. But it's but worth no more considered than this. No. Look how much we're saving. Mm -hmm. And this should be the most, like, it, it, by any metric, like, just in the real world for a second. I showed you, didn't I, the other day, that 56-point jadeite? Yeah. It's four Yeah, yeah, the tiny cabochon. Yeah, yeah. And, I, I, did and, you, you under... No, El. <laughs> oh, 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 I've got a hole in my roof, literally. Oh, I must have not fixed that. <laughs> Every time it rains, I'm like, oh, God, when's the ceiling going to collapse? <laughs> the, 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 the gentleman, like, five doors down came around. He goes, you know, you got a hole in your roof. I was like, yeah, yeah, I just haven't got the money to fix it, mate. So <gasps> there's a bucket underneath. That's me done. Um, but I wish. I wish. But I'm saying to you right now, there is this incredible jade necklace that yeah. should be price and application. Like, the fact that it's not is just by the way. That's why I spent half an hour explaining to you. Yeah, absolutely. Like, yeah, and I always say this, and it's so silly, but if you, if you ever walk into BMW or Mercedes, mm -hmm. if you're ever you know, lucky enough to do that, I guess, and you're going to buy a brand new car, I don't spend half an hour telling you why. Look, when we tell you the price, you're not going to believe it. It's going to be way too low. You're going to think there's something wrong with it. But let me just tell you why <laughs> this is so cheap. It never happens, does it? That's true. You know what I mean? That doesn't yeah, happen, yeah. does it? You never, you know, if you're, ever, if you're ever looking to buy a house or something, you never go around with the estate agent and the garage before you go in, mate. I just got to spend half an hour telling you why. <laughs> this is so cheap. Okay, there's nothing, there's no gruesome uh, uh, kind of crime that's taken place. It's not haunted. <laughs> What's actually happened is someone traded for this. You know, it doesn't happen. No, it doesn't. But that's the only frame of reference I've got because yeah. those are the kind of prices I'm talking about. People pay the price of a house for Jade of this caliber. People pay the price of a brand new Mercedes for material like this. That's, that the happens. Reality. That happens. I see it. The other, the, the, like literally within the last 14 days, I was in China and I held up. A jadeite strand. It wasn't imperial green. It was like apple green. It was mottled. They were large, though. They were 12 mil. Okay. And I was talking to this guy, and the wholesale price on it was $70,000. What? And this is more valuable than imperial green. Yes. I'm not saying that. Like, that isn't me saying that. No. That isn't me going, guys, this is more valuable than imperial green, because I say so. This is the world telling you 
Why, this is why I said to you, this is the material money can't buy. Certainly not the money we have. We had to trade for it. Mm -hmm. And we got lucky. And like, we didn't get lucky throughout the whole uh, uh, jade that we bought. No. There's a clip of film that I could show you, which I can't show you because it's not on this server, but it's next door, where there was a, I got excited when we were buying all this jade in, in 2018. Like, I know like what I'm doing. I don't even shot. know what I'm doing now. Then I had no clue. Ugh. And some of the jade boulders have windows sliced into them, right? Because they have like a skin on them. Okay. And they had a, a window cut into which they carve away the skin. And it's meant to give you an idea of what's inside. And it was super green, right? It was super amazing. And I was like, can we buy this one? Can we buy this one? And they just, you know, they were like, okay, we'll buy it. You know, buying tons. They're like, we'll buy it. I was in China last week and they'd cut it open. It was terrible. <laughs> I was like, an idiot. And we've got, we've got to dye that material now and, and polymer impregnate it and sell it back into the market, which is fine. But I was like, this is a surefire winner. Don't worry. Like, I'm telling Bernard. <laughs> like, what am I doing? <laughs> I was like, this one, this one, I think. He's there He's like open. studying the jade. I was like, I reckon this one, mate. So just throw that one on there as well. <laughs> what are we doing? Right, let's do a 30 second clock. You're about to get maybe the automatic acquisition. Wow. 38 centimeters. Get yep. yourself, I always love your, um, the thing that you say, you say go and get an antique clasp. Definitely. It's crying out for a solid gold clasp or a platinum. This is a larger carat weight than the previous piece. Yes. That huge 16 it's the mil bracelet. Strand, yeah. Double the length of the previous strand that we've done. Yep. And you've got the largest size that we've ever done yep. in a Cotan. And, and ever, probably ever will. Oh, for is sure. Is that a fair assumption? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Probably ever will. Good luck, everyone. Straight, straight down to 499, and I'm not done. I'm taking what? hundreds of pounds off, but I'm going straight there straight away. Okay. Amazing. Dave, absolutely incredible. And again, like the Financial Times, it's so exciting to hear the story of how. Yeah. How. Mm -hmm. Just it's the symmetry here, that glassy texture, the tallow like luster, the, 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 the light passing through every single one of these, as you can see there, that transparency, that top crystal, that pure, beautiful, expensive, coveted color. I've got something else for you, because you mentioned Antiques Roadshow the yeah. other day. You know, when, when in years to come, mm -hmm. you've got this strand, you've turned it into beautiful jewelry, and you can tell the story, or the story has been told on Antiques Roadshow. This is an acquisition that came about because Dave Troth who travels the world sourcing gemstones, the got hold of it, traded, the Globetrotter, yeah, uh, traded. And that's a story that can be yeah, told. Maybe, maybe. maybe. Um, 30 second clock, please. And we are going to, to shock you because remember, this is a bigger carrot weight than the piece we just saw. Absolutely. Longer good, length. Good luck, everybody. Make sure you use this time wisely. There was, how many did we say? 50? That's staggering, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. There's one Barbara Hutton necklace. Yep. There's 50 One. opportunities. And that, that necklace broke the world record three times. It's still mm -hmm. the most expensive jade ever sold at auction. Jade Eye, not the most expensive jade. This is the most expensive jade ever yeah. sold at auction. And you've got 0% interest split payments. Our graphics are just playing up at the moment. Okay, um, good luck. I see our Susie on the phone lines as well. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's take hundreds of pounds off. Let's get a 299. Two and, and look, this is, we're matching the price of the previous piece, even though it's a much larger carat weight, it's a much longer length because we can, and when we can, we, we, we do, and when we can, we will. Wow. Susie, Anne, Maker, Cheryl, Anne, Alison, Marlene, Margaret, Teresa, Maker, Valerie, you've got two, Gloucestershire, Derbyshire, Surrey, Vermont, Valentina, you're there, County Durham, Gloucestershire, Greater London, four left, apologies. I wish we had more, obviously. Yeah, uh, three. Good luck. There's way more than three people with it in their baskets and also on the phone lines. Again, wish list. Our call centre do call you back. Yeah. If, there, um, if any other opportunity does arise. So, because um, when, Dave, you're never going to be able to do a pass. It's never say never, but it's highly unlikely yeah. that we're going to do an opportunity like this. Yeah, in, in, right. in, in all of our years of broadcasting, not just here at Jewelry Maker, across the entire yeah, partnership, yeah, yeah. this is years, pretty monumental, years, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, it is, absolutely. It's a singular moment that we'll yeah. all remember. Yeah. Um, that one has sold out, I believe. Yes. Go on. Okay. And again, we're going to bring you another opportunity right now. Can we just show this? For uh, a oh, yeah, we need to create. Someone needs to create that that graduated long line strand. Because tops out at eighteen mil. Also shows the quality across every single one of these strands. And by the way, they drape a oh, good yeah. distance across the back of this board as well. So can I just put them all together for a second? Yeah. Wow. If your budget allows. It's perfection, isn't it? And, and just, if, can I borrow the clicker? Sorry, Ross. 
because there's something else I wanted to share with everyone if, if it's in here. That's how mutton fat sold. You know, when I say they're not huge boulders, mm -hmm. you can see them laid out there, tiny moments, tiny river-worn pebbles. Yeah. And you've got this unbelievable collection there. Wow. You know, they're, they're searching in the Karakash River for that. Yep. Yeah, and what they're getting is material like that. You know, you can't, you, that, that material there that's been recovered, how many, you know, how many of those are bearing that pure tallow like white within? Very few, I would estimate. Mm -hmm. That's incredible. The world's most expensive necklace features yep. this gem. In fact, you can see them yeah, in that, sort of round shapes. You see that huge 100 plus carat type 2A diamond? Yeah. That's in a bangle of this material. And then those beads with the diamond sunken into them, as you can see, are also... That, that necklace, by the way, is 200 million US dollars. 200 yeah. million? 200 million. Now, we're about to step into the 10 mils. And you know, Dave, mm -hmm. here at Jewelry Maker, when we start talking about these kind of realms, yeah. it goes... It's, everything speeds up, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Seriously. They that's are... not a jewellery maker to me. That's just, you know, that's a, a boutique somewhere, a gallery, yeah. a Basel world, you know, a singular offering at Christie's, like this special necklace that took 100 years to make. That's what it feels like. Yeah. Is the 50 of these, Ross? <gasps> There's 100. Oh, my God. What is it? 10 mil? Yeah. Right, 30 second clock. We're going to do the craziest deal all morning for you right now. There's 100 of these. And we've seen that number miss out on the previous auctions. Oh my goodness me, jewelry makers. So, oh, again, if your budget allows and you can um, treat yourself to the multiple strands, then do, because this is just crying out to be a graduation, I think. Absolutely exquisite. And again, to hold the two together, show the two together, you can actually see that wonderful continuity of quality, that beautiful purity of colour. So I've just positioned on the board now your 10 mil alongside the 12 mil strand that we've just brought you a few moments ago. I mean, I agree with what Dave has just said. This is, this is a one-off piece of jewellery that you can imagine, um, that you can imagine being sold at Sotheby's, your Christie's and your Bonhams. So right now for your 10 millimetres, certified natural Kotan mutton fat jade. I'm going to cover for you here, because you, you were talking and I know why you were talking, because I left, right? Yeah, I left, you I, went. I'll be honest, you probably didn't <laughs> see it because we're trying to be really professional, but I just walked out. <laughs> I went into the gallery. I'm speaking to Ross and I'm like, one, how on earth have you got 100 of these? And two, I've just bought two of these. So you've actually got 98. Okay. And I'm going to tell you right now, and I'm going to say it straight off the gate, we are doing the most sensational deal. And Ross will agree, we have ever done. Ever done. And we have experience because we've actually done um, a 10 He's mil strand really the before. the best mil. Pardon? Yeah. The best we've, deal. We've done a 10 mil strand before yeah. of mutton fat, but it was half the carat weight, 19 half the length. centimetres. Yeah, it was half the length, half the carat weight. And I wanted to put that in your minds because I'm about to blow that deal out of the water. What? Yeah. This is how incredible, how special, hence how sensational this deal is. And I'm letting you know early because although 100 sounds like a lot, it's nowhere near enough right now. And I'm, I'm going to say that. And I, I, this, what, what are we going to do? We're going to do something a little bit different. I'm asking you to trust me. I've just referenced a strand we've done about a year ago. On our screens, yeah. Half the carat weight, mm -hmm. half the length. Mm -hmm and I'm gonna blow that deal out of the water. This is a deal no, no one sees coming, no one understands, no one knows how great this is gonna be. And I'm gonna just see how many of you do trust us. I'm gonna ask um, Adam for a minute clock, and I'm gonna to ask to see 100 of you on the phone lines. Okay, that, yeah, I, I'm there. That's Visualize how confident... my name in amongst that list. Yeah, I trust my name's 100%. there. So I'm, just ha I'm giving you the heads up, and I'm also gonna say, as a friend, multi-buy. Get two, a lot of you already have. Um, and if my deal's not as good as I'm making out, you can cancel it. Yeah, like, I don't got no problem with that. The only reason I'm telling you this is because we can't make more of these. It's 100 and that's it. And in that's 42 seconds... It's mad that seconds, we've got 100. It is mad. It is it's crazy. It's a pinch me moment, it isn't is? it? Yeah. So, I want, I, look, I, it doesn't bother me. It's going to start anywhere when I call this price. I'm giving you the heads up. I'm saying, I'm, giving, I'm buying you some time. I'm giving you 30 seconds from now 
to, for all 100 of you to get everything in order, whether you want to put it in your basket, whether you want to check it out, whether you want to get two or four, whatever it may be, I'm, I'm giving you time. Okay. And in 15 seconds or 14 seconds, you're going to see why I took the time to tell you how incredible this deal is going to be. Wow. It's unbelievable. Mm -hmm. But that strand's unbelievable at two grand. It's unbelievable at four grand or 1,000 pounds. I'm going to go to 249. And I'm going to tell you I'm not done. You said 249, yeah. Yeah, 249. I'm going to go to 249. Two. From 11,976 pounds, I'm going to go to 249 pounds. You can have your interest free split payments. But I am telling you I'm not done. And that's why I wanted you to get on the phone lines and I wanted you to multibar. I wanted you to get the, the one that you wanted, 10 mil strand. You know you may have the 18 mil, the 16 mil, the 12 mil. You want to create that sensational, graduated, world-class masterpiece offering. I'm giving you a chance to do it right now. Well, what about a multi row? Yeah, imagine that. The fact we have options. Yeah. You know, the fact that we're like, oh, what about this? What about that? How amazing is that? Uh-huh. It's about to get a hell of a lot more amazing. I'm going to ask um, Adam, our director, for a 30-second clock. And this is where it gets frightening. This is where it gets scary. This is where we're going to do something that I never envisaged we could do, that we would do. And to show this, and, and, and not hesitate either, Dave, to go, like, that's the $200 million necklace yeah. that, um, that, 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 that's been commissioned. It features, yes, the finest quality diamonds, and it features um, this material. Yeah. This very material. And you know, the multitude of options that you can work with this. Yeah. You know, here's a, an incredible design. Um, who, who put this together? Susie. Susie. So Susie's put this together uh, with other variations of jade. Eye. 10 millimeters in their size. All right. So I, I mentioned the one other strand we've ever done at this size, which was half the carat weight, half the size, 19 centimeters, half the carat weight. And we actually did that one for 199. How about I give you twice the cotan, twice the length, twice the carat weight for the same price, 199. That's Double the quantity. Yep. Double the carat weight. Double, Double the, the carat length. weight. With that wonderful quality that we've, we've learned from you today, Dave. It's yep. that pure glow. Yeah, that, that mutton fat, true yes. mutton fat. You can see wow. it there. Split payments mm -hmm. are just mind blowing, aren't they? Forty nine pounds and seventy five pence. Uh, absolutely ridiculous. Valentina in Vermont, you've got two. Maker in London's got two. Another Maker in London's got two. Yeah. Devon, you've got two. Hertfordshire, you've got two. Fiona in Greater Manchester, you've got two. And in Pembrokeshire, you've got two. We had a hundred opportunities, a hundred percent natural, cotan material, oh, unbelievable. river worn pebbles, glowing, transparent. Top crystal. And just six years left. Yeah, best guess estimate, yeah. Wow. Ridiculous. Wow. You've said before, Dave, you know, a good few weeks ago, you were saying this is something you don't think people should sell just yet. Oh, my this God. Is something no. that no, you no, no. absolutely Unless you're buying off. two or whatever, but I wouldn't sell it. Yeah. Hold on to this material at all costs. Yeah, and people are doing that, actually, multi-buying. Um, well done to everybody. It's absolutely incredible. We've said it, you know, we've been broadcasting for 13 years here at Jewelry Maker. Partnership's been going for, what, 19? Is that yeah, right? I think so. Yeah. 19 years. Um, and this might well be one of the most historic, monumental occasions that we've ever brought to you. The most expensive, valuable material yeah. in existence. Yeah. More of a, again, I, I'm never going to um, forget that analogy that you said, Dave. If I was holding... Something we understand a little bit better. Isn't yeah. It? If that was all solid gold right now. Yeah, it would be heavy. Mm -hmm. It would be very expensive, yeah. but this is more valuable. Yeah. This is more valuable than that material. Absolutely amazing, and I'll, always, I'll remember that, Dave, uh, for as long as I can. Mm -hmm. And I'd use your split pays if you can, you know, maybe help stretch your budget out a little bit more if you want to collect a few mm. of the, the strands today, because maybe you've got a vision in mind of what you'd love mm. to create. It's easy to slip into that sort of blasé state, yeah, isn't yeah, it, yeah. when we bring deals like this, but... We mustn't. We no. mustn't. It is so beautiful, so historic too. Yeah. It's the story behind it. Um, and watch this space, I guess, in Absolutely. terms of the Financial Times. Yeah, well, they, they are, you know, in talks to come out. 17 left. Uh, do you want to do a minute clock to close this one out? Yeah, let's do minute it. Minute clock. I hope you get through on the phone lines. If not, use our web. 
use our app. Teresa, you've got to. Nicolette, you've got to. Cumbria, you've got to. Heather, you've got to. So many of you. Remember, we started with 100. Wow. 90% of the stock's gone. Yeah, down to that final single-figure quantity now entering in. Well done. If, you, if your budget allows multi-buy, by all means, it's pure, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Huge congratulations. If you've just tuned in, wow. Yeah. I'm glad you did. Absolutely so am I. Glad you did, because this is a, an occasion. And it was only, again, for the benefit of those people that have just tuned in, the only reason mm -hmm. this, you know, this opportunity, this huge opportunity yeah. is, is before us is because of a trade. Yeah, well, uh, like I said, it is the material that money can't buy. But also when you, it was like putting the pieces together of a perfect puzzle there, because you're tripping me and Ma was, what, 2018? Yeah. And you said, like, it's, it, it has to be worked, it has yeah, to be yeah, cut. So yeah, fast forward yeah. three years, that's when we started seeing yeah. sort of jade here at Jewelry that, that was closeout deals. That was, yeah. You know, those are the incredible deals that we picked up yeah. because of uh, COVID-19. Yeah. That happened in 2020 that allowed us to be able to pick up finished goods. And we're bringing you that. And we've been working on this in the background. Well done. Congratulations. Amazing. Stay holding, see if there is any available. Speak to the call center, check the web, whatever you can do. Now on to, look at it from there. I know, the glow, that pristine, incredible, crisp white uh, material with that, like I said, that tallow-like luster. Onto the eight mils. Yeah. Oh my goodness me. Um, but, uh, uh, this is your favorite size, isn't mm -hmm. it? The eight, the six. So yep. what you guys love to work with. This is your opportunity in the finest material we can get. Because it's very wearable. You know, it's something that you could wear on a, on, on a regular basis. Mm -hmm. And it should be worn as well, even oh, yeah. though we're talking about value, astronomical valuations for yeah. a material like this. You know, it should be worn. Absolutely. How many of these, Ross? Same quantity. A hundred. Yes. Right, we're we're going to do a, a ridiculous deal on this one too. We're going to do something truly, truly epic. I know what you're thinking. Does the light pass through it? Does it have that transparency? Does it have that glow? I'm also which... thinking that necklace that you sold next door was still not this size. No, no, it wasn't. You can see this oh, incredible wow. glow. All I'm thinking about is the fact that we've got those beautiful crosses on the show tomorrow. Oh, wow. Knotted was... necklaces with the cross at the bottom. That's a good point. I just think... That's a really good point. <sighs> that's going to be amazing. Oh, Did you yeah, team Jadeite with, with, with Kotan? Yeah. Absolutely, the original Jade... And the next with, generation of Jade, you know. Is this you tomorrow is, with the crosses? Uh, I'm not. I'm not in tomorrow. No. But they'll be here. So there are the the, the you know how few uh, crosses we've ever yeah, done in carved Jade. Jade. Yeah. I've had them once before. I launched. I don't think them I've ever sold seen out. them. No, no, no. Yeah, they sold out. But imagine that on this. Yeah, just that the, the, the that that one you know, crescendo at the base of. Yeah. The, yeah. Sensational. Oh, um, who's relinking? Oh, that would be perfect. Oh, yeah. Right, 30 second clock, we'll bring this live. There's 100 opportunities, we're gonna do something crazy on this one too. Amazing, use this time wisely. You've seen how busy it has been from start to finish, or well, from the very get go this morning. It's been a, an incredible show, a moment in history for sure. These are your eight mils. We've got also your six and also your five, I think they are. Um, but you can create that absolutely beautiful, beautiful graduation. So clock is ticking for the introduction of your graphics jewelry makers. I'm absolutely gobsmacked by the fact that we've got quantities that we've mentioned today. I was expecting it to be a little bit like yesterday and have, look, 50 be the largest. Yeah. That's what I was, my expectations. Can you imagine this with yesterday's show? Oh. How beautiful they would be. Exactly. Again, you know, mixing those two unique colours, the, that's the imperial green colour. Yeah. The imperial white colour. It worked perfectly. Good that's luck. A good idea. The graphics are live. Again, I'm going to ask you guys to trust me. I'm going to ask you to get involved. This is that incredible 8 mil, 38 centimetre, 170, 180 carat mm. of, of, of glossy Kotan jade. The, the original jade, mutton fat material. I'm okay. getting pieces. Susie, like... you've got three. Keith, you're there. Hazel, you're there. Maker, Linda, Emma, Maker, Maker, Ken, Julie, Manchester, Cumbria, Fife, Valentina in Vermont. You know that we're going to do something special here. Yeah. Oh, my goodness me. So, Dave, we yeah. can either do this. Yeah, I, I love it. Yeah, it would work perfectly, wouldn't it? Or you can contrast it with the wow. black. These are coming up tomorrow. Mm -hmm. 
amazing, aren't they? Uh, yeah, and the problem is we went too low on the previous strand. We went too low on the previous strand. Yeah, so that's, that's where we should be here. Now it's got a knock on effect. Yeah, absolutely. I love Adam's rosary link idea. I think that yeah. would just be sublime, wouldn't it? Yeah. yeah. Amazing. The two together. A hundred opportunities, multi buy whilst you can. I'm going to tell you we should be at 199, so let's go to 199, Ross. Let's just go straight there. That's where we should be, but you're right. We went far too low on the previous trend because we've got excited. We, we, we know there's so many collectors tuned in. We want you to get these pieces. A third of the stock has already gone. I've yeah. just be, uh, had confirmed in my ear, Dave. That's where we should be, and I'm going lower. I have to go lower. We know that you expect it. We know that you want to create these incredible looks, you know, mixing the sizes, whether it's graduated or, or you know, more asymmetrical or, or different. Valerie, you've got to. Ken, you've got to. Maker in Devon, you've got to. Lots, lots of you on the phone lines. I'm going lower than the price on your screen Look for 180 that. carats in the 8 mil rounds. Top transparency. Uh, Adam, let's do a minute clock. Let's do a minute clock and we're going to take a huge amount off this. Anne, Alison, Susan, Margaret, Sharon, Valerie, Christine, Ken, Maker in Greater London, Susan, Maker, Maker, Anne in Cardiff, Susan in Hertfordshire. You've got 55 seconds, 54 seconds to get involved. We're going a lot lower. Can you imagine this on an auction site? Yeah, of course. Can you imagine? That's the, the only price? place I can imagine it. Yeah, true, exactly, reality. yeah. Good luck. We're 199. This is utter madness. Yeah. Absolute madness. If you want the crosses, they're coming up tomorrow. Yeah. Um, and a different material, but still. Yeah. Both incredibly valuable. Yeah, they're both jade. Both jade. jade. Jadeite ones, the original jade, the nephrite, the mutton fat, the kotan, the Hessian jade. Yeah, a beautiful. I love this. I absolutely. And there is a green, I believe, as well. Oh, amazing. Um, at 199, use the time wisely. Look at the split payment, Dave. You've said yeah, it so many times get before. Even we shouldn't be able to get hold of these gemstones out of money that you get out of cash machine. No way. No way. But you are today and you're, you're multi buying, you are you know, maximizing your savings. Yeah. 38 centimeters, 8 mil rounds, the best of the best. Yours today. I have to do it. I know I shouldn't, but I have to. 179. <laughs> we have to go lower because that's how it works here and I know it's We don't crazy. have to. No, but, but you know what everyone expects, Elle. We know what our clients yeah. expect and we, yeah. love to, we don't want to let you guys down. So we are going to do what we shouldn't do. Especially when you go back to what the, what, you know, what, what the financial times right. are like. You do what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why? <laughs> Why are you doing that? Just because that's what they want. Because we do. Yeah, that's what we've always it's done. Fun. We don't even challenge ourselves. We don't, have to, we don't even say, well, maybe on this we should probably do an upwards auction. Or maybe yeah. we should try something different. We just go, yep, yeah, we're going to sell it just like we're selling Tiger's Eye. Yeah. Or something else. We're going to go and drop the price and drop the price and do these incredible deals. Yeah. And we're going to bring you the best savings. And that's exactly what's happening right now. Even if we put a zero on the end of that price, we know we're amazing value. Yeah. But to say to you, no, no, because we got a great deal, you're going to get a great deal. That's what we do. And that's why we have such a huge loyal, you know, I was going to say, base. that's why our customer base are, um, you know, tend to find us and uh, stay, uh, with, stay us with us as yeah. well. 59 pounds and 66 pence only. Absolutely incredible. Susie, yeah, you've got three. I don't blame you. Wendy, yeah. you're there. Um, we've got uh, Karen, you've got two. Maker in Nottinghamshire, you've got two. Do you know what, Ross? Let's do it. There's 30 second clock, please, Adam. We're going to go again. Eh? Hey? It didn't feel like a big enough drop. Didn't feel like a big enough drop. Uh, oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> Ross is like shaking his head in the doorway saying we've still got another strand to bring. I know, but this is what we do. Uh, it's not on pre-order, but when we bring you the six mil, make sure you're getting involved because we're not going to let you down. Is it, not... Go on. is it one more strand? Is it one more? Ross, is it? OK. I, I, I blooming hope so with the prices <laughs> that we're doing now. Don't scare me like that. Sorry. Um, okay, one more strand. It wasn't a big enough drop. We should have been at 199. Yeah. Like we, I mean, in the eyes of the market, we should be miles higher. But in the eyes of Jordan Maker, we should have been at 199 for this strand. But we did that in the previous one. We've got 100 opportunities. 149. Oh, Let's goodness. do it. So this is, if you've got one, come in and get another one. Everyone pays the final load deal, whether you got in the first person on the phone lines or got three, or whether you're just on the phone lines right now, you're all getting this mad, mad deal. Those beads on that $200 million necklace, which have got whopping diamonds set within. Yeah. That's what this is, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks like this size with a big diamond in the center. 
that pure, true, translucent, yeah. natural Kotan mutton fat. Amazing. And, and let's not forget, you were saying, would you put this with jadeite? They put it with jadeite. Yeah. You know, yeah, there was true. imperial green jadeite. Yeah. There was mutton fat. You know, they, they put those two together and mm -hmm. created that $200 million necklace. Absolutely incredible. Hertfordshire, Cumber. I mean, there's just so many of you. Look, we want to cater to all of you. We want you to all be able to be successful. We know that can't happen, but we're going to let you know there are still opportunities for you if you call now. And one more strand. So this is the penultimate right now to get yeah. hold of your Kotan Mutton Fat J to say, oh, until next time, it's, it's, that's wrong. Let's talk, to our, let's talk to our team about getting some 18 karat gold clasps as well. I Definitely. Think it's only fair. I will discuss with you, if you don't mind, Dave, because, yeah, sure. um, yeah it's, it, it, it's something we should be you doing. Know, our offering has is, is, is become elevated. Yeah. And we need to make sure our components are in line with that as well. Yeah. You know, this deserves 18 karat gold or platinum. Absolutely. And I love the value we bring you. We still bring you great value, but obviously we know an 18 karat gold clasp is going to be an elevated price, but this, this is an elevated you can offering. Pick them up. Look, Cooks and Gold, you can pick them up for 200 quid. Yeah. And that's a heavy clasp. Mm -hmm. You know, which which is I know is more than the Kotan, which it shouldn't be, but this deserves. But, that, but once again, that just showcases how good this. Deal yeah, is. exactly, totally, yeah. exactly. And I think putting anything other than that could possibly sort of, well, you're, you're showcasing that you val that this is as valuable as it is by complementing it with that level yeah. of luxury. Of gold. I think we do that. I think we 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 go and create a very small yeah. series of clasps. That yeah, we can absolutely. Offer throughout the year. £49.66 and 66 pence on your split. We'll do a minute payment. clock to close on this oh one, guys, goodness. because uh, we, we can see there's a massive queue. There's 13 chances remaining. I don't even know if, we, if it will last a minute, but let's do it. 58 seconds before we move on to the incredible final six mil strand. Oh, You've guessed it. it. We're going to go lower on it. Check out, everybody, if you've seen your name right now, you need to check out your baskets. We only have 11 on our screens right now. And I can see twos being added, added to baskets as well. Yeah. We're going to bring you the six mil next. So just drape, just give, you know, wetting your appetite on that one. But again, it, just the continuity of the quality as well. Yeah, from, yeah. The, from, huge from 18, 18 mil yeah. all the way down to the six mil, it is sensational. Um, Amazing, phenomenal. Dave. It's absolutely incredible. What an opportunity for all of our wonderful viewers mm -hmm. on this wet, blustery, wintry August oh, no. day. Look what you've just achieved. Legacy. We, you, we, we casually throw away the No, this word is heirloom. Legacy. This is legacy. Yeah. This is legendary. Yeah, I agree. Well done. Check out and good luck. If you are told you've missed out, then wish list it. Yeah. It's so important. And now the final offering, the six mil. The most popular. 30 second clock to bring this one live. And we are, I'm just gonna say it, we're going to the lowest price, obviously of the showcase, but we're already, you know, falling over ourselves in terms of the prices. We've gone lower on everything and it has that cascading effect. It, yeah, I mean, there's no other jewelers that, that will do that. No way. Okay. You said it before in diamonds. Oh, yeah. Yeah, come back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, Seven seconds. That person negotiated better. Yeah, exactly. Imagine. It's going to happen for all of you right now. Everyone's going to pay that final low deal. Graphics are now live. 100 carats. Do we uh, have quantity of the six mil? We've got to have 100, haven't we? Yes, thank okay, goodness. Amazing. So I want to see 100 of you on the phone lines right now. Let's go straight down, straight down right now to 179. Nowhere near done. I had, a, I had a horrible feeling then for a second that we were going to have a limited quantity of the six millimetres, which oh, uh, thank goodness is not, not the case. In fact, sorry, Ross, let's go to 149 and we're still not done. I'm going to okay. show the torch through this. Just because we've already told you we're going lower, we're going to show you right now. A hundred of you can get this, or I don't know if you multiply, maybe just 50 of you or whatever, but you're going to see oh. light bulb moments. And this is exactly what they do in the jade. This is what you hope for. To find that glow. And if they were inferior quality, they wouldn't glow. Nope. Is that right? Yeah. I know Ross is saying we can't go lower. We can. You'll have to ring Wayne or IT. We are going lower. And we just have to explain we went lower on the previous pieces. So we have to take this lower. Um, we're going to do it. Even if I call the price and we can't actually put it on your screen, just tell the call center that that's what we said. Because at the minute our system is saying this is our, our, our floor price, we shouldn't be going lower then. Okay. But we're, we're making an exception today. Going well, to finish on a high. 
The trust is there. People are already love. making those confirmations. Mm -hmm. We are already right. Let's, uh, uh, right, minute clock. Ross is busy on the phone to whoever, I don't know who it is, but we're going to make sure we can do this. Minute clock for anyone who wants to get involved. Valentina, Donna, Barbara, Maker, Maria, Tracy, Ellen, Morak. I mean, our, when our own system is telling us we're too low, you know it's a problem. Yeah. Uh, 40 of these have already gone. Okay, well, that was great news. It's still got 60 available. Yeah, absolutely. Still all got 60 opportunities, and we're going lower than the price on your screen. You've got your 0% interest. At the minute, it's £49.66. Oh, it's just amazing, isn't it? Why not? I'm never going to be able to have the opportunity again to never say never, but to have an armful of Kotan mutton fat. Oh, God, yeah. So I'm going to enjoy this moment for the. And I have seen people purchasing across every single one of these strands. So, oh, my goodness, look what's on its way to you. Look at what is on its way to you. Full 38 centimetre strands. You can get the perfect graduation. Let's not forget those bracelets. I'm, I, you know, you can wish list those if it's still saying sold out. Okay, we're going to see now. It's a moment of truth to see if we can actually put it on the screen. Uh, apparently we can, but we're going to go right down. 149, we're taking it to double figures. We're going 99 pounds. Even though over half the stock's already gone, that's what we're doing. If everyone checks out, it's gone. 99 pounds. And your interest-free split payments. Question. Yeah. Where else in the world does Kotan mutton fat for £99? Nowhere. That's the easy answer to that. Nowhere. Um, and, and you guys, that's why I said, go and do your research, take a look around certified mutton fat jade. You know the price, and if you don't, please take a look. Even in your 30-day uh, period of, of, of getting this home, taking a look at it, this is a sensational opportunity. £33 on interest-free split payments. £99 one-off deal. Well Amazing. Done. Good luck. Make sure you're checking out we have how many what's a, a stock update 23 left oh my god Th there's a le there's a lag on our call oh, screen well, again tell. when we're this busy it causes a bit of a lag on our call screen so there are live as we speak 23 remaining don't miss that opportunity we've gone to 99 pounds gone to double figures it's madness really isn't yeah, it? it is. and how much was that necklace next door that amazing necklace the oh, 299 299, which is incredible, yeah. absolutely incredible. Mm -hmm. Take advantage. Let's do a minute clock to close this one out. Yeah, oh, goodness. Minute clock to close this one out for anyone yeah. who wants to get involved. Uh, it might not even last that long, but we'll. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, probably. Clock not. is on your screens. Good luck, good luck. It's pure. It's the purest, the most glowing I, I ever, well, uh, well, I ever probably will say. There was a necklace that you flicked past a few moments ago, Dave. Oh, yeah, there this, was. Uh, the rondelles. Yeah. Yeah, which you that appreciate the... really just how pure this colour is. Mm -hmm. You know which one I'm talking about, that one. There. Yeah, and look what they say. The price for Mutton Fat Jade starts at about $1,000 and tops out at $325,000, with the necklaces on average selling for $93,000. Uh, and that's the first dibs? Yeah. Saying that. Amazing, and this is a better quality. Well, Not a huge amount of gold in that piece either, no. is there? Amazing, amazing. Good luck, the final seven opportunities. Massive congratulations to anybody that has got hold of your, uh, your, your Kotan mutton fat. To say that this is part of your family's legacy is truly oh. incredible. Heirloom. It's sold out. Well done, congratulations. We beat the clock. We did. Um, well done to every single one of you. Uh, what an incredible showcase. Oh, Dave, from, on behalf of everybody watching, oh, thank you. <clears throat> can I just say thank you? Oh, and thank you for <coughs> excuse me, sharing your story. Oh, no problem. Uh, we needed to because, look, yeah. we've just done that for £99. People are going to be like, why? How? Yeah, how? Um, has it happened? I'm going to love you and leave you. <laughs> I know you've still got an incredible show, and Mark's got an unbelievable masterclass coming up that I know we're all excited uh, uh, to see. Um, and I'll be seeing you guys next week. Don't forget, you've got those jadeite crosses. Uh, black, white, and green coming, yes, up, coming tomorrow. up tomorrow. And they're going to be sensational deals. So you're not going to want to miss that. But uh, appreciate you guys joining us. And uh, I always love getting to talk to you, and especially when we get to bring you uh, jewelry of that caliber. Absolutely. Isn't he just wonderful? Dave Tross, uh, heartfelt congratulations to you all. Make sure you're checking out your baskets. And like I said, if you've missed out on anything, wish list. Now, we are going to bring you some closeout deals on your Bursa Jade. Um, in the next 20 minutes and then you've got your wall of fame and you've got Mark's amazing masterclass all about remember those safari animals you've got your uh, leopard you've got your 
Um, lion elephant, and elephant. And lion, that's yeah. it, thank you. Um, so I'm going to make my way over to Mark. Make sure you're checking out. Congratulations, everybody. It's absolutely breathtaking. I'll see you the other side of this. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three, or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Wow. That was amazing, wasn't it? I loved the story at the beginning yeah. as well. Didn't know where he was going with that. No, because then he started yeah. talking about Jade. Yeah. I was like, how is, where's the connection here? I thought the same. Mm. And it was like, ah. 
But I have heard, I know that we trade a, a lot of gemstones and that's what a lot, not just us, lots of mm. gem traders do that. So, okay, well, I, I can't physically afford to buy that parcel, but I have got this, Amazing, yeah. like swaps when you were younger. I was going to say, yeah, it's going to be playground swaps. Is. Amazing, yeah. truly, truly, truly. Sorry, what was that, Adam? Yeah. Um, Mark, now we've got your masterclass coming up, haven't we? They're Which amazing. Yeah. is all oh, about your beautiful safari theme. They're really cool, aren't they? So on yeah. trend. They're massive as well. I, mean, I don't know what the, the, uh, the sterling weight is. Well, it's not That's just amazing. elephants. You've got elephant. We've got a leopard and a lion. They're all amazing. Stunning. These kits are beautiful. Yeah. Big gram weights within and a lovely combination of your gemstones. You might want to incorporate this actually alongside some of your jade acquisitions because yeah, yeah. we've spoken about the meanings of elephants and likewise yeah. I'm sure there is for your lions. Yeah. Um, I was going to ask elephants. Dave but, but he had to dash off. Have we ever done or will we be doing frosted jadeite? We've never, we've not done it before. Have no, we? but I, I doubt they will. Think you don't think they will because it's, it's the thing, isn't it? Because it's the translucency, the translucency, yeah. Yeah, I just wonder what it would look like. Mm. Black matte, I think would look amazing. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Maybe you don't know. I'll I'm no ask, expert. Ask yeah. Oh, there he is. Yeah, oh, he's he is. a ferocious. He is. Yeah, he's massive, isn't They're he? They're so handsome, aren't mm. they? And I love the, the, little, the delicate little little toppers as well. They're amazing. Wow. Wow, coming up. So it comes with the little topper on top. It does. Let me just hold well, those, comes, actually. It's huge, isn't it? Yeah. That's all sterling silver. It's wow. Incredible. So it comes with that little yeah. topper. He's got plus whiskers and everything, isn't he? He's yeah, cool. he's got... <laughs> There's the elephant. Oh, I love the elephant. Amazing. Yeah, and then you've them. also got that tiger. So coming up yeah. in about quarter of an hour, we've also got your wall of fame. But up until then, <gasps> we're going to do... Yep. Yeah, I know, I know what you're gasping. Can I ask Roscoe, f just quickly, for, uh, for the presentation to talk about what Bursa Jade is? I because not everybody will know what Bursa Jade is. Dave mentioned earlier on, he was saying you can get jade from different locations around the world. Um, you can get it in China, you can get it in, uh, in um, Burma, you can, or rather you could. You can get it in uh, Guatemala, you can get it in Siberia, lots of different places around the world. Uh, and you can also get it in... Turkey! Yes! <laughs> You can. That was fascinating. I think that's so cool. Although, no, yeah. I should say, let me correct myself. Mm. Mm. Could. Could. Can't yes, get it now. Can't get any more. Because it's actually yeah. mined out. And the window of opportunity was probably one of the most fleeting. This is totally and utterly natural. Um, and when we think about purple or lavender jade, normally lavender jade will come from Burma and it's incredibly rare because it needs the vanadium to colour, uh, to transform it to, uh, to, to that sort of purple or lavender saturation, much, much paler. Mm, yeah, yeah. Um, and that's very rare in, in Mother Nature and geology. However, in Turkey, in a very gem-rich area, a discovery was found quite by chance. And I'll read you an article. So. Um, not available so far, it starts with. As a result of researches, although green and white jade deposits in many regions around the world um, and have been known since ancient times, the rich mineral deposit containing gemstone quality purple jade has not been reported in the literature until now. Therefore, the world's only known source of, I'm going to put natural in front of that, Natural purple jade is located within this geologically studied region. The most typical raw block of purple jade materials are obtained from uh, the field near Akpinar village. This bulky material, which is fine grained rather than coarse crystal, is known for its very, uh, very suitable for cutting into various gemstones objects. And you can see them hold it, holding the boulder. You can also see where it oxidizes. Which is very I cool. just think it's fascinating. If you and I were out on a walk and we just saw those on the ground, we wouldn't give them a second look. Would no, we? it's incredible. No, the, not these at all. And actually, it was a it? farmer that discovered <laughs> oh, was this. It? So yes, did similarly. Oh. Um, let's read on though, because um, they say the world's only wow. known source of purple jade. They refer to it as the lucky stone. Is in Turkey. Reading on, gem uh, adventurer. Sorry. Oh. 
Uh, the uniquely beautiful twist on the ancient gemstone Turkish purple jade is only found in one place in the world, the Bursa province in Turkey. Um, the true emperor of Chinese jewellery, jade was also prized in Aztec, Maori, Mayan, Native American, Olmec and Toltec cultures. Incredibly beautiful, immensely collectible and undeniably rare. Turkish purple jade is a treasured addition to any jewellery collection. So undeniably Amazing. rare. Yeah. So we, we've just been talking about the fact that, and, and I'm pleased to understand I'm not making comparisons here, but Kotan is still being mined. Mm. Yeah. It's still being mined. This isn't. Um, they go on to say the beauty. Turkish purple jade is also known as Turkianite. Um, has been used as a modern gemstone since the 80s. The base colour runs from grey purple to rich deep purple with various mottlings. These colour variations along with deep green dots and red streaks provide an interesting canvas that highlights the gem's characteristic patterns. The preferred hue is middle to dark purple with a mottled surface. Occasionally you can find bold specks of green and orange along with other attractive variations. Um, I don't know if there's another slide, I'm just trying to remember. One more, and it talks about, two more, I beg your pardon, so I'll read it really quickly. It talks about the fact that this is no longer being, uh, being mined. As the concentration of jade dye in Turkish purple jade is 40 to 60%, Turkish, people, uh, Turkish purple jade sorry, uh, doesn't have the same luminescence as lavender purple jade dye. It's one of the world's rarest varieties. Nevertheless, Turkish purple jade has a similar scarcity and price. That's so important. Amazing, yeah. Um, so we talk, we've just been talking about how valuable and expensive jade dye is. This has got a similar price. Turkish purple jade is extremely difficult to source. The quality and prices vary depending on the colour and inclusions. As Turkish purple jade's sole source is now depleted, once our supply is exhausted, there is no more. I'm going to end there yeah. because that's it. Mm -hmm. Once I, And that goes for everywhere, not just us, everywhere in the world. Once it's gone, it's gone. And then I casually say, I'll tell you what, just for kicks, let's do some close-out deals, shall we? Just for kicks. You love this, don't you? I love you? it. I think it's fascinating. It reminds me of... Charite. Charite, yeah. thank you, which we don't see anymore. No. Nope. Um, that, that's what I thought it was when it first arrived on the desk. But to realise that, that you would, I think you, it was you that introduced me to this and told me that it was a form of jade, I mean, that was... Amazing. Well, we don't think no. of uh, think of jade in in, no. in Turkey. I just the fact this Turkish. I yeah, think it's brilliant. Now I'm going to start with yeah. the larger strand, seven wow. to ten millimeters, and then we're going to bring you the uh, other shapes and cuts. Um, so the biggest of all, and remember what they said the, is that middle to dark oh. purple color with mottling. They want the mottling, and you've got those patterns. Yeah. See what I mean? Yeah. You've got the swathes, grays, oh, purples. Wow. And that be uh, flashes of red within there as there well. We there we Even yeah. here, you know, if we're saying, okay, Turkish purple jade can command, is as rare and can command the same prices as your Burmese jadeite. You know, we're starting at 750. Which, uh, look, it's a considered amount. Of course it is. But we're not going to close there. We're going to do close out deals. How many have we got, Roscoe? 38 available, the biggest size that we have. Big closeout deals. I'll show you the launch. There he is, marking his Jeep. <laughs> That'd make amazing wallpaper, wouldn't it? It would. <laughs> or or pajamas. pajamas, socks, yeah. socks, <laughs> ties. We need to get ties and everything, babies. 149, previous closing wow. price. Immediately, the first collector says, I'll have two. Thank you very much. If you're saying close out deals for a gemstone that is quite li literally irreplaceable, um, let's launch your close out deals with a massive bang because we are not stopping there. So we have how many did you say? 38. 38, yeah. which is much more than I was expecting yeah, you to yeah. say, to be truthful. 149 is where we launched it. <coughs> Excuse me. This year, sold it. It might have been alongside you, Mark. Oh, gosh. May. In May. It might have been you it and might I. Have been that birthday then. Yeah. yeah. Maybe it was a birthday. Sounds, looks like a birthday yeah. deal. Yeah. I mean, these are huge. 10 millimetres in their size. 10 millimetres in their size. Good luck, everybody. Already multi buyers getting involved with the swathes, the mottlings, the, the desired patterns that we want from the Lucky Stone. I love that too, the lucky stone. Yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? Because say lucky stone, we normally think about turquoise, don't mm. we? Yes, this is lovely. I think it's a look lovely with turquoise. Actually. Yeah, they would. Purple and blue. 
very pretty. Where's it going, then? Well, sold very successfully at 149 during our birthday celebrations in May. However, we've been promised, yeah, do some closeout deals on Bursa Jade. Why not? Even though it's a gemstone that's irreplaceable. <laughs> in fact, it's nearly. pretty much half price it, yeah. Wow. Ha Halving that price. Goodness me, that's incredible. Straight away, multi buyers getting involved. £26.66. If you compare as well between your Burmese and your Bursa, not only is it the sort of country of origin, the colours are worlds apart, mm. aren't they? Burmese, pretty. It's a, it, it's a lavender. That's why they call it lavender. It's much, much, much softer. You do have a level of translucency, but the paler is also uh, much, much softer. If you are going for that deep ultraviolet, you know, like the little Ribena berries back in the day when they were on the advert, it, it, it's Bursa Jade. Um, all day long. Shona, Hertfordshire, Leslie, Sandra, London, Somerset, you're all there. Absolutely incredible. Closeout deals. We've got two strands of rounds. I've got one bico and I've got one clover design. Oh. And then we've got a slider bracelet that we're going to try and squeeze in. Let's bring you the next round strand. So I'll leave that one with you. Now these. Oh, it's a lovely strand, this one. Oh, I like that. Imagine this with your coat, Anne. Yeah, Why not? That. It'd be nice, wouldn't it? These are seven to nine millimetres. Look at where we're starting, though. 395. Yeah, it's, it's more like um, if there was such a thing as lavender ice cream. Yes. <laughs> it has got that really yeah. beautiful, creamy, soft, tranquil, natural colour. Think back to that gentleman who was holding the rough boulder. You know, which mm. you could see that definite purple colour, but it wasn't purple like this. One crash. Close out deals. No sense, no logic whatsoever. Oh, look at that. Lovely glow, lovely patterning. £79.99 only. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, with those wonderful swirls, mottles that the Gem Explorer actually spoke about is most desired. Remember the darker colour, middle to darker colour with that texturing. So you want to see that texturing. Um, and also you can get hold of it on your split payment too. Very, very rare. So even if you went to the location, which I'm sure you could, lots of people go on holiday to Turkey. I went there last year. Um, it would have been a completely pointless exercise for me to um, go to that location for, uh, you know, on a quest to source this gemstone because there wouldn't be any. Um, let's do the bicones, all oh, my favourite. You loved Turkey, didn't you, when you went? I did. Mm. Yeah, it was mm. lovely. Mm. Very friendly people. Mm. Lovely culture. It's bus. You know, it's busy. Yeah. Amazing food. Yeah, absolutely amazing food. Uh, what's not? Yeah, what's not to love? And it's not that far away. No, no that's right. Not far, yeah. yeah. Every hol every time now, we're keep saying because we haven't booked our summer holiday yet. Can we go to Turkey? Can we go to <laughs> Turkey? I was like, Willow, it's a big world out there. Big Did big she ask world. Just Disneyland yet. Yes, oh. but we've said when Tiggy's older, oh, yeah, yeah. because she's too young at the moment. That would just be a nightmare. Yeah, we want to go twice. No, <laughs> no. Um, Okay, my favourite strand, beautiful bicones, again with a graduation to this as well. Isn't that lovely? That's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. So beautiful. This would work with your kit in the 12 o'clock hour. I was thinking colour I would. The green got that amazing zoocyte at the end. Yeah. It's beautiful. That's gorgeous. Yeah, lovely alongside yeah. that. Um, and some of your... Hang on, let's have a little look. Host, Amazing, doesn't it? Isn't it? Yeah. Nice addition to Mark's kit. Yeah. Let's do uh, some closeout deals. Good luck. The clovers are oh. up next, and there are only ten. Oh. So if you if your ears picked up when we said about talked about the clovers, they're up next. Sixty nine pounds and ninety nine pence only. Again, not only bicones should command a oh. higher price tag because they are incredibly they're wasteful. Perfect, aren't they? Yeah, absolutely perfect. And, it's that and this doesn't have the girdle, is it the girdle, the middly waistband? Yeah. This, this is just sharp, it's perfect. It's just got that it? angle, hasn't so it? So beautiful. Really lovely. Well done. Yeah, it's a wasteful card. Yeah, yeah, and I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm intrigued to know, do they have dr generous drill holes? Yes. Yeah. Just one is a pendant, says Ross, that'd yeah. be nice. Beautiful. Because the cut is very unique, absolutely, but we shouldn't expect Jade to be in bicones. I know we have done it, but 
um, because, yeah, it's wasteful. You're effectively cutting it into round and then cutting bits away from it. Now, our favourite cut, certainly one of our most popular cuts mm -hmm. here at Jewelry Maker, is the Alhambra-inspired uh, four-leaf clover. Uh, clover. And if I had the time, I'd obviously talk to you about bank leaf and our bells and, you know, the, uh, the Alhambra inspiration that has been around quite literally for decades, one of their most successful uh, mm -hmm. collections yeah. that is not only celebrity-adorned, royalty-adorned, um, by footballers, rappers, singers, royalty. Yeah, everybody's rocking the Alhambra. Um, <laughs> hippity hoppers. Yeah, absolutely. Everyone's rocking the Alhambra. And why not? Um, I love the fact that it is such a wide genre. I love it. No, I thought it was amazing. And I'd never heard of it until we started talking about it on the show. And then, yeah. and then you see it all the time, don't you? Yeah. Princess Catherine, I think, looks beautiful in hers because hers is off-centre, isn't it? Yeah. It's asymmetric. Yeah. It's Queen Camilla's a big fan. Yeah. Cardi Adele. Cardi Adele, Adele, Adele Cardi wears it around B. her wrist, doesn't she? Yeah. Good on Cardi B, I have to say. I'm going to get political now. Are you? Yeah. So, you know, this, this, there's this thing where people in audiences now start throwing things at yes. artists. Yes, yeah, yeah, well, yeah. Somebody yeah. threw water at her and she got really cross and threw the microphone back at her, which I mean, I'm not condoning violence, but I thought, well, no, good on her. You know, they should, you know. I mean, why pay a couple of hundred pounds to see an artist and then throw things at I them? don't get it. Yeah, because that's happened to, it's happened to yeah, what, Harry, Harry Styles. Styles. Yeah. yeah. And it's good. Yeah. No, oh. no need. No. No need. Be good. Yeah. Just behave. We don't need to. Th no. It's, no, exactly. Mm. I don't blame her for getting cross. No, yeah, I did see that sketch, actually, throwing mm. water. Yeah. Um, amazing. Well done. They've sold out. And on to the finale oh, is cute. your beautiful slide oh, bracelet. That's made. Amazing. I did hear, though, I don't think the microphone actually hit that no, person. Didn't. No, So she might be getting sued, mm. which is a shame. But, yeah, it's not acceptable. Don't need to no. be like that, do no. we? Um, okay. How beautiful. Oh, my goodness, I love this colour. It's almost bluey, isn't it? It's got a definite blue. Also alongside... Also alongside your slider bracelet. If you want to deconstruct this as jewellery makers, you absolutely can. If you want to make it your own, you absolutely can. But it is a complete finished piece of jewellery. It is pretty, isn't it? Yeah. One size fits all because it is a, a slider bracelet. Twi what? <laughs> what? <laughs> 29 pounds and 99 pence only. That's ridiculous, isn't it? That is ridiculous. Amazing. Wow. And well, we always talk about purple's an incredibly popular yeah, colour, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. Um, across all your jewellery um, and gemstones. Oh. Well done. How many did we have then, Roscoe? <laughs> 29, but there's a lot of you there. Hertfordshire's multi bought Lorraine, wow. Suzanne, Helen, That's Mary, amazing. Janice, Valerie, Pauline, Gloucestershire, Shirley, Barbara. Well done. Uh, make sure you're checking out everybody. 29, yeah, it doesn't last very long, That's not on a Saturday crazy. afternoon. Yeah. Oh, we just tipped over into the yeah. afternoon. Um, your beautiful Wall of Fame entries. Um, Wall of Fame entries are coming up the other side of this, as are Mark's amazing safari theme kits. I'm really excited. I can sport your hat if you want. You Show can Willie. do what? I'll sport your hat if you want for this <laughs> next hour. Um, because they are inspired by the safari. So you have your elephant, your lion, and also your leopard. Stunning jewellery, Mark. Um, so don't go anywhere. Get ready to shop ahead on your kits. And, of course, be inspired by the wonderful Mark Smith. <laughs> Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. 
It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Twelve o'clock. No, I can't. Where has that time <laughs> gone? Sorry, it's we got amazing. distracted then. The talk conversation of Idris Elba. I'm like, oh, where? Oh, where is he? It's amazing. Where is he? Um, Should he be the next Bond? Do you think? I mean, he's already confirmed he's not, isn't he? Yeah. But yes, I think he should. There was a list of suggested new Bonds. Idris is on it. Oh. Yeah, I think he'd be a great Bond. Like, uh, his age is but a number. He's pretty Certainly cool. Is. Yeah. No, He's he is pretty, pretty cool. cool. Yeah. Um, what well, you keep saying? Is it Henry? Henry Cavill. Uh, he's he's going to get my vote. He's yeah. going to get your vote. vote. Oh mm. no. That's oh, who does Adam mean. think? Idris. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think there's going to be some something completely controversial, like someone like I don't know, not really controversial. Someone like, is it Andrew Gar? Andrew Garfield. Garfield. Mm, no. I think it's going to be someone really Could be the like chap, a curveball. Um, the chap that played Elvis. Elvis. He's a good one. Aaron Taylor Johnson. Yeah. Aaron Taylor Johnson. So who did yeah. he play? He he played Quicksilver. You, you don't you don't like superheroes, do you? No. He was yeah. He was, oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. He's good. Yeah. yeah who he's else? Damson Idris. Yeah. Yes. Never heard of him. Okay. Oh. 
audition to it for the Bond uh, yeah, he'd producers. Yeah, he Richard Madden. Richard Madden, yes. Yeah, he gets a, he gets a vote. Yeah, he'd be He gets a vote. R oh, he's from Dam... Bridgerton. Oh, yes. A bit of a heartthrob, apparently. Yeah, I can see that in that photograph. Totally see that one. Um, James mm, Norton. No, no, I don't, oh, I don't know. From Happy Valley. Happy Valley, yeah. Here yeah, he yeah. is, Henry Cavill. That's not a very good picture of him, actually. Sorry, I think, no, he's Superman. Yeah. He looks like Superman. Mm. He can't be Bond as well. He's just stopped, he's just stopped the Superman to work on other projects. Oh. Henry Golding. Henry no. Golding. Oh, don't I don't know, know who he is. No, don't know him. Okay. I don't know him. Lucian. Lucian, yeah. Don't know him either. He's a bit young, I think. He looks a bit young. Not mm -hmm. sure. Emily in Paris, yes, I've seen that film. Dev Patel, yes. Plum dog chap. Andrew Garfield. I knew he was going to be in there. Andrew yeah. Garfield had to be yeah. in there. 39. Yeah. Gosh, I think he could be. He could yeah. be Bond. Yeah, anyway, well, there you go. We've certainly got off the beaten track, haven't we? Sorry. I think when they announce who it's going to be, we should, have, we, should have a, um, we should have a Bond theme show, shouldn't we? Yes. Mm. Tom Hardy. No, he's a bit too rugged, I think, Tom mm. Hardy. Let's have a look. Idris has got to be on There's there. There's of them. John Bego. McKay. Was that? Oh, yeah, because they're going to do Jane Bond, aren't they? They were threatening. Yeah. She'd be, really, she'd be good, actually. Right. Yeah, she was in the last one. Okay. Will Poulter. Mm. One, oh. Yes, he's good. Yeah. Now, he was in... Uh... Yeah, you recognise his face, don't you? Mm. Um, oh, the Maze Runner. That's where I'm remembering him oh. from. Yeah, the Maze Runner. Where's Idris? <laughs> there he is. There he is. Mm. There he is. The People's Choice. The People's Choice. Yeah, I get that. Totally get that. Anyway, shall we show off your <laughs> wonderful creations um, in the Wall of Fame? Starting us off this afternoon, number 238 <laughs> is Jane. Hello to you, Jane. Matt Berry. Matt Berry. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> why not, I guess? I love his amazing voice. Is he a singer, is he? He's a comedian and a, oh. he's, he's a singer as well. But he's James Bond funny. can't be a comedian. He's in, he's in a programme called Toast. It's very funny on Channel 4. OK. Really funny. I'll, have to, I'll have to watch yeah. that one then. Yeah. Uh, Jane Galloway, hello to you. You're number 238. And Jane says, please wow. find my entry to the Hall of Fame. Um, there are a pair of earrings made up of aquamarine gemstones from Jewelry Maker and crystal drops from my stash. Ooh. Very pretty. Um, good luck to everybody in the drawer. Number 239 is from Susan. Hello, Susan. Oh, look oh at that very out. beautiful. Uh, good morning to all my gem friends. My waffering Aww. this week uh, is made from leftover thread from a bracelet I sent to Mark's special waff. Two macrame, uh, macrame wonky hearts. Love that. Um, sea beads and other bits. Good luck to everybody. Um, but I'd love to win the waffering. That's lovely. Joe, you know, we had 108 entries That's for fabulous. my wall of fame. I was ever so thrilled. Amazing. Lovely. And who won? Do you remember? We had three winners. Three winners. Oh, Amazing. That's a, yeah, lots. Yeah. That's fabulous. Yeah. Uh, 240 from June. Oh, wow. Very beautiful, June. Look at that. I think I spot a bit of uh, professional photography there. Um, and June says, please find attached my entry to the Hall of Fame. I bought the long, long strand of turquoise magnesite some time ago and made this necklace for a customer. Mixed with appetite and Mayuki silver galvanized atos with sterling silver, fastener oh. and extender. Loving as always, all the wonderful deals on Jewelry Maker. I had to order more storage boxes too from JM. Thank you for your wonderful company and the fabulous presenters and crew and guest designers. You are entertaining. You can't have enough storage. No, it's true. No, no, that is very, very true. It's, it, that was one of the things that I miss now, not doing craft fairs, is that imagining that somebody is wearing a piece of jewellery that you've made and have paid you for it. Yeah. And I think it's... That's it's, nice. There's nothing nicer. That's, a, that's a pat on the back, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Uh, number 241 is from Alison. Wow, that's amazing. Incredible. Alison says, loved the ombre thread, used one reel on a Kumahimo. That project is still underway. But I also thought it worked just perfect for the colours and dimension, dimensions for this rather large tassel top. Wishing well to all at Jewelry Maker and my fellow waffers. Um, passing the rest to you. You do a much better wink than I do. If you wink at the screen. I'm, I'm at rubbish the, at yeah. winking. If you wink at the screen. Okay, hang on. Go on, go on. Ready? 
if you like ombre thread, make sure you tune in Wednesday. <laughs> All right. Wow. This is amazing. We can say it, can't we? What's that? You're launching new cord, but mm -hmm. you didn't say it was ombre, did you? Ooh. Right, anyway, back to. Number 242 is from lovely Susan. Hi all at JM, here is my latest effort. It's a pearl knotted necklace with a toggle clasp and a blue agate with kunzite and clear quartz necklace with a gold star connector. I made this after I have problems with my thyroid and blue lace agate is the third chakra of the neck. All components were from jewellery maker. Ah, look lovely yeah. Susan, love that. very nice. Love that. Number 243 is from Deborah. Oh look at this, very I love these nice. knotted necklaces. Here with my offering for this week's Wall of Fame. Very Dickensian. Here that with, was, wasn't it? Was lovely. Here with my offering for this week's Wall of Fame. My first attempt at a Marla necklace made with an Amazonite kit I bought from JM last week. Good luck, fellow Woffers. Ah, That's very wonderful. beautiful, Deborah. Thank you, Deborah. Margaret, number 244. Very nice. Oh, look at this. This week's entry for the Wall of Fame is an over-the-head necklace made from green dyed tiger's eye star-cut beads interspersed with gold 11 OC beads with three millimeter malachite rounds. It's finished off with a chunky gold toggle clasp which can be worn front or back. Very nice, loving that. And staying with the Gibsons, number 245 is from Joanne. Oh, look at that. Very nice, old school jewelry maker. Yeah. This is only my second entry and is made from a recent purchase from JM. They are socialite. Is that how I, is that how you say it? Socialite? Yeah. Mm. Socialite, gradualite, fancy bars. So delight, I think it is. Oh, so delight, yeah. yeah. Six millimeter jet plane rounds, rose gold findings pack, and fireline from my stash. I wish everyone all the best and what fantastic makes everyone makes. Such inspiration from JM viewers and guest designers. Here, here. Wow, beautiful. Wow. Loving Thank those. you, everyone. Thank you. Good luck. The draw happens on Wednesday, so you've still got time to send you your. Me. Yes. We'll try and be extra lucky. Yeah, yeah. Ombre thread. <laughs> You're amazing. Right, Mark. I can't wait. Would you like to bring your amazing pieces over to the centre? I certainly will. Because these are amazing. And there's three kits, very straightforward. Very un me, I thought, when I received them. But I'm so glad that you have had these because it's thought, really no. always nice to see how different designers interpret them. Mm, Look just, at those. I'm Mark. so chuffed. And you get a really nice gemstone selection as well. It's one of those bracelets again. Look. I love it. Look at that, eh? Absolutely gorgeous. When you pack this away when you're at home, you don't think you've actually made very much. And then when you lay it all out in the studio, you think, oh, actually, I haven't have... done too bad. Yeah, because you don't, you don't stop. No. You keep on going, don't you? Now... <laughs> uh, <laughs> you're looking at James Bond over still... there. <laughs> yeah, Riz Ahmed, yeah, yeah. Still talking about that. OK. <laughs> Amazing. How many do we have of each of these kits? How many of these kits do we have? Not too bad. Oh, I'm a bit disappointed with that quantity. I was hoping there was going to be more. Six. No idea what price they're going to. Um, I can tell you, Mark. Can I, can, you? I, can, I can tell you. Pretty good, considering the amount of sterling silver that's in there. Right. Which of these kits are we starting with? Leopard. The leopard, the monochrome. Yeah. I'd like to go leopard, lion, elephant. Okay. So shall we start with the component, the okay. element, He's which is a good. massive amount of sterling silver, and then uh, and maybe talk us around how we actually incorporate this into our jewellery, and then I'll show you the additional gemstones. There are 69. You are going to need to channel your inner yes. Usain Bolt to make sure you don't miss out on this, um, because you have very parve, um, very... Um, very Van Cleef and Arpels, actually, it that work with yeah. kind of beading. Yep. Um, and it's curved, so if I turn it on its side profile, look, you actually get you get this really lovely shape of the leopard's face, with whiskers, as you pointed yeah. out, yeah, yeah. and then the, the tassel top. It's got its muzzle and eyes and ears, and there it's fantastic. And it'll go with the, the Wallace Simpson range, won't it, and that sort of genre. No, I love this, so Mark. Cool. And I like the fact you can see right through it as well. Yeah. 
It's amazing. Yeah, you've got the two jump rings on yeah. the top here for you to, to knot on to directly. Yeah. Yeah. And then you've got the tassel at the bottom. You don't just get that, though, because you also have two amazing strands of beautiful, genuine gemstones. So these gemstones include, is this obsidian? No, I thought that as well. Agate? No, it's amazing. Goldstone. This? Mm-hmm. Oh, and it is. Yeah, it is amazing. A very, very, very. dark gold yeah. stone. Can you see? It's incredible, isn't it? Well, you have these really subtle. Yeah. Yeah, beautiful. there you go. You yeah. see it? Yeah, it's lovely. Little subtle, like starry night. <gasps> Hang on. No. It, I think it is gold stone. Oh. It, uh, Oh, it might be colour. It might be rainbow. Maybe it's rainbow, rainbow then. Rainbow obsidian. That's rainbow wrong, obsidian. Then. Yeah, it could be. Wow. Okay. I've that's never where. Another. That's did where you, it. Did, yeah. you, did you take that assumption from yeah. its appearance? Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah. We're just gonna. It must be rainbow obsidian it must then. Be then, which, which is incredibly rare. Forever. Okay. Oh. We're going to do a minute clock to get the graphics in, but we'll just confirm. So it's natural oh, rainbow I'll obsidian. Oh, i take it back. Wow, that sparkle. Because it threw me because I thought goldstone would have more sparkle than that. But it's obsidian, which I've not, I've not seen rainbow so obsidian me, for about 10 years. No, it's been a long time. Let me yeah. just explain. Obsidian is a type of ancient volcanic glass mm, that, yeah. um, d depending on how quickly it cools, depending on how quickly it cools, equates to what colours that you see. So, for example, you get silver obsidian, golden obsidian, and you get mm. the ultra rare um, uh, rainbow, rainbow yeah. which is why you thought this was goldstone. Yeah. I've had rainbow once in my 12 years here. Mark, this kit has just gone yeah. into another stratosphere. Yeah. Completely. Wow. How many... What's the gram weight on this beautiful leopard as well, which is sterling silver, right? Leopard, panther... It's a leopard, isn't it? It's got spots. Yeah, I thought leopard. Four wow. grams, in excess <laughs> of four grams. The only issue... Oh, no, it's even gone up again. What? Second row down. Oh, it's Brazilian Broncoronix, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Natural Brazilian Broncoronix. Natural rainbow obsidian. <laughs> Four grams of sterling silver. This kit, yeah, surely should be where we are on your oh, screens right no. now. It's not. Is that the price that I just showed you on my star by sheet? Then? No way. No. Nowhere near. <laughs> That's for the strand of onyx. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no, they've made a mistake. I think. Yeah. See, what well, I've got the, I've got it suspended there, but but it's got a ring from the leopard, so you could open up the jump ring on top of the little tassel uh -huh. and have two pendant drops. So suspend something from the leopard. And then something from the tassel top part. So you've got two pieces of jewellery there if you wanted to separate them. I love this. They've made a massive mistake with this. Yep. Oh, no. This, uh, hey, okay. uh, it's not our mistake, Mark. Let's just no, put no. it that way. No. So I tell you what. Let's put another 60-second clock on your screen. Now we've addressed and ironed out all the issues. We're not going <laughs> to rectify it. We're just going to go with what it, the mistake was. Never mind. Um, in 60 seconds... We will drop that price point to where it was originally planned to be. Yes, you have natural rainbow black obsidian. Yes, you have natural pure white bronca onyx not dyed. And yes, you have four grams in excess of 925 sterling silver and a very Cartier inspired piece yeah. of jewelry. Um, but, and it's a pretty big but, there's only 69. Sorry. You'll need to be quick. I love your jewellery, Mark. Thank you. And this can be something that I think even with little to no uh, you know, jewellery making knowledge, you can have Absolutely. a go at. Absolutely. Yeah, I'm going to show you how to add a tassel really simply. I'm going to show you how to do that little waistband. Love tassels yeah. and jewellery. I love them. Really. Yeah. They just work, don't yeah. they? So wearable. Good luck, everybody. There were 69. Half the stock has already gone. I'm not surprised. The rest are going to go now. Yeah, we could say oh, I have made a mistake there. Let's 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 rectify it. Or we could go. Oh well, <laughs> it's not our mistake. <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> Which is precisely what yeah. we have done, by the way. 
Wow, wow, wow. Four grams of sterling silver in that beautiful, I'm going to say leopard rather than panther. It's not oh. base metal. I think, I think, yeah, for over four grams, um, you'd be looking oh. at maybe, I don't know, even if a conservative and said 40 pounds elsewhere. Yeah. Definitely. Oh, he looks lovely, doesn't he? Just sat in amongst those obsidian. Obsidian, honestly. Yeah, not goldstone. I feel such a plonker. Don't feel like a plonker. I thought it, I thought it, I thought it was goldstone. I believed you when you which said it. Which is when it. you showed me that price and I thought, oh, that's not too bad. Yeah. But it's not. It's no. completely wrong. Obsidian, <laughs> which is, uh, yeah, rainbow obsidian as well, which wow. is more expensive. Well done, everybody. Make sure you're checking out. There was only 69 of these and there are multi-buyers getting involved. If you love your elephants and if you love your lions, then we've got wow. those too. But again, limited edition kits. Sharon Wiltshire, Hertfordshire, Shirley Allison, Nicolette, Kent, London, London, Lynn, Susan and Brian. I've got Lanarkshire, Pauline, Donna, Tracy, Angela, Mary, Maker, Maker, London. Um, our core screen stuck again. It keeps yeah, doing that, I doesn't it? That, yeah. <laughs> um, stuck again, but don't worry. How, what's the live stock update right now, Roscoe? 15 left. Okay, it'll be an answer. Wish list it. Wish list it. If you're told you've been unsuccessful, wish list it, and our call centre will give you a call if any fall um, back into stock. Loving these. Absolutely loving the quality of the gemstone. You're right, the Bronchronic should be oh, that. So. Absolutely. That's amazing. Should be. Well done. Well done. Well done. Paul. I must, I must, read, I must read my, my specification. They do email me them, but I'm not good with technology. And if I miss an email, it's, yep. it would help a lot. I wouldn't come on and state the gemstone was what I thought it was, and it isn't. No, but you know what? Would you treat it any differently? No, not at all. There you go. <laughs> no need for you to read the specification then. Obsidian. I should have known it though. <laughs> I definitely should. Um, amazing, amazing, amazing. Wow. Julie, well done. Michelle, well done. Pauline, well done. Buckinghamshire, well done. Valerie, well done. Christina, Karen, Don, and Julie. Channel Isles. There's 10 left. I'll leave it with you because we're over allocated. Wow. Um, okay, on to the next. Lion. The lion. Ah. He is beautiful. He's a sort of lion that you'd see in a stately home on a wall with water coming out of his mouth like a fountain. Yeah. <laughs> I've got a lion in our house. Have you? Yeah. Um, <laughs> sounds like I'm talking about <laughs> 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 No! <laughs> Actually, like a, like a lion head by the door. Oh, right. Like, right. By the door. Not, not a real one, obviously. Yeah. Just like yeah. a mould of a lion. Yeah, I kind of stopped then mid-sentence, mm. didn't I? Sorry, I shouldn't have done that. Oh, hang on. Um, what? Yeah, green phantom courts. I thought it, see this, again, I've, I've made a boo. I thought it was tourmaline. No, I didn't. I thought it was fluorite. And it's not. It's, I, yeah, um, it does yeah. look fluorite esque. I thought it was fluorite, and it's Natural not. Natural green phantom courts. Look how beautiful Look this. I love this one. Love it. Love the lion, too. Let me show you. He's a, he is, he's a big putty cat. He's cool. Oh, I love it. Look at that. Handsome devil, isn't he? He's beautiful. And fine mane. Good luck, everybody. He is also two-dimensional. Can you see? So he has actually got a profile. And again, you have that bar at the bottom of the tassel top so that you could, uh, yeah, you can literally, um, you can anchor straight onto him too. Um, amazing. Beautiful. He's amazing, isn't he? £49.99 pence only. Ruby Zoocyte, totally natural. Uh, green Phantom Quartz, totally natural. How, what's the gram weight on the sterling silver of the lion? It's got to be about the same. It's got to be about the same as the previous. I'm going to say about four. Wow. Um, and talk us through your lovely piece of jewellery then, Mark. So I've made the lion. And again, this is, this is um, knotted. And I've just knotted in little groups all the way down. I've made a little... So I'm going to show you how to make this. Um, when we come to do the demo. Then I made this bracelet with Love some seed bracelet. bees. And again, this is the similar style that we did in the, in the nine o'clock hour. So you've got the 11 O's, then the eights, and then the gemstones running through the center. Mm -hmm. Love them. Beautiful. And then I made this little, again, another That's little bracelet nice. on here as well. So I've taken all the dark stones and all the light stones and just separated them. Just, just have a little play. Wow. It's We're at 49 pounds and 99 pence. We've got 69, but... This was never going to be the price of the kit, was it? Mm -mm. 
the big amount of sterling silver, ruby zoocyte, which we rarely ever see. No, love ruby zoocyte. Yeah, it's it's a fusion of two gemstones, isn't yeah. it? Ruby yeah. and zoocyte, the same gemstone family as your tanzanite. And then you also have your, what did you say the gram weight was of the lion? 4.16, so he's significant too. I love the back of him as well. Yes. It's just, it's, he's just really cool. You can see the amount yeah, of, of precious yeah. metal that has actually been invested into him. Yeah, it's a big Lovely. piece. Clock is ticking. We're going to take it even lower. There's only 69 of these available. If you want the elephant, the elephant's coming up next. Ah. Oh. And if you wanted to remove that tassel, you know, you could just Easy. turn it into you've got two, then. a pendant. Yeah. yeah. You've got a pendant and then you've got a, a tassel topper. I say that because I'm fairly sure if I turn that into, I don't know, a necklace, long line necklace, you said David Beckham earlier mm, on, I can yeah. imagine him wearing yeah. something like this. Yeah, yeah. You know, or, I don't know, I'm trying to think of... I feel quite guilty as far as David Beckham's, because David Beckham was all my favourite, but I've changed alliances now, <gasps> I know, after all these years. What football alliances? Mm, to who? Jack Graylish. I love Jack Graylish. He's amazing. He does seem like a nice chap. He's a lovely man. Lovely, lovely chap. Not much upstairs, but, <laughs> but a lovely chap. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so glad. We're all thinking it. I think that's why I like him so much. You just yeah. want to pat him on the head and say, oh, never mind. Never mind. Do you see hug. when he was trying to point lovely. out where, where, yeah. where, where, where he grew up, where he was born on the UK map? And he's just like, that's the UK? <laughs> yes. <laughs> ah, yes, it is. Oh, he's lovely. Um, he didn't recognise the map of the UK. Is that England? Um, <laughs> uh, 39. He's a good footballer, though. He's amazing. You yeah. know, credit where it's due. 39.99. And he's kind. That's mm. the most important thing. Yeah. Um, well done. We had 69 of these. Um, that's a limited, very exclusive kit, very exclusive opportunity. If you want the elephant, that's coming your way as well. And simple, you know, like simple... Kit construction, oh, yeah. threading, beading. Simple, you know. really simple. I, like, it's nice, actually, Mark, because you said, oh, it's not normally no. a Mark kit, but I'm refreshed to see you yeah, with something yeah, like this because nice. you always get the CB kits, and let's be honest, they're quite labour-intensive. <laughs> so <laughs> it's nice to see you yeah. with uh, a kit that is faster makes. Okay. Right, here we go. How let's quick do you think now. this one's going to sell out? I'll save this one till last. It's so exquisite. And the Absolutely. gemstones are amazing. Yeah. Uh, can I start with the gemstones? Of course, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you have, within this... Oh, look at that. Uh, wait a minute. I have... No, different to what it says on my sheets. Let me double check. This is green rutile. Yep. Got spinel in the, in the elephant. That's where I'm getting confused. Yeah. Yeah. Then you also get AB coated clear quartz. I love them. Absolutely. Not glass. I've, not never had, I've never had AB coated quartz before, ever. I've had lots no. of um, agates and things, but this is amazing. How beautiful. Yeah. And, and that's love pristine, eye clean quality of your Incredible. quartz. Yeah, yeah. Otherwise, they wouldn't coat it, quite literally. So you've got green rutile quartz, AB coated clear quartz. And then here he is. Oh, this is up, exquisite. Two, three, four. Keep it up. Two, three, four. Here look it that. is. He's incredible. Look. Every time you look at him, you see something different. That's even to, even attention to detail, even the little tassel topper is the same patination as his trunk and his ears. It's, and the tusks. It's exquisitely made. Gorgeous yeah. tusks. Yeah. Look at that detailing in his trunk. Can we get up close and then you can see? Look, look at that—the tusks, the black spinel. Oh, he is like—he reminds he is, me of um, the Hindu elephant, mm. Ganesha, yeah. not mm. a Ganesha. Yeah, he's gorgeous. Now we're going to do oh. this in one price crash. We've only got sixty-nine. They are flying out. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. They're all beautiful kits, and in terms of their construction, very similar. Thirty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence only. Beautiful with the tassel top. If you want to re remove that tassel top and use it elsewhere, then you've got two separate components, haven't you? Absolutely. Um, if you yeah. wanted to. If you have any questions for our lovely Mark, then do make sure you are checking out those baskets. Um, we had 69. Make sure you check them out. Um, and if you have any questions, like I say, we are live in the studio. So look at you all there, all around the world getting involved. Amazing. Um, hopefully you were watching during the early bird hour and you managed to get yeah. hold of the elephant charms yeah. too, of which you got four. 
is pretty amazing, isn't it? Four yeah. eleven char um, elephant charms. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay. Now, Mark. Okay. Can't wait to see this. So you're going to be demonstrating the elephant. The elephant. So I'm going to show you how to do this little um, peyote belt that I've made, and then I'm going to show you how to attach your tassel, which is which is really lovely, which is really nice. So I've shown this 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 technique quite a few times on the show recently. So I've done most of it. I'm just going to show you how to finish it off. So this is your double drop peyote. Yep. Okay, so what I've done, I've got, so you need 12 beads up. Okay, could we go in a bit tighter? Sorry, I shouldn't, that's dreadful. Lovely. Marvelous. Okay, so you need, because I'm doing double drop peyote, obviously you're dropping two seed beads at once instead of one. So you need to do an even number. And I worked out that 12 11 O's from top to bottom sits absolutely perfectly. So I've had a play with the, with the number of rows and I've gone silver, two green, two silver, two green, two silver, two green, and then ending with the silver at the top. So because we're doing double drop, I'm gonna quickly show you how we do it. So, so it's 12 beads deep and 12 rows. That's easy to remember, 12 times 12, okay? So I've this on my initial 12 beads and then we're doing double drops, so I'm dropping two beads at a time. So I'm just gonna count how many rows I've done. So I've done two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. We need 24 altogether. So I'll quickly do the four rows that we need. So what we're doing, you can already see the little castellations on the right hand side from where I did my double dropping. So we're just gonna continue with the pattern. And the way that I've done this pattern it's really simple because it's silver and a green, silver and a green, silver and a green. It just happens to be the way that all of the beads fell in their rows. So we're just going to do the double dropping. Now the only reason I did double dropping was it's, it's just, it saves a lot of time. You can do, if you want to, you can do single drop, you can do double drop, you can even do triple drop if you want to, depending on how much time you have. So we'll continue, oops. So we're just going to sew up through, and then sew up through, and then sew up through. Okay, so see how quickly it works. So we're just gonna double check again. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 10, 11. So we've got one more section to do. And then we're going to do my favourite bit, which is zipping up. Yeah, something really satisfying. I love that. absolutely love it. Okay, so 11 and 11. Okay, so double check. And the way to know that if you've, if you've done enough is, can you see along the top row, we've got two outies and on the bottom we've got two innies and we need to make sure we have an innie and an outie at top and bottom. Mm -hmm. So I should have 12 along the top. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. I've only got 11 along the bottom, so I know that I just need to do one more little section. So again, silver and green. Silver and green. So in effect, we're making a belt for a carrier bead, but putting it onto a tassel instead, if you think of it like that. So silver and green. Okay, so we've done our little section of peyote. So we've all got our Esalon in our stash at home, but for me, my go-to, because um, many of the viewers know that I'm a, a cross-stitcher uh, in the winter, <laughs> a gardener when, by when, summer. When the gardener doesn't. All year the round, jewellery maker. Yep, absolutely. And um, so whenever I have my, my cross-stick pictures, all of my extra bits of thread I keep because then I can use them for tassels. Mm -hmm. If you go on, if you go on after the show, if you go on to Sewing Street website, you can actually buy these singly, okay. any colour you like. And it's, so if you've got a piece of jewellery in mind that you want to do a tassel for a mala, just go on, choose a colour. They're, they're only about a pound each, something like that. Oh, really? And it saves so much time. They're silk as well, so it just oh. adds another little bit of luxury. And they're, the, they're probably one of the easiest things to use. So you'll get your thread with two little stoppers. Mm -hmm. Keep the stoppers on until you've done your next section. 
So we're going to place that over the top. And then we're simply going to fold the two oh. ends over. So I'm going to take my needle and you can see now that the two pieces, because we've done 12 rows by 12 beads deep, it meets perfectly. So what we're going to do is we're, I'm coming at the bottom left, so I'm going to go across to the right and I'm going to sew up two. Zippity, zippity. Zipping up. I'm going to go to the left and up two. I'm going to go across to the right and up two. Putting it nice and tight. I'm going to go to the left and up two. I could do this all day, you know, zipping up. Across to the right, up two. Make sure we go up two. There we go. And I'm going to go across to the left and up two. Okay, and what I do then is I just, just give it a little wiggle in my finger so it all sits tessellating nicely. I'm going to take off my stopper bead mm -hmm. and I'm going to tie a single knot which brings those two pieces nicely together. And I'm just going to rub it in my fingers so that again, so all, all the little nooks and crannies close up. And I'm going to do a double knot. So a single followed by a double. I think that's in tight. And then to tie it off, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my needle and I'm going to go to the right. I'm going to go down two beads. I'm going to go across to the right. I'm going to go up two beads. And I'm going to go across and down two beads. And then we're ready to cut our threads. So that's nice and secure. We've, we've sewn away from the knot. So I'll cut my cords away. Like so. And then what I'm going to do is put that to one side. Now what I've done on the tassel topper, you'll see that you've got a bar along the bottom. You're going to take a piece of thread, thread it underneath and up. Okay, so we've now got that attached. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my, you get these little paper binders. I'm just going to take the binder down. I'm just going to gently separate. It's quite good because it straight away you found that central point. So just make sure we've got no overhangs. So that's absolutely perfect. Okay, make a little loop. And I'm going to take my tassel top. I'm just going to tie a single knot followed by another knot. That just secures it nice and tightly. And all we're going to do is we're going to take one end of our thread, feed it into that little loop we've made, making sure that's sat on the top. And again, we're just going to tie it in. So I've gone for white. There we go. Got in for white, nice and tight, so it hides in your tassel. Then I'm just going to separate our thread so I can get back in there. There we go. And then again, tie another single knot. And you can see that, that then the tussle topper sits nice and neatly on top of your thread. You tie that in. Like so. And then we're going to cut our ends off. How easy that was yep. to attach. This is why I love these threads so much. Okay, then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut through this little paper cup. It's, it makes it so much easier if you keep these papers on until you finish. Yeah, it keeps it all tidy, keeps doesn't it? All it? And nice clean. And tidy and clean. Yep. Okay, so we take our little paper off. Okay, like so. So that's now attached. And then we're going to take our little belt that we've made and we're going to slide it all the way up. And that's nice and tight and secure. Okay, so that's your door tassel now attached. And then, because this is still attached at the bottom, you can then decide how long or short you want your tussle to be. And with one cut, all of your fronds are going to be the same length, you see. So if you, t you tell me when to stop. 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 Oh. It's so not it's short. Go in, and all we're going to do is we're going to cut through. That's not short. And there you have your... Oh, Adam's not happy with the length no, of that not. tassel. <laughs> <laughs> and because we've only cut halfway, you see, we've still got... If you keep that other piece of paper attached, you've still got another, another yeah, you've tassel, got another to, tassel use, there, to use you? for something else. So that is your... Look how beautiful that is. Shall I pass that across to you to have a look? Yes. Ah, oh, Mark. I love these kits. And obviously you can yeah. do exactly the same so with Otherwise, the if you've got Eslon in your stash, you have to wind it all around a card and then you have to secure it. And then if it all curls up, you have to soak it overnight. And yeah. For a quid, you get... Every, I think there are about 900, nearly 1,000 colours 
of your embroidery silks. Okay. So as I said, and you can get any colour matching whatsoever, and I just love them. So with so with the necklace, I went for green because of the zoosite. Very zoosite. nice. Uh, and then you've gone for red, and then I've gone for this sort of the plum colour. They're just oh, amazing earrings. Yeah, if you can, if, so if cool. your budget allows you yeah. to get two. Yeah, and oh, you've got and you've on. got and you've got real silk in your tassel. There you are. Not a nylon cord as well, so they're just they're just amazing. Oh, Mark, they're yeah. awesome. And you can position that little belt up and down depending on where you want. And they're just lovely, aren't they? <laughs> Loving <laughs> those. Oh, how simple is that? Yeah, even I could do that. Yeah. For a, as I said, for a quid, all that work that you save. Yeah. And you're, you've got a silk tassel perfectly formed. It sits right. It hangs properly. I just think Job it's, done. Like, you just can't go wrong. Um, well, I can see the yeah. elephants almost sold oh, out. Yeah. Um, yeah. Stock update on the other kits. Leopards wow. close to selling out as well. Less than 10 of those, the single figure quantities. Yeah. Lion's okay. There's yeah. about 23 of the lion. I'm surprised right. at that. I thought mm. the lion would be one of the more popular mm. ones. Mm. I would swap out. I've got to be honest, as I, I do love Ruby Zoosite, but I would want to put a bit of tiger's eye in there. Oh, yes. With the that lion, I think. Yeah. I think that would yeah. work. Personally, in yeah. that, like I say, we're all different. Um, Mark, thank you. As Pleasure. always, beautiful design. I could demo that over and over and over and over again. And it was refreshing to get you, so to know that you haven't had to spend literally days <laughs> upon days upon days. I needn't, but I still did with the uh, with the belts and all the little kiss crossy bits and things. True. But True. you can't resist. Dedicated can't resist. to a fault, yeah. you are. <laughs> um, right then, okay. Let's do what? Oh. Sorry. <gasps> no. Oh, they're nice. The elephant. The oh. elephant. Go on, repeat, 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 repeat. Yeah, repeat. Okay. Uh, I'm going to show you a tea bar of dreams now. Um, ooh, ooh, ooh. <clears throat> these would be amazing for both of, for all of these kits. With the elephant, actually. I think in the elephant in particular. Now this, what we're looking at, lovely jewellery makers, is natural aquamarine. So aquamarine, first we don't see as often as we used to. No, nope, Do you remember nope, we used to get all the time? Absolutely not. Yeah, so yeah. aquamarine, remember the Beryl family, you can get aquamarine which lacks that blue colour, but so it's much more colourless, I guess, but can have pristine clarity. And you can get aquamarine which is really beautifully vibrant azure blue, but become quite opaque. To have the best of both worlds, to have the best of both worlds, um, is a rarity, is a real, real rarity. This, Mark, back in the day, let's go back five, six years, a strand like the, these, I should say, plural, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, would have probably been pushing three figures. Do, we, do you agree? No, absolutely. Yep. Now, Ross is oh. saying, I want to surprise everybody today. It's been a wonderful Saturday. We've had, we've had a lot of fun. But it's an incredible deal so far. He says, I guarantee you have no idea how good this deal's going to be. Crazy. Honestly, he's saying in my ear. That technique that I just showed you, the double drop, you can do that with this. With, oh, this, with, the, with the smaller size, you can do it. So you can have an aquamarine belt around your elephant. Wow. Oh, never never cool, thought I'd hear <laughs> myself say that. An aquamarine phrase. belt around, around your, your elephant. elephant. <laughs> With that black spinel that we had earlier on this morning, it would be yeah, lovely too. Yeah. Um, seriously, look at the quality though. Now, Ross has just said this will sell out before oh, oh. the first price crash. Oh, really? Now, we're going to do the four and a half mil first, 40 carats, natural, no heat treatment. And then we're going to step into the micro. There are 55 of these available. Wow. Ross, you have to whisper in our ear and tell us what you're doing. What do you mean you're not telling? Oh. You can't. You, did you hear that then? Oh, you wait and power. see. Power, power, eh? I know. Oof. With power comes great responsibility. True. Did you hear that, Roscoe? Yeah. With power comes great responsibility. Yeah. He says, I am that confident <laughs> now. These are stunningly They're beautiful. Absolutely. I love this little dark patch here. Look. Yeah. Virgin van Santa Maria there, isn't it? Definitely. Yeah. You know, if we, if we imagine textbook aquamarine, mm. yeah, yeah. it's this, isn't it? It's that blue. 
That, that blue, which is quite unlike mm. any other out yeah. there. Not even like, some might say, oh, well, Angel likes that colour. Yeah, but it doesn't have the clarity. No. Nope. That's nope. the difference. Nope. Um, natural. Do you remember earlier when Dave brought the first 10 millimetre coat and matte fat rounds? Yeah. Mm. And he said, this is the best deal we've ever done. Oh, no. Oh, I like it. Ross very confidently says, actually, the, the deal on this rivals that. Look at the quality. In some, depending on the gemologist, some gemologists would refer to this as Santa Maria. Mm. You know, because you have that clarity and you have that intensity. It's not heat treated, which is what I would have expected. Right. First price crash. We've got 55 of these available. I don't think I've ever heard Ross quite so confident. No. Some might say cocky. cocky. <laughs> <laughs> In there, I can see. Are you giving a little head, Bob Roscoe? <laughs> he says I am, yeah. Oh, right. Okay. I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued, Ross. And people trust you. Yeah. Do you trust Ross? If you trust him, he says, I, I want to see you there. This is made for Kiss Cross, this strand. Oh, that'd be beautiful. With yeah. like one of the Salon yeah. Pearl colours. And I'd use the smaller one for the Kiss. Oh. And then Sterling Silver 15 O's. Look how gorgeous be, they are. Yeah, they're perfect, aren't they? Perfect match. Good luck, everybody. First price crash. And not where we are closing. We had 55. There is a lot of love for our Roscoe. What do you reckon? Natural aquamarine. First crash. Generally, about five, five, six years ago, this strand would have been pushing oh, three figures, no. wouldn't it? So when Ross is saying, um, with his experience oh, as, a, a, as a producer, his birthstone, he said, if, when I first saw this strand, he thought 49.99. I agree. Totally agree. Imagine that in a marla. Amazing. With your elephant. Yeah. With a tassel. Ooh. Pills. Cotan Jade. Good luck, everybody, because we are not stopping there. We have got two strands of beautiful aquamarine to bring you. And just to show you the two together as well, if you want to go with the Kiss Cross, look how perfect that quality is. That's gorgeous. Oh. Yeah, it's beautiful. Some of the best aquamarine we've ever had, not just because of the quality, the colour, the clarity, the, uh, the, you know, the saturation, but also because of your amazing price point. In 41 seconds, we are going even lower. Good luck. I love the confidence. Half the stock has already gone. Our call screen's frozen, so that speaks volumes, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, dear. Okay. Yeah. Five, six years ago, this would have been probably... 79, I would have said, at a conservative price point. In 19 seconds, we are going even lower. Elaine, Dawn, Merseyside, Denise, Josie, Lavinia, Hello to London, Christine, Monica, Amanda, Carol, Linda, Maker, Karen, Agnes. So many of you there. There's a little bit of a queue on the phone lines building, but it's worth that time. It is. If you press your option one, uh, one's been allocated to you. I, I've got no idea what you're doing, Ross, because we're I already lower do. than I, I thought. I think I know. Do you? Yeah, I've got a feeling. Ni Sorry, I almost said 19. 14 99 for 40 carats of natural Santa Maria blue. Oh, that and a tassel would be gorgeous, Mark, amazing. wouldn't it? I'm thinking of that amazing D D Debbie Kershaw bracelet. Yeah. The tough. Yeah, that beautiful. Thing, that look, that look just you'd get a couple of those strands, you're on enough there to Absolutely do the whole bracelet beautiful. with the tassel. Oh, my goodness, that would be insane. Mm. So lovely. Yeah. yeah. And because you have got that continuity, that yeah, I can't. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think what that's called. <laughs> I, I'm trying to think what that's called. That technique that Debbie showed. It came from the uh, the it rose the that's rose right, quartz bracelets. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. That's right, yeah. Um, yeah. Forty. No, there's no point going. You know, feeling guilty now, Roscoe. He says I'm embarrassed. <laughs> Were you showing off? Were you showing off a little bit? He says, I was showing off at the start and now I regret it. $14.99, loads of multi-buyers. If you want to get hold yeah. of the, the smaller strand, maybe you'd use a, this for your weave and that for your tassel or vice yeah, versa. Absolutely. Um, absolutely. Amazing. It has sold out, but just so you know, 86 people oh, yeah. missed out on that strand. 
and still increasing. So that one's sold out, but don't worry, you are, look, you can see the blue from here. That's incredible. Oh, it's got the little blue, dark blue patch as well, look. Yes, oh, it's like it's mirror That's image. Cute. Oh, look at that. Again, totally and utterly natural. Oh, no. Got a bigger quantity, okay. 60 of, by five. Do you know what he's, I reckon I know what he's going to do with this one. I, I don't, because we were already too low on the previous one, weren't we? Mm. I don't know, Ross. That is beautiful. They're perfectly colour matched, you said. Yeah. They deserve to be worked together, don't they? A, a few little seed pearls would be nice. Mm. Oh, a koya, something yeah, like that. Yeah. Blue well, a koya maybe. pearls would be lovely. We have 60 available opportunities, lovely jewellery makers. Totally and utterly natural aquamarine. Perfect. For your tassels, for your weaves, for your wow. kiss cross. Where do we stop? For the technique Blue. you've just done. Yeah, that'd be amazing. Yeah. Hi, Amanda. My favourite gemstone oh. ever. This is a beautiful. I've got three, so many choices to make absolutely. with it. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Well, you just did that technique of the... Or the little belt. You the can belt. do that with a small one. You can do, yeah, you can do peyote with it. Yeah, That'd be absolutely. nice, wouldn't it? Do an aquamarine belt. Yeah. Are, you, are we all ready? Four mils sold out. Oh, We're bringing nice. you your three millimetres now. Look, Look at, at that, that blue. That is amazing. This is mirror graded, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I yeah, 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 yeah. So you could, it's like, yeah, oh yeah, you could just re restrand it. Pop a little 15 in between, gold or silver Very or nice. rose gold. It worked with everything. That's the joy it? of aquamarine. It complements yeah. all your precious metals, doesn't it? Um, this is the aquamarine oh, version yeah. of that yeah. zircon or that topaz, yeah. absolutely. Yes, that's a really good point. In fact, it would look lovely with mm. those strands, yeah. wouldn't it? with those beautiful strands. Good layer color faceted rounds. Oh, I like it. That's a new, t that's a new terminology yeah. for me. Layer color faceted rounds. You could just restrand it. First price crash. Oh, you yeah. sensed it. You called it. Wow. Uh, heat treated aquamarine, fair enough. Aquamarine, that, oh, Wayne told uh, oh, um, Roscoe that the only aquamarine he's been offered at the moment is full of oh, resin. Yeah. Um, and obviously he's not buying them. Right, so right. Uh, these, are, these two are some of the last natural aquamarine um, that we've got. And the price for resin filled aquamarine is, is as high. Um, so Ross was like, okay, so 49.99 is more than reasonable. No. First price crash, fourteen ninety nine, but going even lower. We had sixty of them available. There's no enhancement, not even heat treated, which really doesn't ever phase me in the world of gemstones. Wow. It's only replicating what the sun can do. It's just warming the gemstone to encourage some beautiful saturations through. This is madness. Love the idea of doing like a belt, be incredible, like you said, it? with your kiss cross. Yeah. Twelve pounds and ninety-nine pence only, so I can get both for less than thirty pounds. Crazy. That's right, isn't it? But both for less than thirty yeah. pounds. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. Well done, Sarah, Gloria, Deborah, Shirley, Sorry, Barry, Linda, Keith, Elaine, Barbara, Amanda, Josie, Shirley, new customer, Mary, Agnes, Tracy, Manchester. Super busy today. Um, how about in amongst your cotam? Perfect, wouldn't it? It'd be like heavenly, that combination, alongside your yeah, pure whites. Yeah. Maybe with some lovely pearls. That's a joy aquamarine. Do you know, when I was over in Tucson a couple of years ago, um, and I love aquamarine, I do, but it's not, I wouldn't say it's one of my all-time favourites up until recently. Mm. Um, and, I yeah, I, I, I remember one... So I, I saw Zavarites, I saw Alexandrites, I saw the finest diamonds, rubies, emeralds, all of those. And I remember walking past this one vendor, bearing in mind I've probably seen hundreds if not thousands at that time. And I turned and I was like, oh my goodness me, that's probably one of the most beautiful stones I've ever seen. And Jake was with me and it was a faceted aquamarine. It was actually like a very simple emerald cut. I was so tempted to buy it. And Jake looked at me and he was like, why are you going to spend all that money 
when it's something that I can get to, to yeah. better than wholesale price. And I was like, okay, but you know, it was the aquamarine and it was that beautiful that blue. Yeah. Mark, I have loved today. Thank, thank, you. thank you so much. Well, thank you for and looking after me today. I know it's been a tough Bless day you. for you Bless as you. well. You so. know, you've been very supportive and very kind. And, Bless uh, you. Yeah, but thank you. Lots of support and love for you. And Bless I think you've you. done amazing. You. Your kits and everything yes, is. Yes, amazing. And we're back Wednesday all over back again. Back Wednesday. What's happening new Wednesday? Launch. Might have a little new launch. In the mid, in the 12 o'clock hour. Yes. Very, very, very exciting launch. Yes. Mark's first ever cord launch. I'm off tomorrow, so I'll see you on Wednesday as well. Have a wonderful, hopefully sunny afternoon. And we'll see you soon. <laughs>